You love that low mm. cut top for going out at night, but I sure sometimes do. Oh. that much cleavage just isn't right. You've yep. tried safety pins, but they leave holes and just look wrong. And with a camisole, you end up it tying just and looks wrong. All day oh long. my god, well, it's now- such a pain in the ass. <coughs> yeah. Now there's Cami Secret, the new fashion accessory that looks just like a camisole. But watch closely, because here's the real secret. It's designed to attach quickly um, and easily. So easy. wait, I have a question. Why would anyone purchase this when it's just a little white cloth yeah. that you affix to the yeah. fabric? Guess what? You can change your shirt. It's not that difficult. <clears throat> Right to your bra straps. You can even adjust your cami secret up or down, so you can decide just how much cleavage you'll show. <laughs> awesome. Unlike regular tank tops that ride up and down, cami secret stays securely in place, so it's more comfortable to wear. Pins pull open and leave holes in your clothes, but cami secret attaches to your bra, so you can wear all your favorite tops without ruining them. Perfect for controlling necklines on delicate dresses. Sweet. Or adding a touch of color to any top. Even a plain <coughs> button-down shirt looks much better, and you can enjoy wearing all your wrap tops without being overexposed. Ma- I think all women should just walk around naked. <laughs> you misogynist. Well, you know, they're just objects anyway. Sex objects. With no feelings. I don't even know if... And if they have feelings, their feelings are too stupid to even is care about. I don't know if it tells us the, the price. See, I guess It's not. a piece of cloth. It's like the John Cena dish towel. <laughs> I know. They sh- you should just get one of those. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. For those of you who don't know what we're talking about... John Cena the, <laughs> is like the lamest fucking wrestler he's a, ever. He's a walking advertisement. And like he comes out and first of all he, he has a head that's shaped like a bucket. And I he like comes how, out. I like how now you guys are speaking honestly about John Cena finally. He comes out and he fucking he's always wearing like the most obnoxiously colored clothes. Like he's wearing a shirt that's either <laughs> like lime green or like baby blue or some fucking yeah, hideous yeah. color. <laughs> And he, has, he, has four and he tromps wristbands. out, like, yeah, with, like, four big fluffy but, wristbands well, he, of the same color, like, quarter, color coordinated with the shirt. He's like a walking merch stand, but first yeah. he comes out and rolls down a fucking dish towel. Yeah, and he's wearing his own shirts, and yeah, but he comes out and he holds up a dish towel that says something like, never give up, or some bullshit. Or hustle, loyalty, and respect. Yeah, something like some that. Some crap like that, and he holds it up, like, it's stupid, he's, it's a fucking stupid-ass little rag that he holds up in the, yeah! It's horrible. Yeah, and that's basically what this product is. And then he runs to the ring, throws his hat into the crowd, takes off his shirt, throws that into the crowd. Sometimes he takes his wristbands off and throws them into the crowd too. Yeah, walking merch stand. Actually, I have a video that I think we're gonna play on the private show tomorrow, and it's this guy that like loves Cena and he wants to defend him, and he gets like emotional. Like, Leave uh, Cena alone! Uh, yeah, yeah, like that much. And he's a grown man. Wow. And we're going to play awesome. that on the private show that yes. only our patrons can see? <laughs> yes. Sucks to be everyone else, huh? Yep. Truly. I'm excited to tell you about a breakthrough in personal cleaning. Our name, Ah, says it all. You'll feel fresher and cleaner after you go to the bathroom uh, using Ah. Simply spray uh, Ah toilet paper ah. foam moistener on your dry toilet tissue. It's a smart alternative to dry tissue and wet wipes. Okay. So, cr- you know, put some cream on top of your fucking toilet paper. Basically, a, just another totally unnecessary product. But, you know, I mean, there's always some sucker It's like... Yeah, those wet wipes are too expensive. I'll use this and save money. The foam moistens your tissue, and with its aloe-based formula, makes you as clean. I like how the shit. Do is they have like a graphic? Purple. <laughs> Without foam. Ah. As you can be, and soothes minor irritation. It's fragrance-free, rinse-free, and you control the wetness. Your ordinary dry toilet. You paper control the wetness. Extraordinary. God damn it! Without this toilet paper is too dry. Clean. This toilet paper is too and, dry, and but these wet wipes also, are too wet. It doesn't properly clean you, TJ. I need a proper bye level bye of dry. wetness. Bye bye dry. With ah, it should Peter be Fra- die dry. Ah, die. just wipe my ass. Ah, fuck sure you, dry. You'll want one in each of your bathrooms for sure. I really love the product. I have ah uh, in each one of my restrooms. I really love my favorite part product. about it is how it feels against my butthole. Wetting dry toilet paper disintegrates the paper. Yeah. Sometimes the wet wipes remaining in the container dry out, 
because the container was not properly closed. Awful. Well, that's your fault. <laughs> oh, you know what? Someone found the ripoff podcast on Daily Motion. Oh, let's take a really? look. You want to? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. This isn't riveting. Get episode seven though. Did they have episode seven on I, there? Uh, that, they, it was more like ours by then. Yeah, yeah. They like really. They ripped off more by the time it got to episode seven. So let's see. Do they have it? Or I don't. Or do you not know how to do it from here? Let's see. I I know. Yeah. Let's see. They they their even their song was look look they're talking about G Man. <laughs> yep. And Venom Fang X. <laughs> what the fuck, man? That's three. Whatever the most recent. Mr. Repsion crying, talking shit about Mr. Repsion. <laughs> Episode one. Put it on. Ah, uh, I. It doesn't. Let's see. Hold on. Looks like they only have a few. They don't. Th this one's similar to ours, though. Yeah, go ahead and put it up. Let's let's let people see this. Okay. Fuck. I can't believe we're gonna do this. The Jesuit Drunken Peasant Clone Podcast. Yeah, you guys can see it. Random discussions of the inebriated variety. Uh, Earther creationist videos. Oh, okay. Hold on. Ah, uh, it sucks because they, they had an intro and it was hilarious. It was like a generic version. It was of, a super generic version of our intro. Yeah, it, 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 there was even a commercial, but it was for Patreon, but it even was like shot similar. The guy was like, hey. Discussions podcast. And this is a bit of a disclaimer before the show. Uh, uh, before the sto show starts in earnest, we have two announcements to make. You might notice on Oh, shit. Of a send questions thing where our, you our Patreon ad was. Oh. Uh, that's because instead of having you send videos <laughs> to our Facebook, what we're going to have to <coughs> you do to send your questions from now on is send them in text don't send us a contact request but send it in text to our skype and if we like your question we'll call you at the end of the show and you can ask us your question you see this shit i um but the random discussion original podcast. originally it was called the random discussions but they changed their name uh, to be like even more like our name it's the um Random discussions of the inebriated and variety, right? Yes. Yeah, it's like, wow. When, and, when they had their YouTube channel, most of their videos had like six views. <laughs> That's why I'm kind of incredulous that even there was even backlash against them because no one. Yeah, had even yeah, seen yeah. It. That's fine. I just thought they were funny. Like, yeah, it was pretty crazy when I like went and saw someone just like clone our podcast. Yeah, it was nifty. Yeah, the the intro even had like the like bounce. We're gonna freaking nuke them. Yeah, it's gonna be like we're gonna call up the Chinese, we're gonna call up the Russians, we're gonna call anyone. Nuke. Gotta take, gotta take care of these guys. Won't dry out. Always wet and ready to clean. <laughs> it's magical. All right. Wipes can clog pipes. The rainbow sponge. <coughs> Sweet. You Finally. Ask for it. I did? Uh, I don't remember that. Devoted to the Rainbow Sponge. Finally. The Army Arts and Crafts Department sent me to Korea. Now, not a what? normal sponge. This the is Army so Arts and dense. Crafts Department? Three sizes because Does I Does the can't Army have an Arts and Crafts Probably. Department? Probably. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, okay. I mean, the Maybe. Rainbow Sponge. The Army's got a lot of stuff, so. The Rainbow be. Sponge. <laughs> Just one size. Another thing that I want to talk about is the hygiene of the sponge. I squeezed and squeezed and squeezed and squeezed. And no squeezed? No flab on this arm for my cleaning. Flab on this arm. Now, if you do get it on your hands, gloves are incredible. I have a pure, oh, I love a sponge that is absolutely oh, pure. I love Oops, sponges. A virgin itch. Oh, my gosh. What is the... Ah! Oh, wow. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, it's amazing. Oh! I want you to look at all of those wiggles. <laughs> I want you to look, look at, at all of those wiggles. Obey the wiggle. I guess look at the way them. I guess this isn't a commercial. I guess this is uh she's 
Who paid the widow? Teaching people how to paint or oh, yeah, yeah, with the selling sponge. sponge. I don't know. I thought it. I thought thing? it was a product called hey, the Rainbow GJ. Sponge. Apparently anyway, not. Yeah, yeah. We'll we'll move on. Obey the wiggle. Is your ordinary hairstyle <laughs> just not cutting it anymore? Yeah, damn Are you right. looking for something that will dazzle Ugh. your friends? Wow. Introducing hot stamps. If, if your, your hair don't, don't look good, you're just what? garbage. Yeah. This is this is such a horrible idea. Put glitter in your fucking hair. That demands attention. Hot stamps are uh, stylish, hip, fun, and fashionable. No, way they to look turn worse. Boring plain hair into the <laughs> they actually look worse. Thing. Look like shit. <coughs> no. It does look like shit. Ah, uh, whatever. I, I respected know. those girls, but then I saw that and I was like, "You're you disgust me." Stamp it. It's just like you're the garbage. Into the incredible, with ah, amazing glitter. Makes me want to fucking what a waste of money. The every day into the hottest thing with so I should many get some of these colors. though. Stamp I'm gonna get some of these. Ben's gonna wear them too. Sure, why not? Me and Ben, we're gonna we're gonna get some hot stamps and we're gonna get some WWE themes. Dude, oh my god! Put them on your face. Put it on TV. there for yeah. the show. Cena for life. Yeah. Hot stamps is put perfect a C for every here, occasion. E here, N here, for any occasion. A here. Going out to do some cocaine? You need your hot stamp for any occasion, even funerals. They have little skull and bone ones. Oh, if you're in a secret society. Yeah. Well, or a funeral. I was going funeral, but secret society works too. I don't I don't think there was a price in that nah, one. No price. Check out this one. This one's pretty cool. What happens? Convicted for tasteless advertising, Joe Greed of Westway Ford languishes in shame. Huh? Bingo Warrior! Sent by my Legion of Warriors to set Joe Greed free. Let's boogie! No, come on. How can I ever repay you? With the new car. Like this new 87 Yugo <laughs> for only 87. With the new car. 87 down. Yeah. Look at that fucking car, man. That's hideous. Look how boxy it is. <laughs> yeah. Dollars down, it's yours for just $87 a month. You could fucking recreate that car accurately on an N64. It's weird that Ultimate that Warrior was doing commercials even back then. I know, it looks like they're about to like hug and kiss. Yeah. What a pal. Well, Should well, make out. Well, 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 West way forward. West way forward. West way forward. West way forward. It dropped. It rolled. Oh it man! Oh, I can't get it. Just can't buy. reach it. Well, now you can magnascribe. Magnascribe. Magnus magnetic magnetic technology keeps your pen where you need it all the time. Uh, magnetic. The magnascribe pen magnetically attached. Oh, to that's a handy pen that's how it. magnets work. I They're magic. Only at the cost of your dignity can you wear this amazing pendant. Clock that keeps you on schedule and the pen you need right at your fingertips. Oh, she looks and so clueless. She's like, oh, oh shit. my god, oh, here's the time, and oh, here's the place to put my pen. The beginning of the commercial showed someone dropping a pen, though. Like, how how does having that yeah, I don't know. keep you from dropping the pen in the course of, like, your daily events? You could still drop it. It's not like the magnetism is so powerful that if you drop it, it's just going to suck it back up, you know? Debra in one easy motion, your pen pulls off, ready to write, right away, magnetically. No right clicks, away. No, twists, no caps. Look, the Magnuscribe uses patented magnetic engineering physics to engage the ballpoint <laughs> roller as magnetic as you engineering oh, physics. Break. It's just two magnets. Pen pending NASA technology makes your pen writing experience <laughs> more intense. It's it's magnets. Magnets. How, how do, do they work? Fucking. Yeah. Ma well, apparently, I don't want to talk ICP to a is not alone. No, I know. Confused. That's what I was it. saying. It's magic. It's all Miracles. magic. Miracles. It's a miracle. The carnival is God. We've always uh, been behind him. Uh, wow! Watch that again. It's a quick draw. Dynamo. Wow! And when you're done, just reattach the magnuscribe and your ballpoint roller <laughs> hides. <laughs> those kids would be bullied. Those they no think uh, those kids would be so bullied at school. My pen is attached to this pendant. What the hell's wrong with you? Fuck. That's guaranteed. The superior quality Magnus Drive features a unique feather-like cushion Someone would steal rolling the lunch money. that can help reduce cushion glad rolling system. Cushion glad rolling system. So you can write the right way, right away. Foil finger day. fatigue. Say goodbye to runaway pens. Missing cap. Come back, runaway pen. Misses. Say hello to Magnus Drive. <coughs> it's super simple, super convenient, and super fun all rolled into one. Call now to order your set of two Magnus Drive pens for the incredibly low price of just twenty nine ninety five. What? What? Oh man, twenty nine ninety five for a pen. For two pens. Click onto a fucking pendant two with pens. a watch in it. 
Are you like flavor fleet? You're like the digital flavor flav yeah. with that fucking thing on. <laughs> but you're ready to take someone's orders. So. Yeah. Act right now and you'll also receive two free ink refills. But hurry, because if you're one of the first 100 callers to order the amazing flavor new Magnuscribe, flav. you'll get another Magnuscribe with two more ink refills and this bonus pocket memo book absolutely free. That's right, you get it all. Sweet. Three super Magnuscribe pens, four full-size refills, and a pocket memo book for one low price. Don't. That is awesome. So, no, so you get three of them. Only if you're one. Only if you're the first hundred people. Everyone then. gets three. Only if you're in the first hundred. Yeah, give me a break. Oh, only if you're lucky. You got to be one of the fortunate chosen ones. All right, here's the next one. It's impossible to close an open can with a pop top. Open cans spill in the fridge. What a mess! And open cans lose their fizz. What a waste. Yeah. Introducing Bottle Top, the ingenious new way that turns your can into a bottle with the snap of a cap. Watch. Bottle Top attaches to almost any can, soda, beer, iced tea, or energy drink. It snaps in place instantly to seal the top closed. It fits virtually every brand of can, from mini cans to super Virtually size. every brand of can. Yeah. <coughs> Not every this is brand. Like a total virtually every brand. Okay, these two guys are, are going to go drink some fucking beers and... And presumably they're not going to finish them, so they need this top. Yeah, right. Or, or it's like, oh, we're not going to spill the beer. It's like, who regularly fucking spills their beer? Are these guys like fucking both like Parkinson's patients? Where they're like, <laughs> you know, what's going on here that they need this product? When you're done, just snap off the top so it's reusable for dozens of drinks. Look, open metal cans can't travel. What a waste. Bottle Top turns your can into a bottle that's perfectly portable. Look, you know what you, you could do? do you could just buy a water can. bottle Amazing. and put whatever beverage you want in it. I mean, pretty much every beverage that's available in a can is also available in a bottle. So if you really want the whole bottle thing, you should just buy bottles instead of cans. <laughs> yeah, it's or have a reusable bottle. your can of energy drink on a bike ride. Look, leftover sodas go flat. But Bottle Top turns that can of soda into a screw top bottle and keeps its carbonation for days. Holy Outdoors, shit! Bugs can crawl into your drink. <laughs> Gross. Gross! But Bottle Top is great for you know, all these people drink RC Cola and Sam's Cola. RC Cola. They don't drink Coke or Pepsi, they drink like RC Cola. Yeah. I wonder why that is. Arse flavored cola. Arse flavored cola. Arse. Arse. Or barbecues. It protects your drink from insects. When you're done drinking, just pop it off. Rinse I have never bottle. had insects in my drink. Maybe you had, TJ. You said no. Well, never that I know. Gross. Gross. Ah. Bugs can crawl in your drink. It's like, well, I guess they could. If Whoa. You just leave it out in the fucking, fucking sun bugs. for like fucking two days or something. Next one. Yeah, uh, right, glow TJ. jammas. <laughs> Or, oh, do you want to see how much this costs before we move on? Okay, sure. The, uh, price nine ninety nine. Uh oh, hold on. Two twenty two. No, uh, I think you get six, six for ten dollars. Ah, there you go. I was right. Ten bucks. You said nine ninety nine. I said ten. No, you didn't. Yeah, I did. Fuck you, TJ. You end up getting twelve of them for ten dollars. Yeah. What a deal! What a deal! Glow jammas. Glow jammas. Ah. So, if you buy a white shirt, then you draw on it. Yeah, with a light. Go, 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 jammas. Ow. Yeah, I don't want to hear any more of it. Uh, 1995. <laughs> Who the fuck would want that? It's like I'm trying to go to it's sleep. You're wrong. fucking. You're fucking glowing, like, ah, it's not really helping me go to sleep. Plus, it's radioactive. Dude. All of these kids are dead. Oh, there's, like, radium in it. <laughs> um, well, I don't, probably not really. Yeah, it does. Um, dude, uh, when I broke my arm one time, I, I actually, like, they offer you, like, do you want to glow in the dark cast when you're a kid? And you're like, yeah, I want that. Man, you fucking regret that shit. I'm trying to go to sleep, your fucking cast is, like, glowing in the dark. You can <laughs> see it, and you're just like, oh, I'm trying to go to sleep, and this fucking thing's just glowing. Yeah. Uh-oh. Trouble telling time. Doesn't that really tick you off? Yeah. Introducing Wonder so Watch, difficult. the amazing new watch with it's the so extra difficult large to tell the time. that makes telling time at a glance fast and easy. <laughs> yeah, anyone that's with you will be able to tell the time, too. <laughs> 
They should just, why don't you just fucking strap a, a, a wall clock to your wrist, you know? I would say most people use their cell phone to check Shit. the time. We're talking about Flavor Flav. Look, there you go. Yeah. Yeah, he, yeah. He just, like, has a fucking full like, <clears throat> clock on his wrist. He's like, oh, let's see. It's, uh, 1230. Hands make those links hard to fasten. <clears throat> Wonderwatch has an adjustable Okay, this is for old people. Easy yeah. to fasten it, it's so clear now. No yeah, but the woman, links, or, uh, no I don't know, the woman in the commercial the earlier didn't seem like elderly. I think oh, that's to make old people feel less self-conscious yeah, for see. needing it. Light up face, so it's easy to Even see. Even young nice. people use this, this product. E technology. Triple easy E's fasten, technology. Easy Triple E's. With one, two, three easy ways to tell time faster. Compare wow. watch to an ordinary watch. Which watch can you read? Now yeah. trade in the dark. Time and time again, Wonder Watch beats the competition. Holy shit, I'm convinced. Anytime, day or night. Also, like, who's okay. really concerned about the time like this? Like, old people are like, what time is it? I need to know the time. Uh, and also, would, what's the You what's wouldn't the, believe it. You what's wouldn't. the weather, too? Ah! Oh. Uh, how much is it? Let's see. Fourteen ninety-five Plus shipping and handling. You get two of them. And if you're like, no, we'll double that So over. you have a watch for each hand. Just pay additional mm -hmm. shipping and handling. That's so cool. Tell time on both arms at once. All right, so we got one more. One more. Gentle gel socks. Finally. I love these. I own a pair. Do the balls of your feet ache at oh, the end yeah. of your All the time. Bunions, my balls are always yeah, my bunions aching. Are acting my, acting bunions. Acting my bunions. My bunions. And cramped toes causing you pain? Oh, well, now yeah. you can soothe your feet all day long. Oh, finally. Introducing Gentle Gel Socks. The ah. cozy toe topper that's lined with gel on the inside. To relieve yeah. the comfort mm. aching feet. So you can walk all day without pain. Fuck, like yeah. Yeah. Gentle gel socks feel so soothing over feet and wear comfortably in shoes. They're like you therapy for okay, my feet. This is basically for women who like wear those really uncomfortable shoes that they think look good. And then it's like, well, my feet hurt. It's like, well, put this on. It'll make the pain go away. It's not, it's not the unnatural angle you're walking at. Society <laughs> pressures them, Scotty. Yeah. Right, they're only objects. Society places them. From common foot problems, they have no the choice. The top and balls of your feet. The secrets: the breakthrough comfort gel lining, which surrounds the ball of your foot and toes like a glove, absorbing shock, preventing pain. Like absorbing pain. shock. How much shock could that really absorb? Come on, loads. Just look at it. They're like toe condoms, basically. Mm, yeah, my little toes. Get two pairs for. Nine ninety five. Double that offer for ten dollars. Uh, yeah. That was pretty close. Ten dollars. They're not ordinary hats. Yes. Flippies. Flip, flip, flip. That is what I need. My life is not complete. Stumpies comes flippies. Yeah. A new animated cat. <laughs> oh, I thought it was an owl. Woo! Flippies, come on and run, flippies. Life's a fucking blast when you got flippies, bitch. Ha <laughs> ha, flippies. They'll make you laugh. Flippies! Man, flippies, man. I wouldn't have been caught dead in one of these things when I was a kid. Bullshit, Ben. Bullshit, Ben. You, that, you love flippies. <laughs> Everything the better. Parents getting a divorce, give them a flippies, they'll don't, they won't worry about it anymore. That's how it works. <laughs> Do my mommy and daddy still love each other? Well, have a flippies, yeah! <laughs> the ears go up when you squeeze it! I asked a question about my- The ears go up when you fucking squeeze Play it, bitch! Flippy. You love flippy, go play! <laughs> They'll make you smile. Flippies are the fun way to stay warm and comfy. There's Huggy the monkey. Oh Cheer no, yourself. Rascal Rabbit, Scotty. Monster. Scotty, I want, I want the flippies, dude. You want all? It's of only them? for kids, dude. It wouldn't fit your head. It would fit my dude, head. Dude, your head is massive. It would no fit. Way. It would There's fit. No way. I'll make it fit. <laughs> it will oh, No way. It's, you'll tear it. It's stretchy looking material. I bet it'll work. <laughs> it would be so tight on your head. It'd be like, like. <coughs> Nylon on your head, like like pantyhose on your head. Well, I'll I'll have to get a head you reduction because I can't I can't a abide I can't abide by not having flippies in my life, man. Why are there no adult flippies? Come on, guys. Why would you show me a Flippy. product that can solve all my problems and then say I can't have it? Twitchy kitty, kitty hypo puppy, and so many more. Wanna... Everyone loves. You let dog can have a flippy, TJ. Yeah. <laughs> A dog can have a flippy, but you can't. Yeah, not TJ. That's That's bullshit. Ah, fuck you, TJ. It's bullshit. These are loaded with personality. You'll smile from ear to ear as these crazy creatures flip, flap, They're and loaded flop. with personality. This is like, and everyone in this town owns one. Every kid's like, I own flippies. They're just, you have to have them.
all those kids got beaten up when they got to school. I know, it's like, I mean, I, I just, I feel like you might as well just give these kids, like, here's a certificate for one free ass beating from your classmates. <laughs> oh, cool, I'm gonna take this to school. Hey, guys, go up to the biggest, toughest bully. Look what I got, this is a certificate it's that says, crazy. I get a complimentary free beating. Oh, okay, well, we'll try to pencil you in for four. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Love flippies. Yeah. Ordinary animal caps aren't very fun, but no way. Flippies kicks their ass. Grandchild can use a warm cap. Why not have a fun cap? Flippies Fuck come yeah. With a fleece inner lining. Then warm the fleeces. Flippies up <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> does the bunny one look stoned to anyone else? It does. Y it yeah. Slowly it's fucking out of it. It's yeah. little black lines. It's like. Glazed over. So like... <laughs> yeah, the bunny is just like, holy shit, am I, I a hat or am I a bunny? Yeah. It's actually to be red and bloodshot too, though. Uh, is that like is it a real? Is it a real bunny that's just been skinned and glued onto it? Yes, <laughs> it is. It's a. R oh man, the the fucking Easter bunnies at the uh, at the department stores are scary as shit looking. You ever seen those fucking things? Oh, it, it just reminded me of it, like a big pink bunny head. You're easily frightened, Ben. No, no, no. <laughs> they, they are fucking. In, there's, there's actually websites out there with scary looking. Maybe that should be a, the next horror movie. If someone out there is looking to make a low budget yeah. horror movie, make yeah, a movie. Bunny yeah, I would say actually make it to where everyone wearing an Easter bunny outfit becomes like a flesh eating zombie, and they just go around and kill people in their bunny outfits as zombies. Sounds like a solid plot to me. You know what? It could be that the manufacturer of the bunny costumes is a mad scientist and he's put some kind of like mind control device in it that, you know, builds up an army of evil bunnies to, to slaughter the living. <clears throat> yeah, we've got to put together a treatment and pitch this, you know. I would say do it. Yeah. All right, next one. Michael Bay might do it. <laughs> Easy, poor, no drip spout. And, Seven, and we have a eight, countdown. Eight, eight. Oh my god. Five, four. What's gonna happen? Three, two, one. Does it make your blood uh, boil? The yes. greasy mess from pouring hot oil. Oh god, it Lots does. Lots of fatter that burn and bake, ruin your ah. pan, and a disaster make. Oh, the what is it, Dr. Seuss write this? Was, was that a poem? It was like, the and a disaster pour. make. I hate when you have to like reverse the natural order of words to make a rhyme happen. Gee, do they need to promote the easy pour? Uh, I think more importantly, like, who the fuck are these people pouring? Are they just like, do they have like fucking, they, do they, like, you know, the, have they been drinking? They're like, you're shaking everywhere. No one fucking pours like that. They're just like emptying everything across the things. They just like, they might as well just take the entire pan and just like flip it over in one solid motion. Like, ball, <laughs> splat, it's all, oh, can't do it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my eyes, fuck. Oh. Yeah, they should get injured more often. Like, they should like, even get killed and sometimes. Like, if they only had our proc, they'd still be alive. They should just take the pan and just dump the oil right into his fucking face. Like, <laughs> oh, it's all, oh, and his fucking f melts if off. If only he had the easy if pour. The easy pour. It makes no prevent spout. stuff like easy this from happening. A removable spout that easily removable and to easy to attach. Bolts, so you can even drain hot bacon grease cleanly and attach it to your mixing uh, bowl finally. for perfect muffins and cupcakes. Beloved. So Everyone who don't, don't like cupcakes, they'll love them even. Cupcakes will be so transcend. I don't eat oh, cupcakes. It's an easy point. It's. Cool. I had a massive orgasm, so I was awarded a U.S. patent. <laughs> awarded a U.S. patent. Amazing. Holy shit. That that. I never give incredible. those out except for those other fucking seven million times. <laughs> States patent. A snap to attach. Flip it on the rim and push down to secure. No more ladling pasta sauce across <sighs> your stove. Oh my now god! Just pour it from the pot to the pasta. Same with gravy. From the pan to the gravy boat without a mess. Save your soup. With easy pour, you won't lose a drop. <laughs> Pouring grease down your sink and clog your drain. And <laughs> Use easy pour. Hold on. Like, why? Why are? Why is everyone in these commercials like incompetent on a supernatural level? Like, they can't. 
It's not like they're selling a better plunger, so why can't they at least plunge the sink competently, you know? Yeah, they're hitting the sink with the they're plunger. They're just, like, no, basically, basically like, slamming the plunger into random spots of the sink. Duh, why no work, duh. Like, if, if people are this stupid, can they even really dial a phone number and, and try to pay for a product? I don't even see how it's possible. To safely dispose of grease from chopped meat, hamburger patties, and sizzling hot bacon. Provides a precision pour so you can drizzle melted chocolate like a pro. Use it to pour dry goods like sugar and hey, coffee. A drizzling no pro. Has hundreds of uses, and it's only ten dollars. Only ten. Hey Scotty. Uh, food safe material while we're on that subject, man, who's your favorite pro drizzler? <laughs> pro drizzler? Yeah, pro drizzler, man. He just said you could drizzle chocolate like a pro, Ben. Like a, uh, yeah, Who's yeah. your favorite pro drizzler, oh, Ben? Let me, let me check my collection of pro drizzler trading There's cards. There's too many, TJ. There's, There's just, too many to uh, know. I'll trade you uh, uh, a Bob Smith for... <laughs> Bob Smith, huh, Ben? Yeah. <laughs> That's what you got, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I'll, I'll trade you a fucking Dick and Jane. Dick and Jane? Yes. I like Bob Smith better. I don't, I don't know. I think mine was probably better than No, yours. no, because Dick and Jane was a fucking famous book about two bland-ass characters. Okay, fine. So you have one it's, Dick and one Jane? Uh, one Dick and one Jane. Or it could be one person, Dick Jane. And you want to trade Dick and Jane for Bob Smith? Bob yes. Smith. The, the, the I, greatest, would not, I would not say... The greatest professional drizzler of all time. I would not say Bob Smith is the uh, greatest oh, professional oh, well, drizzler. Well, fuck you, TJ. That's subjective. You know what, TJ? It was all because you did not have the easy pour. And TJ, let me tell you something. You can get it for only $10 right now. Order it now, TJ. Right this minute. I actually think that... Uh, Order it, TJ. I think Yusef Bin Laden is probably the best <laughs> pro drizzler. <laughs> Yusef <laughs> Bin Laden. It's, well, it's unfortunate that he has that family connection. We don't need to talk about that, but... Oh, I see. I see. You know, his 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 fucking family aside, you know, we can't hold him responsible for what, you know, others do. But yeah. when it comes to drizzling, he was a master. You know, <laughs> it, you, you know, you get one of those like other people bring you out like a fucking cheesecake or something and it's drizzled with some like strawberry sauce and you just look at it and it's lackluster and you almost feel like killing yourself. But, you know, when Yusef Bin Laden brings out one of his fucking cheesecakes, the way he drizzles it, <laughs> it's fucking sheer artistry, and you look at that shit, and you know that maybe you can't define the meaning of the universe, but there is a meaning in the universe. Because how else could something so beautiful fucking exist in this horrible, otherwise bleak world? But did he use an easy pour? Yes. Bob Smith all the way. You fuck, still go Bob Smith. Fuck Yusuf. Fuck Yusuf. Fuck you, you well, ben, Yusef. Ben is a racist, so we can't hold it against. Yeah, Ben just uh, doesn't like him because he's Arab. That's what's going on here. Why would I assume he's Arab with a with a name like y Yusuf Bin Laden? I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? Dishwasher safe. Pour a day's worth of mixed baby formula in just minutes. Drain excess juice from fruit salad. Are you pouring pitiful? Oh my God! No one is that no. fucking stupid. <laughs> It was like, ah, just throw it on the pan. It's going to be fine, kids. You think pancakes? It's a fucking pancake. They, they, were they giving them like a cookie cutter for a pancake, basically? I don't know. It makes using down. pancake molds simple and easy. Attaches to oh, the it's happy. Electric mixer, so it likes that you're going to eat it alive. Like for pudding you can be proud of. The ingenious easy pour no drip Hundreds of uses. $10. But wait, call now and we'll double the value. Okay, You'll hundreds get... of uses. Yeah, what does it do besides pour things? What are its other uses? It pours uses? a lot of things. It's a, it's yeah, a exactly. hat? It's not a new activity just because it's pouring a different thing. Shut up. <laughs> If you call now and get two of them, you could do one with each hand at the same time. Be a pro like you said, and do it with each hand at the same time. That's what you have now, to do. You're just showing off now. <laughs> yeah, you get. What would you even need two for? It doesn't even make sense. For you all the to become a pro do. drizzler. That's what you have. You need two. Yeah, you got to make sure your left hand is just as fucking apt because you know your right hand might be destroyed in a car accident or something. You don't want to miss a step. It's basically like Def Leppard shit. You're to lose an arm. Yeah. yeah. You know, got, you don't want to have to go through that compensation period. You just want to be able to pick it right back up. Yep. I can drizzle just as well with my left hand. Oh, I'm not Shyamalan S twist. I think this is so good. You can probably pull with your teeth or your your butt cheeks if you really if you lost both arms. Just in case, it's worth training up every part of the body. Yeah. Even <laughs> if I'm nothing. 
Even if I'm nothing but a brain and some eyes, I have figured out how to, you know, manipulate my eyeballs to drizzle expertly. Get a second Easy Pour Spout free. Just pay separate processing and handling. Call now and get two Easy Pour No Drip Spouts for only $10. Not sold in stores because they fucking suck. But it's got a patent. Yeah. That, that means it's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, they, they even gave us the number for it just to prove it to us. Yeah, it's real. Yeah. <laughs> this does exist, you folks. You can look it up. Here's the number. Is it, is it is it a page for putting like is it like just put, like putting useless fucking spouts on the side of things that don't have spouts or like I, mean, I wonder what it's actually for is it like the motion of you know there's always these ridiculous fucking things with patents people file some of the like the most if you watch things like Shark Tank or in the UK Dragon's Den or whatever yeah. the crazy fucking shit that some people patent and you're like why did you spend tens of thousands on a patent lawyer to patent like I don't know like having goggly eyes on a penis or something you know what I mean? uh, <laughs> invented. Penis. I invented the dick shoe. It's like a shoe, but it goes on your dick. And I have a patent for that. And, you know, we're working on getting a patent on that, and after that, we're going to be selling that on TV. Because, you know, what if you lose both your legs, got to walk on your dick or something? <laughs> then you're going to need dick shoes, man. You can't be walking around with your dick just bare out there, and you don't want to just wear a sock because you might step on a nail or something. Need dick shoes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, next one is the. I guess you'd only need one dick shoe. Yeah, yeah, you wouldn't need a pair. What about your balls? Unless DJ? you want to like. Glue Unless you want to do like that weird shit where Mr. you like Potato Head style, like. Yeah, like as they're like a single. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know what you're saying, Ben. That would be so amusing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so pineapple twist, whatever the fuck this is. Let's... Do you love fresh pineapple? But yes. hate all the mess. And yes. who wants Fuck it. Can't? Oh, who wants oh. that shit? Oh, from the islands. Anthony Sullivan here for the pineapple oh, twist. From green the fastest and easiest way to core, peel, and slice a pineapple. Here's the twist. Just push in the blade and give it a twist and a turn. Ooh. Then simply pull oh, wow. the handle and slide off the stack. Then with one simple cut, you've got perfect slices every time. Use the pineapple. Every fucking time. And you could throw it back in the sea and a little fucking sponge can live in it for fucking 20 annoying ass years. It must be a successful product. I mean, they flew him out to the Bahamas. I mean, it must be doing right. well, you know, for them yeah. to do that. Because, yeah, he's uh, he's clearly actually at, you know, a tropical island. Look there. how he's in Hawaii. He is, though. Look. There's no way that's a, just a green screen or anything. Look you know? at the simplicity, though. How can you... How can you mock? In in all fairness, at least in the case of this product, it really is a legitimate pain in the ass to fucking cut up a pineapple. So I can at least give it that. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> so I'm actually allergic to pineapples. Do you think they? Do you think it, using this product might fix that? I think it, it, it probably is that. Of good. course yeah, it would. Well, of obviously, course. the pineapple twist. Yes, of course. You know, you have an allergy to pineapple. As soon as that's because it's been cut. With the wrong knives. If you get the oh, pineapple twist, we actually all learned this in medical school last week. While yeah. we were, while, while wow. we were teaching medical school, we we remembered. Uh, you well, were most successful learned. podcast and your old doctors. That's incredible. Yes. Right. Yeah. In order, and you know, we actually there's a law on the books in America that says that if you advertise something on TV, the product has to be infallible to the point that it negates problems that you would even normally have with such products. Like if you can't drive, if you buy a car that you see on a TV commercial, you'll be an expert driver when you get behind the wheel, just because it's new and it was advertised on TV. That's how it works. Fantastic. Yeah. I need to move there immediately. I love pineapple twists. <laughs> Make fresh salsa <laughs> Hawaiian style or add some flair to a mouth-watering baked ham. Let pineapple twist be the hit at your next barbecue and carry more the pineapple twist, please. The secrets the specially designed self-guiding coring. Uh, that was like a pub skull for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just drill that bitch in there. Yeah, motherfucker. You could also kill people with the pineapple twist. Jeffrey Dahmer had a pineapple twist. Yeah, I guess he did, dude. <laughs> Well-known fact. Probably, probably does. He's like, yeah, I'm going to core out your brain, and then you're going to become my sex zombie. Uh, I don't think that's going to... Ah! It'll work. It's fine. It's a it hole to eject acid into as well. Mmm, yeah. 
perfectly peeled. What a twist! And spiral slices, pineapples with ease. Ooh, Use the pineapple yeah. twist to create fresh fruit salads. Add a tropical twist to grill yeah, chicken. Yeah, all these ah. things are going to do with pineapple suddenly. It's like pineapple could anywhere, when, anytime. When you get the pineapple twist, pineapple basically becomes the center of your existence. Yes. All things now are centered around pineapples. I fucking hate pineapples. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, if if so, so do you get really sick when you eat uh, them? I get, I get, I'm actually allergic to like citrus, um, and sort of like I guess like the acids in fruit. I'm never really sure specifically what it is, but when I eat fruit in general, most of the time, my mouth like swells up and it gets really oh. sore. So yeah. So probably the same with oranges and and that sort. Yeah, of Yeah, I mean, shit. some things, like, things like bananas are okay and stuff like that. Woo! Uh, <laughs> but in, you know, most uh, fruit, yeah, is a no no. Yeah. Ben, give me that to suck on. What? what? Hey, give TJ, me that to TJ. suck on, Ben. Hey, TJ, you know you're related to a banana, right? Yeah, I am. <laughs> That's why I had that incestuous relationship. Some, someone, someone made a video about that, saying like you got wrecked. You got wrecked, bitch. Yeah. It wasn't even intentional on his part, though. I know, but it's so funny. <laughs> it was. Troll's funny. gonna troll, TJ. I felt more embarrassed at the part where I fucking was like. Oh, I think JF is joining us from another time zone, so thank him for doing that. He's like, I'm in North Carolina. Yep. Oh. It's like, oh. And then you said he was French, but he's actually Canadian. Well, I mean, he is French, but he's French-Canadian. That's bullshit. There should only be one kind of French. Mm -hmm. And that's French fries. Sorry. <laughs> There's like, you know, like when, when we get to Belgium, there'll be like, French people in Belgium too. They're like French speaking Belgians. Kicking those motherfuckers in the nuts. There's not a lot to do in Belgium though. It's sort of like a country people drive through on the way to other places. Yeah, exactly. Pretty much. I'm gonna live in Belgium. Where, where are you planning to go on your if, if I had to ask on your European trip, what countries? Uh so do you wanna say it, Scotty? What? She asked uh where where we're going. I had a message from Monica. Well, you guys. No one cares about your personal business, Scotty. <laughs> you guys fucking uh, said last time we weren't supposed to say anything. Well, so. well, well. Now, now we can say it. Now it's okay. Now we arbitrarily well, can not, say it. We're, it's we're, arbitrarily we're not saying fine specific. Now. We're just saying where we're going. That's. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, well, well, the well, names well, of your hotels, the address of everywhere you're staying. Yeah. Oh, exactly. okay. Well, that, on, well, that's put obvious. Put it on Tumblr. Go here to meet TJ and call him a, a misogynist. That's yeah. It's gonna be beautiful. Okay. Well, Bananas. we're going to. Uh, we're starting in London, then we're going to uh, Brussels. Yeah, very briefly, uh, Brussels, then Amsterdam, uh, then Paris, and then we're going to Nice, and then Rome, and then we're leaving. That's really cool. There's some really beautiful cities on that list, and Amsterdam's a lot of fun. A lot. Of yeah, fun. yeah, Amsterdam. I I went there once. The more I learn about Amsterdam, the more I wish our entire vacation was there. Because <laughs> I don't give a fuck about you know old buildings and shit. I know, but... Let the past die yeah, already. But you'll like right. the food in Italy, though. Let the fucking past die. Food is really good. Yeah. <laughs> There's already enough shit going on. So, it, I used to go to Amsterdam to get wrecked all the time when I was younger. Like, I hadn't been for quite a while, but, you know, it was, it's really... It was, it was, I used to have a lot of fun in, in Holland in general. Yeah, yeah. I, I was there for maybe a few days at one time, and, and it was a fun time, from what I remember. <laughs> from so, what I remember. Which is I like very that. little. Yeah. The caveat, from what I remember. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, like, the, like I, I've, been, I've been to lots of places in Europe. I really like um, Prague in the Czech Republic, although I got I got arrested in Prague for getting really drunk, and I shat against the monument just as these policemen <laughs> came around the corner. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So that, that, was, that was fun. That reminds me of the time fucking Ozzy pissed on the Alamo. <laughs> <laughs> Banned from Texas for 10 years. Yep. But then later on, George Bush sucked his dick, so. <laughs> yeah. You can look it up. It's on YouTube. I did not know that. That's pretty amazing. Yeah. George Bush was sucking on his dick and, like, cupping his balls. Like, no, oh, Ozzy, no, no, crazy train was awesome. <laughs> George W. Bush is a good little cocksucker. I'm sure he is. He, lo he looks like one. He has those... Those lips. Those dick you know, lips. That's why no, but he's got such big ears, so they're like handles. You remember he painted himself nude in the bathtub? You know, TJ was pretty excited for that. Well, you know, I was actually there when he painted it. So. Oh, I, I see. <laughs> I was his <laughs> five o'clock, so. <laughs> you should have him paint you almost like that scene from Titanic. 
I'm you too know? beautiful to paint, Ben. <laughs> you can't you can't capture perfection. It's impossible. You can get close. No. No, Ben. Oh, no painting can do you justice. No. You, you, people are free to try, though. You know, whoever can paint the most epic painting of me, I'll give. Uh, I, mean, I guess that's had to be a painting, but I'll give you guys like forty-eight dollars. Forty-eight dollars. Forty-eight dollars. What an oh, odd. Forty-eight. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's what I'm. That's, what? that's the prize. Why 40. not make it fifty? Nope. Forty-eight. Or Forty-five. It's forty-eight. Forty-eight. And twelve cents. And twelve cents. Twelve cents. I will pay you $48.12 for whoever can draw the best, most epic picture of me. I don't want any derogatory shit. I don't want any of this, like, I'm super fat and I got fucking 20 bananas up my ass. You can draw that if you want to, but you ain't winning the contest like that. It's got to be, like, the most realistic painting no, it's or got, flattering. It's got to be ridiculously flattering. Like, I should be, like... <laughs> I should be, like, covered in muscles and, like, <laughs> fighting, like, a skeleton army or something, you should know? Should have, like, a 20-foot cock, too? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Just whatever, you know? I need to be, like, the absolute symbol of awesomeness. I should be fighting a fucking tiger with a flamethrower. <laughs> you guys, uh, guys, $48 could be yours. 12 cents. <laughs> 12 cents. And 12 cents. Talented. Like, ar- we got some talented money, artists out there. like... Nothing. It's like when I whenever I come back to the SF with the sense, like this is just it's no point even changing it. It's worth nothing. It's just zero here. It's ridiculous. I agree with that. I pretty much don't even think that like I don't even agree with like the existence of like pennies at this point. Yeah, you know Canada stopped making them. I think the I think Switzerland stopped making them too. They're fucking useless. We have one penny pieces, which is like point six a cent or something. I think I can't remember. Weird. I don't like it. Anyway, Ben, are we watching any more videos or no? Yeah, we have more. Let's watch them. Okay. Gotta watch them all! We're not even... Drunken and peasants? We, we, we still have like 40 minutes on our normal... DP Mon? Sure. So. Did you turn that beautiful steak into a big mistake? Oh! Count, but still that meal lets you down. Stop! Hi, Chef Tony here. This is intense. What's the secret to a great tasting steak? Uh, it's how you marinate. That steak looks this nasty. This is my Zoom flavor marinator. Stop. Watch. Hold on. That steak looks gross. Yeah, his steak did not look good. That steak looks like a piece of shit. You're going to present that to me as the good steak? I think he ate all the good ones. That makes sense. He's got a big meat belly. That said, <laughs> I, I would never trust, like, a thin chef. You know what I mean? Like, you know, I, th- I think it's probably, like, a job requirement to be bigger, you know? Yeah, that's true. So, so is is Gordon Ramsay a thin chef? Because like that's that's, oh, that's PJ's true, actually, favorite. Yeah. That's I do I do like I, I, speaking of kitchen nightmares, like Gordon Ramsay. I like that show a lot. Like I, I guess I guess I trust Gordon Ramsay. It's something to do about. I think that his use of his use of fuck and shit and stuff, which you obviously in the UK versions, like you hear. We even have the uncensored version of the American versions, like over here. Oh, um, that's sweet. The 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 English people I know that watched the American version said they told me that they like it because he makes Americans cry <laughs> in every episode. But but he make <laughs> but you know what? No, fuck that because he makes them cry in like that stupid Oprah E. Doctor right, Philly, right. like this is part of your redemption kind of way. You know, <laughs> he's he's come to fix their, their lives, not just the fucking restaurant. Like he's come to mend yeah. the wounds of their father walking out of them when they were five years old and they bought them a stupid fucking rabbit hat. To make he's, them feel better about it. <laughs> he's Dr. Way Phil to bring it back. Or something. Yeah, you know, he, he, he fucking is like, he's not just going to fix your restaurant. He's like the savior. He's like a Christ-like figure that's coming to fucking pass judgment upon you. But, you know, even though he's a cruel, vindictive God, he's also a loving God that will save you in the end. Yeah, he always starts off as an asshole in the end. He's like, I'm your best fucking friend. Actually, he does kind of behave like God, because he goes in there and he's like, I have these rules and pronouncements. And then when someone's totally psychologically destroyed, he's like, actually, I love you and I want to help you. It's like an abusive relationship, but with Gordon Ramsay fixing a kitchen instead. It's kind of, yeah, it's kind of awesome. If I was, if I'm going to be totally, if I'm going to be psychologically destroyed by someone, I would say Gordon Ramsay is probably a good choice. I would agree. I think he's, I think he's very good at like, um, making you feel shit, but also, also safe and, you know, and comfortable. Yeah. I've been watching that hotel show that he does now. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, That, that shit's just crazy. He went to one in uh, o- in Oregon where they were like all smoking weed. He's like, "Is that cannabis?" He's like yelling at him. 
Yeah, that's kind of like the selling point of our hotel, dude. That's yeah, awesome. It pretty Fuck much off. was. <laughs> Fuck off, Gordon. You suck, bro. He's wrong about that. Smoke de ganja. So, so what the fuck is this commercial about again? <laughs> I don't know. Steak, steak in the chef. Oh, oh right, steak. steak. Flavor any marinade, marinade to the top any marinade. Cylinder, Don't make it a miss steak. <laughs> pins tenderize and inject the flavor. So, how much do you think it's going to cost? This is starting to look like the Dexter oh, opening. Oh man, ninety nine dollars or some ridiculous amount. Really? Da -na 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 -na. I'm gonna say seventy nine ninety nine. Okay. I'm gonna go lower than them. I'm gonna say forty nine ninety nine. Actual Keep retail size. With Zoom, you'll be flavoring from the inside out. Make the least expensive taste like the most expensive. Uh, Whether it's what? spicy garlic Hold chicken. Hold on. No. Taking an inferior cut of meat and injecting it with a bunch of fucking bullshit is not gonna like suddenly like make it like oh shit. It is now filet mignon. <laughs> yeah. Even if you even if you found the steak on the floor in some alley covered in shit. Uh, it's now gonna taste great when you put it inside this. <laughs> but mm. it has, it has, there's over 50 flavor injectors, though. I mean, come on. 50. I injected. Okay, okay maybe I maybe you're swaying me. I with injected that Dr. 50. Pepper into some shoe leather, and now it's a filet mignon. A delectable pork roast. <laughs> this fabulous fish. Even this mouth-watering London broil. Zoom is None great for the looks barbecue, and it's dishwasher though. safe. But that's not all. Zoom's also a vacuum marinator. By pumping Sweet. out the air, it creates a perfect vacuum, drawing the flavor deep inside. You'll be flavoring from deep the inside, inside out and the outside in at the same time. So much fucking flavor. Marin wow, okay, this has got to cost $50 million. I don't know. <laughs> how could they? How could they not charge right, that amount? Something yeah, said. yeah. Now okay, that now that, now that, now that I see how gone. amazing it is, I'm gonna up my price to like a hundred bucks. <laughs> All right, let's see. The old-fashioned way can take hours. Hour. 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 With Zoom, you'll be marinating. Instantly, Sick. give all your meats, fruits, and vegetables great taste. Zoom uh, is not just for marinating; it's the perfect solution for vacuum storage. <laughs> now you can keep your food and vegetables fresher up to five times longer, so it pays for itself. Yeah, if you buy These 100. marshmallows have been vacuum sealed. Now that's the sound of freshness. Try Zoom today with the flavor injector, vacuum handle, now they're all stuck and my together secret in marinade recipes for only nineteen ninety five. Oh, Whoa! Fuck? This fucking guy tricked us, man. I thought, yeah, I thought they was gonna say way You more. asshole! I should have stuck with my original bid. I would have won. Uh, we've got to buy one now, guys. I mean, there's no excuse. It's such a bargain. Yeah. What could go wrong? <clears throat> and we need like a hundred too. Let's see here. To vacuum seal everything in so, our house. I think that this, you know, I want to see a, a fucking video of some dude sticking his dick in this. It's like, <laughs> oh god, <laughs> BME oh, god. Pain Olympics two. Zoom! I'm gonna inject my dick with several marinades. Here's uh, the magic apron. Is it just an apron? No, no it's, it's a magic. magic. Right. Right. Listen, stupid, it's, it's fucking and the magic. Ones that don't untie can leave your hair a mess. You don't want to wear it, but just a single spot can ruin that blouse or dress. It's ruined! Burn it! Magic apron. It magically flips on with no strings attached. Wow. Or magically! Quickly get covered it's, it's in ugly. <laughs> Hold on now. Is it magnets? <laughs> it does it magically, guys. Magnets? How do they work? Can they just... Like... Isn't it false advertising to say that it magically does something? Like magic, TJ. They didn't say like magic. It's magically... It, 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 like... It's not... This is not Harry Potter world, man. It's not fucking magic. It's just like there's no... It's a skin no one, like apron. That's what it is. Th then explain how they do it, TJ. I think it's magic. Magic! Dumbledore is sitting there fucking making aprons and shit. <laughs> yeah? Ains. When company comes, it's embarrassing to be seen. Oh, Not so anymore. embarrassing. The magic apron magically the wipes she, clean. Like, did, Watch what this. The fuck she in? How did she, like, get that amount of shit? <laughs> she, like, roll in the food? What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> she likes to stick her titties she was in really the casserole. Hungry. You know? Yeah. <laughs> That's how she checks the temperature. It's a family tradition. All right, now I go stick my titty in the casserole. <laughs> Why, why are you doing that? Water or sauce. It's a family tradition. Been doing it for years. <laughs> it's the best way to check if a casserole's done.
and soak through some ordinary aprons, but not the heat not the fucking heat resistant apron. awesome magic Best apron, all, motherfucker. The magic apron adjusts to fit virtually anyone. Virtually no anyone. Time, it's like it perfectly it fits even it's fat people. The magic apron can also be a prom dress. <laughs> <laughs> it could. Yeah. Instantly around your waist, holding the apron magically. And the in magic place. apron is 100% bulletproof. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I want a fucking magic Kevlar, paper. Fuck that. Kevlar fabric. I, I Here's I see that tested in the commercial. Actually, that's great. <laughs> Here's Bro. how an ordinary Kevlar vest handles this 45 ma magnum round. Boom! It's nearly destroyed. Now here's how the magic apron handles it. Boom! Person starts bleeding profusely. Ah! It's like, oh well. We thought it was bulletproof. It was Sorry. Almost magic. I guess Come we on. were wrong about that one. <laughs> Dumbledore was off that day. He was drinking. Is perfect for Let's try another one. kitchen chore and so much more. And when you're done, just simply fold and store in a drawer. Fold it's and store in a drawer. Fold and store in a drawer. What if you have two more? <laughs> that would be quite a score. Yeah. And of course, the kid just like grabs the fucking uh, like. There's a lot mom. of women rubbing their tits in this commercial. Like, oh, I think I this was clean. like a fetish commercial. Uh, fuck yeah. So dirty. Yeah, and in this scene. Yeah, in this scene. Yeah, in, this, yeah, in, the, in this scene, your tits are all dirty, so you gotta rub it off. Uh, just rub real slow. Rub yeah, your yeah, fucking yeah, titties, yeah, you goddamn slow. slut. Yeah. Sh <laughs> show them how the magic apron keeps those titties nice and clean. Yeah. Do it, you fucking whore. Yeah, you'll get your fucking money. You'll get your fucking money for your fucking drugs after you show them how the magic apron works, bitch. <laughs> the paint stays on the paper and not on you. Just slip it on and it keeps you dry when washing your dog, too. Oh, no, the sauce is on the ribs and now on you. Oh, the man. magic apron oh, just saved that shirt. It's a must for the barbecue. Wait, it, it was already covered. Like, what, it didn't save the shirt. Does it, like, suck, suck like, dirt off the existing shirt that's got shit on it? No, no, no. See, they're, they're showing... That was a, the first clip was, like, an alternate yeah, reality. Yeah, well, some doofus oh, okay. that didn't own the where magic he was, apron. You know, where he wasn't wise enough to own the magic apron. Oh, but, of course... Thankfully, in the real world, he owns it, Ugh. and his shirt was saved. Oh. Even though the, uh, if, even though you notice the magic apron actually wasn't even covering the part of his shirt that got spilled Nonsense. on in the first place, but in a world where there was no magic apron, <laughs> <laughs> like well, the entire I imagine that world, the entire world is just like basically one giant spill. We're basically like it's Noah's flood, but with like ragu and shit. <laughs> just drowning in sauce. Help out! If only the magic apron. <laughs> <laughs> like, but like again, these people in this show are fucking stupid. Like, how did he get the sauce that high as well? It's just, oh, <clears throat> it just can't touch anything without it spraying everywhere. Yeah, I, it, everyone, everyone, everyone in these commercials lacks basic wow. motor skills. If, if I got Maybe... hit by a backfiring enema, it would protect me. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe these commercials are like, you know, geared towards people who have like you know, fine motor issues and shit, like Michael J. Fox types, all shaky and I, I think shit. I so. it, it, it would make a lot more sense. If you know, you know I mean. like, like a, you got, like, fucking neural pathways that are not quite working right, so you're like, Duh. You're saying for people with Parkinson's, TJ. Not just Parkinson's, but any sort of, like, neurological disorder that causes, like, lack of yeah, balance TJ, you know or what? anything else. Maybe maybe that, that's what these products are really targeted to, TJ. You're yeah, just, you're I think so. I think, no, I really think that is what they're targeting. Tearing to. them down, TJ. Because that's what they're you're are entirely person. populated by those people. You're a horrible person, TJ. It's like they can't set a fucking pan down on a stove without like fucking sauce exploding everywhere. And like they probably bring it to common like, problem for those kinds of people. They, TJ. they probably bring the sauce to like the heaviest boil they can, where it's like squirting out everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> and then hold their face in it off camera. Yeah. And then, and then they film them up. No, you did. <laughs> it's like a tomato paste bukkake and shit. Yeah, basically. <laughs> All right. So next What's one. Next, Ben. Pet, pet cakes. Pet oh, cakes. Wow. Well, I've always wanted to have cake with my pet cake. Ah, so cute, and, and you can eat them. Each plush cupcake has frosting for hair with a uh, cherry on top. You know, kids will have I'm just, let me just put this out there. If anyone ever presents me with, like, a cupcake that's not really a cupcake, I will strangle them to death. <laughs> it's a cupcake. Is it like a Korean advert? I thought that it's something they eat dogs, right? <laughs> yeah, maybe. 
Cupcake, cupcake, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cupcake, cupcake, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, uh, that's really that's, like. That's like a Korean to me, to be honest with you. <laughs> that's not, you know, that's oh, not. Shit. Uh, don't be racist now. <laughs> don't be racist now. That's definitely Chinese people, not Korean. Get it right. And don't be don't be making fun of the Ching Chang Chong peoples, you know what I'm saying? You know? That's them, fucking racist. Yo, know, them them fucking peoples, they they sensitive, man. You know, remember when Miley Cyrus she did that shit with her eyes and it was all pissed off, man. You, got, you can't be fucking racist. around with that, man. Everyone's fucking racist. <laughs> they all fucking racist, man. You seen these fucking racists? Why are you out laughing, there? Ben? You racist! Yeah, Ben fucking he was just sitting there the other day, he's telling me that man, I wish we killed all them Japs back in WW two. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like Ben. Jack him high. Ben, that's not a very socially progressive fucking attitude, dog. I that's the exact accent I had when I said that too, because that's really how I speak. No, you and speak more like, like I'm Ben. Oh, oh, I'm oh, fucking guys. stupid, cause I'm ben. You're awesome, TJ. Oh. Oh, I don't like the sound of your voice. All right, so Ben's pet, perpetually going through puberty. I am. Hey guys, can I come over? Pet cakes. <laughs> <laughs> Deliciously cute cupcakes and pets. I sound like Shaggy from Scooby Doo. I don't know, maybe. They're not deliciously cute. You can't eat them. They're worthless. All right. Find those candy. Light, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> they need to put like little flashlights in these. You know. How many kids you want to eat one of these? Yeah, you can just like you could fuck the little animals right. in the cupcake. Yeah, I'm saying, do you have a fetish for the animals or the cupcake? The cupcake, but you could call them fuck cakes. Oh, yeah. It could be like a cupcake that you could like. Cake, aren't you? you just like stick the head of your cock in, and it like has little like rotating beads or something in there. It's like. Brrr. I'd rather just have a cupcake that I could eat and just be done with it. Yeah, I guess you could fuck one of those too. So he's you right. You could. Yeah, you know, so, it'd I mean, fall apart, but you know, you could like. I, I would still prefer to eat it. Scrape but, it all you know, back together. If that's afterwards. what you want to do with your cupcake, TJ. Then go ahead. Fuck cakes, fuck cakes, fuck cakes. Yeah, yeah. What what would the theme song be for fuck cakes? Can you come up with one? Fuck cakes, fuck cakes. Uh, <laughs> it sounds just like. <laughs> well, well uh, there's, it's the ideal song. Okay, I think you're right. But the ta the tagline is you make your own frosting. <laughs> you make your own. <laughs> wow. I will play the next one. Next one is the beater meter. Wow, I, I, I wait. Hold on. I'm afraid. You mean that product? Hold on. You mean to you you mean to tell me that I wasted all of my like masturbation and fucking things jokes on the pet cakes when <laughs> the meter beater was coming on? Yeah, yeah, the beater meter. The beater Not meter. Be a better yeah. way. You gotta beater your meter. <laughs> so what is? Should, can we t can we guess what it is beforehand? Oh sure. I don't sure, I, I, don't, yeah. I don't what I want it to be for comic value, but I mean it, it's probably something to do with measuring how long you hit eggs for or some shit. I don't know. What do you guys think? Yeah, go ahead. Is it like some product to like subvert parking meters in some way? <laughs> what? It's the, just a gun know. to shoot traffic wardens with. <laughs> there you go. Um. I have no idea. It's, I, it's the Holy Grail. That's what it is. I would I would have to guess it has something to do with eggs, too, but I'm not sure. Pro it, it's probably some lame, like, eggs or something. Well, why does it say meter, then? Who knows? I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's see this shit. Here we go. The beater meter. <laughs> D3 Development <laughs> Studios presents. This is not what I expected so far. Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. My name's Rishab <laughs> Nakpal founder and CEO of D3 Development Studios. Today I'd like to talk to you about our brand new innovative smartwatch application, the Beater Meter. The Beater Meter is a breakthrough, all-inclusive oh, no. masturbation oh, it's experience oh, enhancing smartwatch It's the same thing. Our app has loads of features. It was pretty obvious. Everyone it was know who is tapping in your area? Loads. Well, you can with our geographic leaderboards. Hi. My name's Ian Green, senior developer here at D3. So is this real or not, Ben? I don't yeah. know. This can't be real. This is gonna be <clears> bullshit. <throat> yeah, this is totally fake. What was the name of the company again? D3 Productions? D3 Productions! Let's see. Let's see. If you type in D3, you might get Mighty Ducks 3. That's an awesome movie, dude. But Mighty Emilio, Ducks! Emilio Estevez just isn't in enough of it, though. That's the only downside. Let's see. The Beater Meter. How many people in your area are masturbating right now? I hope all of them. <laughs> probably, probably ninety-nine percent. But do they have the beta meter? That's the question. 
I there, it does have a. <laughs> it does have. Oh, there's an, an Indiegogo. Indiegogo that's trying to raise money for its existence. Yes. I don't see that happening. I don't. Think. Uh, yeah. There's currently zero dollars donated. So if anyone, oh, so, so if shocking. anyone is impressed with this product and they want to help out, you know, it's How there. How much are they looking for? Uh, Two thousand. That seems like a pretty low amount to develop yeah. a product of that caliber, but I don't know. Caliber. Um, Fifty thousand, I would say, at least a minimum for something like that. So let's move on, Ben. Okay. Move on, Ben. Someone sent me. Uh, oh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah. All right. What are they sending? So, so, so these secrets. Okay, okay. So someone sent someone sent a crazy hey Scotty. Do you want to see the hey Scotty, Scotty? Show it. it. Show it. You, you Show see it? it. All right, here we go. Hey Scotty. Word around the offices, you've got a fat cock. <laughs> oh, of course. <laughs> I've got a fat cock too. Maybe we should rub our fat cocks together sometime. Maybe a little oil. Two fat cocks. Together, oil. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty awesome. And they actually used the credits one. You have a fat cock. <laughs> Two fat cocks rubbing together. I got a fat cock too. We've all got fat cocks. What is that from? It's from a. Uh, it's like a from a fake training video that we watch. Oh, right yeah, you did, sorry, yeah, I, I, I did see that, yeah. Alright, so, next thing we have is a bad infomercial with uh, Joe the Plumber. Oh and my god. It, yeah, yeah, he's terrible. Real oh American hero. Yeah! G.I. <laughs> Joe! Hi, America, I'm Joe. He looks Robert. trustworthy. You know me as Joe the Plumber. And I've partnered with my friends at VelocityStore.com to help America go digital for the DTV transition. Wow. This isn't about politics. It's about doing the right thing. You see, the transition from analog to digital is happening on February 17, 2009. This impacts millions of this Americans. This is the person that they felt yeah, should this deliver is a this message. Yeah, this service announcement. Like, he's not, even sh he's not even shilling a product. They're just like... We're gonna hire him to tell people that this is happening. No, he's gonna try to sell you like something that converts your analog signal to a digital. Signal. Oh, okay. So he's gonna fucking sell some shitty product that's like, yeah, yeah. For those is. of you too broke to buy a new TV, it's, just buy this fucking hunk of shit that'll fucking somehow make your TV work. Yeah, yeah. It's not a PSA. It is for a store because oh, I can okay. see the URL on the background. Okay. Especially the handicapped, senior citizens, and non-English speaking communities. I partnered with Velocity non English speaking communities. Don't you hate them? Providing Dude, look how bad the green screen is. Yeah, you can see like, the green on the, on the right side. He's like surrounded by blotchy greenness. Ugh. In English, Spanish, and then Chinese, with other languages to be added in the near future. VelocityStore.com is making a conscious effort to reach out and bring attention to those most impacted by the DTV you know, transition. I'm surprised he didn't win that election because his read has so much I'll energy, you, you know? It's like, he's just, like, b blowing me away with his fucking charisma, you know? It's like, I can see why they chose him. He's such a fucking amazing spokesman. He really fucking, Dude, like, he speaks to the heart of the I don't even need this product, and I want to buy it. Yeah, he's like, hi, I'm Joe the Plumber. You might remember me. You probably don't. Anyway, probably don't. Um, so they're making the switch from analog to digital at some point. You should probably buy this thing Please that'll do. turn your shitty old TV into something that'll actually play the new digital signal. I'm Joe the Plumber. Kill me. Yep, basically. <laughs> With pleasure. You're dead. All right. Here's here's one TJ I like. This is the Brazil butt lift. In Woo! I've actually stopped on this when I'm flipping the channel. Oh, yeah. Before. This is a uh, real informative. Uh, it's only 30... It's only 30 seconds of it. But it's real informative. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Leandro's booty making it. Leandro's booty making it. Yeah. yeah. Including a customized workout calendar oh, for your body yeah. That shows you Sweet. What workout to do each day to totally transform Yeah, your transform your fucking you body. Finally. Pencil to take the famous pencil test. The pencil okay. test. Uh... Can someone explain to me how this works? The famous it, pencil test. You, it's the you shove famous a pencil, pencil like, test. under your butt cheek and see if it can see if you can hold the pencil with your butt. I believe. Yeah. 
And and what does it mean if you can hold? I, I, it? I I'm not sure. Like I, I'm not versed on this Brazilian, but I, I guess like if it, if you can hold it, it means that you've got a curvier butt, and that's good, maybe. I see. Or it could I mean guess. like it your ass is around. too fat and lacks tone. Yeah. yeah, I'm not sure which one it is. Like it doesn't really make sense. It's like it kind of just depends on what you're going for. But when I hear Brazilian, I'm thinking <laughs> like big asses, you know, because that's how it is in Brazil. Yeah. In Brazil, <laughs> I want to move to Brazil, guys. By the way, I'm it's surprised either, I'm not already there. Big, see, the big butts are good, or kill yourself, you're too fat. I'm not sure which one, but both yeah. positive messages. <laughs> the way you are is wrong. Way. You need this transformatory technology. Only 19.99 a pop. To tell yeah, free you if you have yeah. We'll give you a fucking pencil. I, I, think, I think they do, don't they? Is that a true story? Yeah, yeah. Well, they do. We're gonna give you a. F if you order now, we'll give you a fucking pencil, guys. That's like, what holy shit, a pencil. pencil. Woo! A lifted butt. I did the pencil test, and I passed. In, in oh, I guess you must. I guess you must pass if it doesn't it stick. Amazing. That was amazing. Oh my god, I did the pencil test. I think the pencil test should be when you just like jam a pencil up your ass until you <laughs> fucking just yep. like you bleeding you profusely. Well, <laughs> that's a TJ pencil test. Yeah, just fucking jam up, fucking see how many pencils you can stick up there. Just more, more, more. Trying to break my record. Uh, at some point, when does it involve you being uh, cooked and eaten? Yeah, it is like fucking you, you cut my dick off. Light the pencil on fire. It to my forehead. Hey TJ, I'll be uh, cooked from the inside. In the last video, when you like busted everybody's balls for uh, not hitting the like button, we ended up getting like almost seven thousand likes. Really? Yeah. So maybe you know. Bust them balls, yeah. TJ! All right. Yeah, hey. tell them. I'll, I'll, I'll hey put guys. you on full screen for this. Full screen All right. for TJ. Yeah, because... All right. TJ! 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 <sighs> hey, guys. We would very much appreciate it if you would like this video. It's totally optional, though. You don't have to. We just really want you to. And if you don't, we're going to come to your house, and we're going to find... Anything you love. I don't care if it's a person. I don't care if it's a thing. We're going to fucking destroy it right in front of your eyes. And we're going to laugh. <laughs> and Ben's going to be there and Scotty's going to be there. And we're all going to laugh at you. And we're going to rub our dick on your face. <laughs> I'm going to jerk like, oh, off. Yeah. Uh, so when at your misery. Because, you know, Ben and Scotty, they're pretty much straight and everything. But the one exception is they'll fucking jerk off to some human misery. Oh, yeah, all the time. Yeah. And you could spare yourself Three times a day at least. That Here's horrible face. Lube. If you just fucking give us a thumbs up. But it's totally optional. You don't have to. You don't have to. <laughs> no. But you should. I hope you can live with yourself if you do. Piece of shit. Because when we're done with you, you're going to wish you were dead. <laughs> okay. All right, so um, we're about two and a quarter hours into it. So, do you want to play another video? Or? Yeah. Well, how many more? Let's we'll say one more or two more. You want to play another ad? Sure. Yeah, okay. Let's play a couple more ads, I'd say. Okay. If we have more. Yeah, yeah, we have more. More Stupid ads. ads. Let's see. Give us ads. AIDS. Sorry. AIDS. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just Everyone has AIDS. Dun, 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 dun. Ads are AIDS. AIDS are ads. It all makes sense. Do you have AIDS, TJ? Or do you have HIV? This is uh, this is part <laughs> of a uh, live infomercial. Infomercial. 1101, 1816 is the item number on this one. And the nice thing about these practice katanas... Oh! Oh! <laughs> <man>. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> A piece of that just, the tip just got me good. <laughs> what the fuck did this guy oh, expect? that got me good. Let me you slam this on a the table. Tip just got me. Uh, it just got you because oh, you slammed it into now. a fucking table, you fucking well, retard. We, uh, the sword. We need emergency surgery in the studio. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is this guy? Like, the worst guy to get on camera. <laughs> we may need. Oh, we may have to save his life. In the studio. Folks, I, I don't mean to alarm you, but he's really losing a lot of blood right now. Oh, he's dead. Oh, Look, shit. Oh, well, he's, half off. He's begging me for help. What we're going to do is, we, yeah, we're going to go ahead and knock 20% off the price of this here blade. For your inconvenience and, and seeing this, 
You know, uh, however, the one that cut him, we are going to be selling for uh, a $200 <laughs> because it is if he dies, probably around 500 <coughs> You're a good salesman, TJ. I'd buy one now. Yeah, oh, it's like, see. this is the sword that killed some guy on the home shopping Whoa, network. How he much, tried dude? to demonstrate it. It's like, sweet. He committed ritual suicide with a samurai sword. Some people say he was making an Illuminati blood yeah. sacrifice <laughs> and he will rise again dude. in a hundred years to conquer the world in the name of Satan. I'll say, if this dude dies, he'd win a Darwin Award. Well, I mean, like, the sword shouldn't be so cheap and shitty that it breaks when you hit it. They probably even told him to do that. Like, yeah, bang it against the table to show how sturdy it is. If I should have banged it the other direction, though. Not the one where the blade was facing towards him. Maybe he should have just realized, like, hey, this is a fucking shitty sword <laughs> being sold on the Home Shopping Network. I probably shouldn't really roughhouse with it. I think that's uh, a better idea. For sure. All right, so this next one is the, the Q-Ray. The Q-Ray. The, the Q-Ray. The q I'm doing it. Oh, I'm digging oh, it. Right. I'm bringing it. We're, We're feeling it. it. Is that like a fisting One thing? more. 30 more minutes. 20 more laps. I feel like this is, <laughs> you know what? Letting it up. Okay. I'm burning it up. This and is I'm like. Loving it, baby. It's the cure you know effect. What? Say hello ben, to the able. This is like. I feel like this is t t makes place in like one of those like alternate dimensions where you know, like you get your way and all your dreams come true and you're really happy, but it's really just like to control you. You know, like. Like, the, the fucking trope. They use it a lot in, like, shows like Star Trek and different, like, sci-fi shows. They'll create, like, a paradise, but it's not real. This place kind of strikes me like that. Like, I'm so fucking happy! I just have a fucking birthday cake in front of me with all the candles lit, and I'm just sitting here smiling, and... Whew, yeah, now I'm just, like, fucking goofing around with some orange slices, and we're all just having fun in this world of pure whiteness where we just have random items and we're happy. Be sure to always wear your Q-Ray, TJ. And this is all gonna... This is all gonna happen because you wear a fucking... some kind of weird-looking bracelet. Make sure to always wear your Q-Ray, TJ. They come and get you if they don't. They execute you. That's Sweet. what they do. Sexy. Oh yeah, and my, my apologies to everyone. I, I accidentally had TJ full screen for too long. Ugh, and I sorry. was like, what the fuck are you doing? Get yeah, TJ yeah. off the screen. Yeah. Dear God, man, what's well, wrong it, with you? It was during the whole This boner part. is starting to hurt my pants. Uh, please, take oh, him down. Take him down. <laughs> It For some reason, I don't think that's what was going nobody on. Nobody got to see the sword infomercial when I uh, did it. Oh, yeah. you suck, Ben. Uh, I know. I know. We gotta show it again just so they know what we were talking about. Okay. All right. We'll so all it. that shit makes sense. Do you want to finish Q-Ray first? Yeah, let's finish Q-Ray. Uh, I want to see what the Q-Ray is. is. Is it just uh, a hand? Like, it's, it's, it, no, it's a bracelet. It's a little bracelet. Oh, is it, I didn't see it! I, I, yeah. I'm sorry. I, I missed that. Yeah. Obviously, it's, it's so subtle the way it just blends into your daily routine and life. Yeah. I just yeah. completely missed it. <laughs> Yeah. Pilates, See, there it is. Oh wow! In the pink and just plain chipper. Just some of the one That's million the people the That's who wear that a Q-ray wellness bracelet. The power of positive thinking. Look at that guy dancing around. <laughs> it's the power of positive thinking. In a this bracelet. is like so. The Q-ray is basically like a drug that you wear on your the fucking placebo wrist. bracelet. Yes. It just makes it's you exactly feel happy and better. It's like yeah, I'm wearing my Q-ray now. My life is good. Just I mean, sure, my. My son murdered my oh, wife and worth it. daughter, but, you know, I'm okay because I got the Q-Ray. So my attitude is positive and chipper, even though my family is dead. And doing. So become the absolute undeniable Q-Ray. You can be. Can a simple bracelet actually Let's... turn your life around? No, yeah, but yes. Positive. Q-Ray. Q the positive. Q, Q the Ray positive, man. What in the actual shits? It's it's a Q ray and it cues the positive. It cues the positive. It makes you feel better about life, you know. Whatever whatever happens. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. matter. You know, you know, you could be like driving your car along the road one day, and you know a child jumps in front of it and you fucking destroy them, and then you go to jail, and you know you're fucking just sitting there in your fucking cell getting raped in the ass fucking fifty eight <laughs> times a day. But you're okay, because you got your fucking Q-Ray on. You're just like, man, this is okay. 
Like life throws everyone... life throws everyone... me lemons. I make lemonade with the Q ray. <laughs> Everyone on that previous screen, I'd like to think now that they've gone through some horrific trauma, like, recently. Like, their whole lives fell apart, their kids died, they have just just found out they got AIDS, but it was all okay. Because Cause the Q-Ray took them to it. That, that's what, that should be their, it shouldn't be Q the positive, it should be like, Life's okay with the Q-Ray. Yes, you have a gift, that's my friend. Good. Yeah. All right, so, yeah, we'll play Can the- my terrible jingles on a whim? We'll play the sword thing superpower. again. Uh, my mistake. Sorry about that. Yeah, god damn it, Ben. Yeah. Ben's a communist. Alright, watch this shit, faggots. 16 is the item number on this one. <laughs> and the nice thing about these practice katanas... Oh! Oh! That hurts. <laughs> oh! 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 bad. Oh, that's bad. I'm dying. <laughs> The best oh, guy ever's on his way, guys. Don't good. worry, he'll fix right. everything. A piece of that tip. Yeah, he's gonna he's me. gonna solve this fucking dilemma. Oh, oh right now, we uh <laughs> may need emergency <laughs> surgery in the studio. You have a gift for saying things that are pretty much useless and only make the situation worse. This is what people do without an earpiece. It just falls falls apart instantly without someone screaming it and telling him what to say. Uh, 9.99. 9.99, Michael. 9.99. 9.99, Michael. First month is uh, free. 9.99. No contract. Or maybe a contract. We'll we'll decide later. <laughs> I don't know, Ben. What else do we got? That guy's face ben. is beautiful. Ben's looking for something good, but he can't find it. Because he sucks. Oh, this, this thing's yes. I don't know what it is, so... Put it on! So this is a one-of-a-kind piece. There's no other one like this particular one Oh, I know what this is. Yeah. And you can see the tracks go this way. And, he's like ultra-nervous. Um, it's really cool. So he said this is, the, this is one of the only kind, the only one of its kind in the world. And he's visibly shaking. He's probably never been on television before. Uh, All right, so. Yeah, maybe we should let someone else handle it. Yeah, and this is, this is very rare, this the, thing that this, he's holding. This little weird black tube thing is just there's only one of its kind could ever exist. Well, I'm really shaky. It, it I'm really scared. much more accurately than... Oh, <laughs> oh my god. I was like, oh fuck. Uh, um, well, that does happen every uh, once in a while. That <laughs> <laughs> The host is like, oh fuck. Oh, this happens. This has nothing to do with the show. The show has no liability. He's like, oh <laughs> fuck. Oh fuck. I'm fired. I'm fired. He like oh, almost fuck. said fuck, but then he said shit. He's like, oh f <laughs> shit. I guess that's still bit not better. allowed to say on TV, but a little whatever. Bit better. You, you, you should get away with shit, though. You just broke some one-of-a-kind thing. I think you can just go ahead and say fuck in that moment. Fuck. What if he trashed the studio after that? Yeah, it, he sh you know what? If I'd have done it, I'd have started smashing other shit to make it seem like it was just like an angry outburst. You know, because it's better than being the doofus who dropped it. Be like, yeah, I destroyed it willfully. I'm like ISIS, bitch. This, this is one of my all-time favorite news blooper videos. Have you ever seen this before? No. No, Ben. Okay, uh, I'll... All right, I'm gonna play this. Listen to the name of the guy that he said he made the the movie with. This guy's like an indie filmmaker. Wait till he says yeah. the name. Very familiar name. Oh shit! Gotta turn this up. Correct. It's been going on for the last couple of days, and tonight is everyone at home's last chance to take part in it. They're showing a picture at 5:30 at the Ragtag Theater. Tell me about what's being shown. The show that's going on tonight is called One Small Step. It's a documentary about the first chimpanzees to be sent into space, um, sort of a combination of the history of the space program and an animal rights sort of activist piece. How many of you guys got together to put together this film festival? Um, there were two core individuals, myself uh, and Ryan Wiley. <laughs> dun, dun, dun! <laughs> no! Dun, dun, dun! Yeah. Okay, right, take a guess what happens next. Obviously, he Ryan Wiley. Okay, so you saw the title. Yeah, I saw the title. Okay. Oh, Ryan oh. Wiley fucking jumps in there <laughs> and just fucking just starts. They start just spit roasting that bitch. Just like double team, <laughs> both sides. Like, yeah, <laughs> animal rights. Both of us went to school 
Blah. So he's gonna yeah. puke, right? We both and have math degrees. Puke, puke, and puke. And one of the pictures that I know Ryan Please tell me it's projectile in into her face. Ryan piece that got a lot of, you know, publicity. She's like, uh, It's okay. one of those moments in life, you know? Why did he randomly throw up? It's probably, <laughs> he was there's nervous. A, there's know? a bunch of videos of that happening. He was nervous. You, you guys should see stuff like that. Like, sh things going wrong. Yeah, yeah. If that... I'm ever invited on to, like, real time with Bill Maher or something, I'm going to fucking just, like, I'll eat, like, a bunch of fucking just, like, disgusting food, like my normal diet, and then... Just throw up everywhere. And then I'll, you know, just before I go on, I'll drink, like, some castor oil or something, and then I'll just puke into Bill Maher's lap. <laughs> Here, here. Um, Dude, that'd be awesome. Blah! Oh, sorry, Bill. Sorry, Bill. Blah! Sorry again. Here's a uh, here's another one right here. We'll we'll show this. One. LMA Sot O P G. Yeah, this I I'm not sure what country this is out of. Uh, Sweden. Yeah. Okay. Sweden. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Hey, what are Niklas. Hey, Niklas. What do you want me? Tull. <laughs> I don't know what he said, but it must have been pretty gross. <laughs> Damn it, what did he say? Hold on, wait. She comes back. Woo! Okay. <laughs> she had to puke randomly. No big deal. Ooh, okay. I've never, you know, I mean, like, every time I've ever puked in my life, I've had, like, some warning. Like, I'm gonna puke shortly. It's never been like, you know, I'm gonna puke and then, blah, it just happens. I can honestly say, yeah, I can honestly say I've never just like puked out of the blue, like bleh. <laughs> Maybe like an occasionally get like a vomit burp, like ugh, ugh, that was gross, but that's about as bad as it's ever gotten for me. That's a, that was a big chunk as well. It's like a big bowl of brown <laughs> Yeah, it looks like she she just like go eat an entire like tobacco plant or something. <laughs> And then she's like, ooh, okay. Oh, oh. It's kind of strange. Oh, well, let's keep going on. So, like, you know as she's talking, there's, like, a big puddle of vomit just sitting there on the floor next to her, spattered. Yeah. And she can, like, smell it from where she's sitting doing the rest oh. of the show. Oh, she probably tasted it, too. She just threw up. I mean, yeah, you know, it's not like she fucking had time to go, like, gargle. <laughs> that was beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, it's, it's one of the... It, it, I figured out about these videos on one of those boring nights where you're just like, you know, people puking on the news or people puking oh, on sure, game yeah. shows. You yeah. know. I like it when people faint as well. I like laughing yeah. at other people's misfortune, basically. <laughs> oh, the fainting ones are really funny too. That's They're pretty like, much what uh, comedy uh, is, and then just go back into the set and just fucking, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> Dude, you should faint on TV. I, I wish you did what have fucked up on CNN. There was this thing if uh, I, would, if here I had a plan that if I cut. fucked up, you know, I was going to like just... You know, stand up and throw my microphone. I'll be like, "Fuck you guys!" and like toss a chair. Really? Yeah. <laughs> dude, you should have done that anyway. That'd been nah. awesome. That would've been awesome, dude. It was just my backup plan in case my <laughs> fucking performance sucked, but it was okay. What were you saying, Minx? Um, there was a thing on the news here where this guy had built like a, a giant jigsaw for some. Maybe I think it was like like a few years ago for like the Queen's like jubilee or something. And he built yeah. this giant jigsaw with like fifty thousand people. It was like one of the world's biggest ever jigsaws. And he had it on the wall. And he was being filmed live, and he just fell off the wall and smashed into individual pieces. And he was just, his face as it fell, was like his hopes and dreams were being crushed as they like plummeted off. It was amazing. One of the best things I've ever seen. <laughs> um, recently, did, did you hear about how recently someone toilet papered Howie Mandel's house? No. 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 Yeah, it, it, was, uh, it was Roman Atwood who did it. Oh, uh, really? yeah, I know who that is. He's a yeah. uh, uh, prank, <coughs> guy on YouTube, right? Yeah, yeah, he he actually lives in the same area as us, like, a lot of the places in his videos that we see. Yeah, around Columbus. Yeah, so, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of weird. He they, they even show him on the on the news sometimes, like, he'll prank the news people, like, the weather lady. He, like, came from around the corner and smashed a pie in her face. So it's like the most it's like the basest of all pranks. Yeah, yeah, that's here's a pie to the fucking face, bitch. Yeah. Yeah. He Go does he does super old school. Well yeah, he does some pretty crazy ones though. Did he do one where he pretended to kill his own son in front of his wife or something and she like 
like flip the, like he's he's got he he's like playing with their real son he's like a toddler and then she goes down the room for a second and he swaps it with a dummy wearing the same clothes and tells the, the toddler to hide and then he like throws it off the top of the stairs and it like hits the roof oh, and yeah. she's like holy fucking shit like totally freaks out it's, it's, yeah it's, it's pretty brutal <laughs> he he also goes into like some neighborhoods where are some pretty scary parts of town and acts like he's siphoning gas out of people's cars and shit like that. So yeah, it's it's pretty insane. He's 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 braver than I am. I'll say that. Oh, much. for sure. Yeah, <laughs> he does some pretty crazy shit. Yeah. Um, anything else you guys want to talk about or anything? He ever we tries to prank me, I'll fucking murder him. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that would be like a redneck thing. I'll like, murder him where he stands. That, you know what you do when you, you bring that up? But like that would be like a redneck reaction, like. Try that shit right here. See what happens to him. Yeah. I'll fucking kill you. I carry around this forty-five yeah. with me anywhere I go. Prank he me, bitch. Guy, he went through like predominantly black neighborhoods and was like, "What up, my neighbor?" And they were like, "What yes. the fuck did you say?" And like, get up yep. in his face. And, like, yep. yep. Yeah. My neighbors. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Yeah. yeah, I saw that one. Yeah. He's always pushing buttons. Yeah. That one. He's a scamp. Lovable little scamp. Okay. Are you constantly suffering from chafing hands while performing simple tasks? Yeah. Oh my god, yes. my hands, they are chafing. Are your this is bullshit. Yeah. Ugh. Are you tired of This is like a poorly shot parody. Yeah, this is like some teenager shit. Oh yeah, yeah, school. yeah. Fuck this. I didn't even I didn't even Oh hold on. This is bullshit too, but I thought it was funny. Okay. This is like some April Fool shit. Okay. From from people that they make like a they make coolers. Oh, okay. And they make a ri they made a ridiculous cooler. Yeah, this shit's stupid. I don't even fucking know. Yeti. Yeah. So this is. I know that this is fake. Hi, I'm Eric with Yeti Coolers, and I'm here with the newest addition to the Yeti Tundra family, the Yeti. <laughs> ridiculous. Fucking right. Do I, I want that? Dude, fucking I hope thing. that's not fake. That looks awesome. <laughs> it is. It's totally fake. Oh man. Nah, that's real. I hope it's real. No, it, it, it came right. out on a, on April first. I need that. It's got a four. fucking CB radio on it. I you know, might it's need awesome. It. <laughs> Never know you'll need that. It's like the Boy Scout motto personified. Always be prepared. Yeah, look at it. This is the last cooler you'll ever need. Yeah. Look hey, how awesome we know is. how wild adventures can get, so we've included a blender on every ridiculous cooler. I love it. Doesn't Night's like the camping, blender's that hunting, good, though. And going after the big one can get long. That's why we included a stainless steel rust-proof toaster. Sweet. Can really sneak up on you. Fuck yeah. Where, where the fuck are you going to plug it in? Does it's, it have a battery on it's it? It's solar-powered, then. It, it, it has something to mount Dude, a rifle onto. This is the best thing ever. It has a fucking rifle mount on it. The only it. way you can go picnicking you is with this fucking thing. <laughs> You got Our your gun, your blender, your toaster. To back for easy access. Tagging this season's granddaddy of a buck or the plumpest bird for your next. Oh no no yeah, it's just a rack for the gun. It's nothing to mount the gun onto. It I see. Is in your hands with the aid of preloaded calls. It has calls built into it. See how awesome it is. What the fuck? And if fishing is more your thing, have no fear. Our special drain plug holds an endless amount of leader material. Endless. When you do catch that big one, there's a built-in tape measure just above the drain plug. We wanted a clean, sustainable way to power our product, so we over-engineered this beast with a solar panel that powers See? all necessary electronics. We've included a ah. solar scanner so only you can access content. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> and you say you don't need one, Ben. Come on, man. Look at this thing. <laughs> Well, does that make your life complete? This is clearly the greatest product of all time. I'd pay a thousand dollars. It's like it's like the pulley, the wheel, the Yeti Ridiculer, the if greatest had, inventions of men. If I had cash, I'd be throwing at the screen right now. Just give me this fucking product right Shut now. Shut up and take my money. Yeah. Uh. It's Safety is no accident. We've included a retractable breathalyzer. Wow. Be irresponsible. Wild, but be wild responsibly. We Sweet. built in a 120 and 240 volt outlet into each ridiculer. So we've heard our customers, and after so many requests, we finally added the golf ball and club washer. Wow, it's clean. 
if camping, wow, kayaking, it's clean. And getting out into the There's no fucking way that little solar panel would be able to carry enough Shut up, ben. electricity oh. for you to be able to plug something into it. You don't know, Ben. Ben, you could do whatever you want with this. <laughs> so it'll probably make you breakfast, Ben. The wild is your cup of tea. You'll love our new personal assistant, Troy. Hey, Troy, where's the nearest gas station? The nearest gas station to my house is Duffy's, which belongs to my dad, a Duffy's bait shop. What the fuck? Uh, we sell bait <laughs> to the commercial fishermen, wow. and it's about a uh, half a mile from my house, right along Highway 70 in Bear Park. That's incredible. Hey, Okay. Yeah, Ben. So, it's pretty fucking ridiculous. Rid ridicule. It's ridicule. Yeah. <laughs> so, this next one's a real product. It's called Doggy Do. I think it's a game. What's Doggy doing? Oh no, he's <laughs> in the dog house now. We love you. Let's play. Make a tasty treat. Eat up, Doggy. Roll the die. What's that sound? What did he do? You win. <laughs> that That's awesome, dude. You have to make the dog shit in the game. And the dog's <laughs> It's yellow, The though. dog's shit is yellow. That dog is sick. That dog has got problems. Yeah. He did probably eat the shit, though. Yeah, my shit was yellow a few days ago, so... Ugh. Did you try to, did you try to eat it as well? Why is that kid covering his nose? It's just Play-Doh, right? Ew, it smells so bad! It's not real shit, kid. Your imagination is overactive. He, he just shoved that fucking yellow shit in the other kid's face. He's yeah. new! Doggy do by Goliath. That's one hell of a game. I know. What the fuck? There's no explanation of the rules or anything. It's just like, the dog shits, buy it. I can't remember <laughs> if we've done this one before or not, but I, you know, since we can't remember, it'll probably be interesting a second time. Whatever. Would you rather look like this or like that? Hey, hey, simple. I'd settle for either of yeah. those. <laughs> it is like, I can be, I'll be before. Either of those would be okay. Either, yeah. It looks like all they basically did was get this guy to like suck in his stomach, and it's like, or like st put his stomach out, then he sucked it in. Yeah. Or they just had like two different guys, one who's like more fit than the other. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So here, th this infomercial is going to show you how to how to make that change. How to go from like having like a small belly to being like perfectly chiseled. Yes. Ready? Yeah. Like this or like that. Yeah, I mean, come on, man. I don't really TJ. notice much difference between those. There's not, like, very drag. Like, there's a little bit more cellulite on one, but that could just be the angle. Yeah. Now you can look like this in just 10 minutes a day. With 10, <laughs> ten minutes, minutes a day. TJ, why are you not looking like this if it only takes 10 minutes a day? I don't know. I didn't. I wasn't aware of this product. Oh, okay, well, you better go and buy this right away. I will once I Watch. know what it is. And when you know what it is, you'll be like, wow, why didn't I think of that? Why did I not think of something so easy? The revolutionary vibro built oh. professional oh. obviously. <laughs> <laughs> that clearly works. Your upper abs, your middle abs, your lower abs, and obliques, plus your thighs. And Look at a like, oh, I'm just sitting around reading a magazine, guys. Blah, blah, blah. Working out my quads. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that jiggling your fat is not going to turn it into Whatever. Muscle. That what? it jiggles it right off. Only ten minutes a day, TJ. It just to falls be off. So if I just like if I just like put a vibrating belt against my belly for ten minutes a, a day. Vibrator. Yeah. That's gonna make me thin. Sweet, sweet. Uh, TJ, could this commercial lie to us? Come on. I don't think it can. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that, that commercials can. have to tell the truth. Exactly. This but is America. In just 10 minutes a day, stop Wouldn't it feel weird to have, like, a... <laughs> stop, stop working! Stop working exercising! Out. Yeah, like that stop Like a working. moron! <laughs> Dieting, oh, for losers! Diet and exercise, <laughs> You'll believe anything. Only with the vibro belt can you get true results. <laughs> Sagging buns and shaky thighs in less time with the Vibro Belt. Work, sleep, or do nothing at all while getting in shape. I'd have a tough time sleeping, sleeping with that time. on me. Yeah, how the fuck how could you, you sleep when, you're, when your abdomen's like uh, shaking violently? Uh, I feel so well rested. My eyes are burning. Greatest product ever. Greatest product. I'm gonna buy like one for each of us. A vibro belt secret is its revolutionary oscillating heated massage move. Oscillating is a series of intense muscle contractions. Notice how the fat just recedes against it. Buns, thighs, and hips like no other machine ever before. 
With multiple intensity settings to choose from, the VibroBelt's powerful motor gives you a toning How could you possibly buy this a day. and, like, believe it's going to work? Nothing could be easier. You must be the most I desperate person. Results within a few days and everything what results? You know, nice and tight and smooth. What? Within a few days. Within a few days, you went from being fat to being skinny because you had something that was like some heated thing shake against your fat. And then you were skinny. Anyone, it's, how could anyone possibly believe this? You just have to be so desperate. Are you saying that you don't believe it, Scotty? No, I don't. Vibrobell, dude. Vibrobell. It's proven, Scotty. It's not. Pr it's results, proven. results vary. No, I like they don't. that. They don't vary. You can't stop them. They vary between amazing and stupendous. <laughs> if you think it's bad, fine. Yeah. All right. Does so it, does this ever say how much it is? Uh, <coughs> only three thousand dollars. It's probably like forty bucks or some stupid shit. Let's see. Yeah, you have to get like the very end. That's what you when they say like the price, if any. I saw the word guarantee. Send it back for a full refund. I don't think there's a price. That sucks. Anyway, vibe. All right, belt. so this is this is for a product called Hamper Hoops. Hamper. It's like a basketball hoop. What has kids racing to pick up their dirty laundry off Nothing. the floor? Nothing. What's turned no. boring chore into tons of fun for everyone? TJ, TJ, I saw that video where you cleaned your room in like 10 minute bursts. Yeah. If I had hamper hoops, that shit would have yeah. been done in a second. You'd be like, you'd be like Michael Jordan, like, yeah, yeah, he's taking it to the hole. Yeah. Hamper hoop. Yeah, motherfucker. Dude, that, that would be, it, it, even if TJ bought it, it would be full in like a week. It would just sit there forever. <laughs> it would. I know. I know. How dare you say that? I like I like how you cleaned your room in 10 minute bursts with like two hour breaks in between. I had to contemplate existence between. He barely even cleaned the room then. I know. Hamper hoops. The all-star basketball hoop and hamper by Whammo. He shoots, he scores. And mom, so do you. Dirty clothes are off the floor and in the hamper. It's a slam dunk. I like how room is, these rooms are pretty much clean besides Except a bunch for of, clothes. Yeah, a bunch of clothes. Like, yeah, because that's the, the only, only thing, thing on the floor is just clothes. Hook shots, trick shots. Your kids will have so much fun. Yeah. Their clean Sound their effects added. I like that. It's like it's not gonna, there's not gonna be a cheering crowd. Room. Camper hoops fits on any door, so let the any game door. begin. Socks, shirts, shorts, and more all yeah. make the score. I'm pretty sure that just using our basic knowledge of how reality works, we can see that pretty much any article of clothes will fit. Yes. Oh, and the light up effect is also added. So basically, it doesn't do any of the. It shit. Doesn't do any of the stuff it does in the commercial. It's just basically a cheap piece of plastic that you can throw your with clothes a, with a long net. Yeah. Yeah, that's amazing. Or dirty laundry has never been this much fun. I'm happy. Yeah. She'll love it. Everyone <coughs> will love it. Everyone loves Hamper it. Hoops, everyone's a winner. When the hampers. You're a winner. There, there may be a price. Do you want to guess? Nineteen ninety nine. Yeah. Nineteen ninety five. Nineteen ninety nine. Ah, you fucking piece of shit, TJ. Plus, plus shipping and handling. Seven ninety nine shipping and handling. Handling. Handing. Yep. Fucking pile of TJ shit. wins. Hamper hoops backboard with the retractable hoop and the detachable hamper. As a special bonus, we'll also include an official all-star hamper hoops basketball. Absolutely. Oh shit, dude. We'll throw in now a cheap basketball. Yeah, that's great. Yep. All right. So this next one is for something called Ba Noodle. Big. <laughs> the big, or no, the bag noodle. <laughs> Chip clip as seen on TV. What? The bag noodle. <laughs> it's All right. You can bind it, clip it, tie it, or zip it, but air gets in and freshness leaks out. Oh, so you still end up with stale. There's got food. to be a better way. That's any Sullivan here for but noodle. But Your noodle. flexible friend that seals bags. I think we've done this one food, before. Fresher, longer. Yeah, the noodle seals any yeah, bag. Just roll it up and bend the ends for an airtight seal every time. We did this, Ben. We did, but noodle. Did we? Yes, we did. Oh, okay. Fuck this then. Fuck it. Did we do uh, Dr. Hart's Power Floss? I don't think so. No, I don't okay. remember that. 
I don't have time to floss. It really hurts. Ow! It's getting stuck the in the agony. Brain. My gums bleed. Look. My floss. gums bleed. Well, maybe you need to floss more. You yeah. Floss. Yeah. I like that. It's like maybe you have gingivitis. Yeah. yeah I'm fine. Then your teeth doesn't have to be such a pain. Hey, is this the water pick? I yes, think we it made. Is. Yeah, yeah, we already did this. It's basically just a glorified okay, water pick. So I need, <laughs> I need to empty out my stupid ads inventory, and I need you guys to send me more. We need new stupid ads. Yeah, because we're, we're running, running out. out. Yeah. So, power floss. It's just a water pick. Yeah, that's, that's all it is. That's it. Sorry, so we've already done that one. Uh, I know we haven't done this one, but this one a lot of people have talked about. It's uh, Peter Popoff's Miracle Spring Water commercial. Have oh, you ever seen that? No, no. I haven't, but it sounds funny. Yeah, it's some charlatan. Peter Popoff once cured Marilyn Manson, though. He did? Yes, he did. Did Marilyn Manson just do it because he thought it was like Well, he was funny? like a kid at the time. Oh, I see. And, uh... They said that Manson was, like, born fucking deaf in one ear, and Peter Popoff rubbed his ear with his finger and cured his ear as a boy. <laughs> it's in his autobiography, Long Hard Road Out of Hell. Reverend Peter Popoff wants you to know that God can reverse every negative verdict in your life. Every single one. To live a life sentence of lack and your defeat. daughter's dead. You can be free to enjoy all of all God's you need is some blessings. fucking cheap ass water, he wants bitch. To send you your free packet of Miracle Spring Water, your point of contact for the miracle you need. Now in a larger size. I had Sweet. been in two car accidents. And the doctors kept saying, well, here, you got to take painkillers. I used your Miracle Spring Water, and it's gone. Wow. That's amazing. I used your Miracle Spring Water, and it's gone. That's doctors amazing. told me one thing, but they're liars. Unlike God. Unlike God, who fucking miraculously cured me with water. God doesn't lie. Why, why did God need to like, send her water? Why, why would any uh, Why would any water be holier than any other water in existence? Didn't God create all the water? Yeah. Wouldn't tap water be just as holy as some fucking Peter Popoff bitch ass magic Appar water? Apparently not, dude. Because that one was in two car accidents and nothing worked. Peter for her. Popoff fucking waggled his dick over the water, and now it's special. <laughs> yep. Yeah, well, like Peter Popoff fucking got rich off bullshit like this. Tell me that I could not get another home. I prayed, I believed, I followed every instruction, and on May 26th, we closed on our dream home. Thank Stop you, Miracle what? Water. What? Millions of people buy homes every year. It's not magic. It's, well, not, it's, not, they, like, it's not like I prayed She thought she would Jesus. never be able to get one, but Oh, then, yeah. It's nothing. With the power of Miracle Water. And money. <laughs> yeah. And, and, and a you mortgage. Know. Yeah. It's like, I don't understand this. It's just the, like incidental things in your life. Like, you know, you could do with anything. Like, you know, the it, power of mortgage I really bankers. wanted a smartphone, and then I went and bought one. Thanks, Jesus. Yeah. My arm was cut off in a fucking industrial accident, and I drank your Miracle Water, and it grew back. Thank you, Jesus. Thanks. That Jesus. actually would be a miracle. Best. God is a God <laughs> yeah, you notice it's never shit like that, though. More miracle spring water in a new, larger packet. You have sent me the water, and I use it. You told me I was gonna get a check. This is all women buying this shit. Sure enough, I got a check in the mail. It was exactly seven thousand dollars. Another check for Someone just sent you seven thousand dollars randomly. Like, so, it's all women there, too. So, randomly, these women get checks in the mail because they drink so, Miracle Spring water. I mean, like, I mean, you know. I don't know what they do I don't want to be sexist here, but, man, women are fucking stupid. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't see no men falling for this shit. Excuse the, I'm sure. Not yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Miracle men. water, guys. I'm sure there are men that fall for it. Maybe three. Glory to God. It's mostly women. And they're smaller and inferior brains. I will send you the miracle spring water. I'll send you the instructions. I'll tell you how to use it to see how to use it in oh, fucking wow. water in enema form. You must give yourself an enema with maybe it. That, maybe that water will cure my uh, my cold. I That's can, true. I can drink some of that water and I'll feel good. In every area of your life. Act now. Call the number on your screen today. I can't. There's a big black block over miracle it. Miracle spring water. Well, they can't even see that. Isn't it amazing to see what God is doing? No. It's sure not. You fucking charlatan. <laughs> Yeah. I kind of admire his brazenness. He's just the definition of a charlatan, man. He's just like sitting there. He's like, selling something that's absolutely worthless. Probably for a it, shitload of money. 
but it's brilliant because it's like it's it's miracle spring water. He's basically just giving people water and then getting them to come to his fucking seminars and shit and just, and just buy his shit. You like me charging like thirty dollars for a bottle of Evian. Yeah, it's not even that much. It's like a little plastic packet. I need to start selling like atheist water. Well, I I guess that's what they give away for free. But yeah, they probably sell giant. No, jugs they give that away for free. But that's how they get like your name and you're on a mailing list. Atheist you, water. It doesn't do anything. Yeah, except for hydrate. I mean, it hydrates you. you and <laughs> I guess it gets you wet. But yeah. dude, you say water, the giver of life. I'm giving you life because I'm giving you water. Here's here's a crazy. Video. Many scientists believe life originated in water. It says this is an advertisement for. Toilet paper from the Dominican Republic. Okay. And it's weird. Let's see. Aliens, give us toilet paper. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, all right. <laughs> These aliens. Wow. Damn, I guess powerful aliens. You, you could do that, or you could just, like, open it with your hands. <laughs> They're aliens. They don't understand that. I concept. also like how he's transparent enough that you can see the door through him a little bit there. Or maybe that's just the white on his back. I don't know. Oh, they're stealing toilet paper, it looks like. I guess they don't have toilet paper technology. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? This is the best commercial I've ever seen. <laughs> Why would they need toilet paper when they don't even have asses? Maybe they're like, buttholes retract, TJ. Why is he carrying it like it's heavy? Oh shit! It just became the Matrix. Couldn't they shoot lightning a second ago? What happened to that? Well, they want to take, they want to take him back. Oh, oh, there he goes. Wow, this has gotten intense. If he shoots a thing of toilet paper, it becomes a rope. So, there's that. They're taking him back to probe him, dude. Okay. Uh, Sounds like they're about to play some copyrighted music. Yeah. Thriller. Yeah. No, no, it's bad. It's bad. Yeah. Okay. I'm bad. Yeah. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, yeah they're still, still playing, playing it. it. Yeah. Yeah. Don't do it, Ben. Yeah, no, no, I'm not going to do it. Don't do it, Ben. Don't do it, Ben. Yeah, but it's it, it was pretty crazy. It looks like it gets even crazier. I would say uh, if anyone wants to check that out, look for it. It exists somewhere yeah. on the internet. You can find it if you're not retarded. Yep, Dominican toilet paper. All right, so. Are your teeth less than perfect? Would you no, love to my teeth are absolutely perfect in every way. Well, creating a stunning Hollywood smile could cost as much as ten thousand dollars and Shit. involve drilling, shots, and having your teeth Those ground don't look down perfect. to stumps. But now there's an incredible breakthrough in dental technology. So I want to look perfect, not like a rat. An ultra-thin professional dental product that's custom-made to give you Finally. an instant. It's called whiteout. Just spread the white out on your teeth. No, I don't think you can TJ, put you that need in your this. mouth. Snap on smile, sure TJ. You can, ben. Snap on. Never go to the dentist again, dude. Just yep. have this. Yep. Removable, stunningly white, natural looking smile. All it takes is two brief dentist visits and you even get to choose your new smile's shape and shade. There's no grinding, no drilling, no shots, shade. No so like I, I like uh maybe like an orange. Yeah, like I'll take shade. red. Yeah. <laughs> I want bright red teeth that are sharp. That'd be sweet. That would be. I, I was gonna say that. That would be, be pretty fucking, fucking awesome. Sweet. I actually want one of these now. Oh, pain! Snap on smile can be fitted in two visits. It's easy, painless, and beautiful. Look, both these ladies have smile makeovers. Grill. One cost almost ten thousand dollars. The other has a snap-on smile. Can you tell which is which? 
Yes. Why pay thousands? That one. I got my snap on smile more than two years ago, and I wear it every Your teeth day. were slightly I've imperfect had snap before. I've for four years, and it still looks Look beautiful. at her hideous before snap teeth. Snap-on's great for special No one will love me without snap-on smile. I'm ugly. No one could love teeth like that. They're no hideous. Way. They're Look monstrous teeth. teeth. I see no value in them as human beings because of their yeah. fucked up teeth. Yeah, that little fucking part of my brain that lights up when you recognize people just doesn't. Yeah, they're just objects. When I see you. that shitty smile. Especially That's, women. They're just like, this woman's like an that ob- smile is fucking garbage. You know, you, you kind of try to see them as people, but then you see their teeth like, oh, it's an object. I can just do whatever I want to it. Yeah. Because remember, objects are acted upon. All right, so we're going to play one more before we sign off for the night and then do the post show. And then kill ourselves in a suicidal pact. I was never advised about this pact. Well, this now you is have been. This is a, a commercial for a convention... I think it might be f- it, something Japanese related. A was, used butt plug convention. It was called Sakura Con. Sakura Con. Yeah. Sakura Con. Sakura Con. Sakura Con. I love sushi. I love Japan. Period. Mm-hmm. I love Japanese. Period. Yeah. Garuga mess. Oh yeah. Uh, I love okay. the anime. Yeah. And manga. Oh, These people okay. are insipid. I know. Yeah. Keep them away. Oh, yeah. Get them back! Yeah. Get back! And hentai! He said and DD. Bukaki, yeah. yeah. Tentacle porn. You know you guys know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Kyle K. Sakura Kong Ikima! Get your wow. butts to Sakura Kong. It's, it's so bad. He's, it's like He's so threatening bad. them with death if they yeah, don't He's got go. a knife. He's like, go to Sakura Kong or die, bitch. I'm a, fuck, I'll go, man. Shit. Holy shit. The guy is brandishing a fucking knife as big as a sword. You better go. <laughs> go to Sakura Kong or you die. Go, to, go Sakura to Sakura Kong or you die. Go to Sakura Kong or you die. Sakura Kong or death. Don't just talk about it. Check out SakuraCon. April 10th through 12th. Check SakuraCon.org. Yeah, so I guess... I guess it's SakuraCon. 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 Whatever. They got sushi and fucking dicks. And fucking dicks. And hentai. And dicks. Announcing an amazing electronic breakthrough. A watch so unbelievable, so incredible, so revolutionary that it goes beyond time. Jesus Christ. Are we in the Twilight Zone? Introducing the Multicron 20 Function Calculator Watch. Look at that fucking thing. Look at it. So basically, this is pussy repellent. This is 1983. It's so advanced, it replaces all of this. Imagine, every digital feature you could ever want is now available in this one single timepiece. It had a calendar, uh, okay. There's a special 21st feature that will astound you, but we're saving that one for last. Multicron is a full-function calculator that adds, subtracts, multiplies. Oh, so... But does it divide? Does it it divide? It divides! A memory and even a constant. The Multicron is a stopwatch and lap timer that gives you hundredth of a second accuracy. Of course... What the fuck is going on? Whoa. It's like... I feel like I'm being sold pussy repellent by the Borg. (laughs) Resistance is futile. It's also an everyday watch that shows the hour, the minute, and the exact second. It displays AM or PM or 24-hour military time. Holy it gives shit. you the month, it does and everything. the date, and the day of the week. You and do your fucking taxes with this watch. Viewing. The Multicron has a daily alarm. Or can be set a week in advance. It even has... What do you think this mystery 21st feature is? Because they're going to get to it. Lasers. An it hourly shoots time a fucking laser. And now that astounding feature twenty-one. Feature twenty-one, everybody. The price. The oh, price. that's garbage. That's such a fuck. Let's see what it is. Uh, remi- I mean, mind you, this is nineteen eighty-three, so the dollar had a much higher value. Right. Multicron is not a hundred dollars, not seventy-five, not fifty dollars, not even thirty. It's yours for the unbelievable low price of only nineteen ninety-nine. Wow. It's kind of scary. I mean, the the 
I don't know. It's... I feel like this. Yeah, you, you, you know, you feel like by the time this guy is done talking, you almost feel like this watch is a threat to your existence. Yeah. 1999. It does this and this. Soon it will replace you. Yeah. Your family will love the watch more than they love you. All right. So next product is called. And the... it's only 19.99, Ben. The next product is called the Pen Quarter. It's a pen. It's a quarter. Wouldn't it be great if you could stop scribbling important notes and still remember everything later? Yes, or have an accurate record of your doctor's specific directions without yes. relying on your memory? Well, sure. now you can. Because now you can record it all with the pen quarter, the digital recorder that changes everything. Because in addition to being a fine writing instrument, it's also a discrete recorder that doesn't need tapes or batteries. Okay, okay. Uh, can you imagine if it needed tapes? <laughs> How much? Po I mean, they couldn't have that much memory on it, really. And it seemed uh, like it'd, I be, mean. it'd be kind of a pain. In the, it does like with no actual like menu that you can choose from. It's probably be pretty hard to scroll back through your recordings. So easy, anyone can do it. Just switch it on to record, then insert into any computer to play back your recordings. First contact oh, okay. shipping, then send out all the emails. Pen quarter records up to twenty five. First emails. Hours and works. Good thing I have okay. my pen, Carter. Why? Why was it a woman? Uh, or I don't know. Like, so she was like taking notes that her boss was dictating to her, and that's all it said. Why? Why couldn't she just remember that? I don't. know. That wasn't a lot of instructions. It seems to me like you, if you know, like if you want to remember something, you could get a pen or you can get a recorder, but combining them both into one thing really isn't doing anything new or interesting. How much do you think it is? Um, probably like tw 20 bucks-ish. Maybe 30. You probably get two of them, too. <coughs> Jeez! Oh wait, that's a that's one of the um, that's a regular recorder. Okay, no software required. You could call now and get the amazing new pen quarter for like only nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. Order right now. Oh, and there you go. The offer you. And get Why is this shit so predictable? Because they're. Because it's based on methods they've developed. Because they know someone's sitting here watching this fucking. Probably commercial. an old person, an old retired. Per yeah. Because these commercials, there. these commercials show like when the soap operas are on, or like the Price is Right. Right, or at like three in the morning. You know, they're sitting there. They see the pen quarter. Maybe they think it's kind of a cute idea. I don't know if I'll get it. You know, and then they say, oh, "Well, it's only nineteen ninety nine. Like, well, that's not that much. And they're like, "Well, you get two. And they're like, "Ah, oh, well, that clinches the deal for me." And a second pen Meanwhile, quarter. this shit ain't worth a fuck. No, it's garbage. I mean, it's a total piece of shit. You're never gonna actually use it. It's it's fucking looks inconvenient. Probably is a shitty pen and an even shittier fucking recorder. Quarter. Pen quarter only nineteen ninety nine. Call now for this amazing TV only offer. And there's a uh, reason why none of these products are around like 10 years later. No. You know, you, know, you, you never see something in one of these infomercials Only? that people are still using. You how know? about how about Chia Pet, though? Chia Chia Chia. I don't know. Do people still use those? I will. I mean, I still see commercials for them, so people must oh, be really? buying them. I had no idea. But that's kind of different, though. Because that's not there's it, the Chia Pet doesn't even pretend like it actually has a use. Yeah, it doesn't solve some false problem. <laughs> yeah, you know, like, are you tired of you know every time you put on your glasses your dick explodes? Like, no. Well, you need the new. Yeah. Whatever. All right. So uh, this one's called Easy Feet. How do you clean your feet? You bend, stretch, and you can't I'm reach. Tired of Keeping all that your bending, tired feet looking it. young is such a chore, but not anymore. This Jesus is easy. Christ, feet. That looks dangerous. <laughs> Guys fucking sitting there jumping up and down in the shower on one leg. I mean, it's slippery in there, buddy. Revolution in convenience. A foot massage every day. Easy Feet uh, has over 1,000 like rejuvenating bristles to gently massage and clean the top, the bottom and even has a built-in pumice stone for rough, cracked heels. So make ugly, dry skin a thing of the past. Fuck Easy you, feet. ugly, dry skin. You're a thing of the past now. 
makes me no feel longer a lot will we more be when wearing my strappy shoes. Easy Feet my will literally shoes. change the way you bathe forever. Easy Feet's unique design not only cleans your feet, but massages and gently exfoliates. It looks and weird. <laughs> I, just... I don't, it doesn't, like, I'm imagining the sensation of that on my foot, and it just makes me feel uncomfortable. It's dirt. And most importantly, Easy Feet cleans in between your toes. It's great because also, you don't have it to get really dirty itself. Probably. You probably have to clean it. Yeah, you know, that's just one more thing you got to clean. Fuck Easy Feet. So, how much do you think Easy Feet costs? I mean, it's probably 19.99 again. I can't see them charging more than that for it. You probably get two pairs again. Or some other bullshit shower or appliance. Yep, you get two easy feet for free. Just pay separate processing. So that's two easy feet for only fourteen ninety nine. Yeah. Whoa. Fourteen ninety nine. Yeah, so it's because they cost fifty cents a piece to make. If that. Yeah. I mean look at this. This double pieces offer of won't last long, so call now. I mean like I guess if you're really old and you can't bend over to clean your fucking feet anymore, maybe. But I mean, I would st I would just say like sit down and you know lift your feet up on your fucking knee and you know clean it with a washcloth or something. I mean, you really don't need some fourteen ninety nine piece of shit that you know it's all probably more hassle to maintain it than it's worth. Looks like it feels weird on your feet too to me. I mean, it doesn't. I mean, I don't know about you, Ben, but to me, it doesn't look like a pleasant experience. I don't. Really. I don't know what it feels like. Like it's. It's hard to tell. It depends on how like stiff the little bristle things on it are. That's true. So I don't know. Um, Just but, based on how it looks, I don't think it, it would feel. Nice. If I want, I, I mean, if I, we, I have no problem cleaning my feet now, so I really don't give a shit. Yeah, like, you know, it's is, like eh, whatever. Why don't they just invent like l shoes that are little washing machines? You know. They probably have something like that, like pedicure machines of some sort. Um, all right, so we're going to move on. This is... I'll, I'll just play it. It's hard to explain. Let's see. Listen up, ladies. We all know leggings are just so comfortable and easy, but now jeans, they just look good, and they go with everything. So how do you choose? Well, you don't have that to. That has been now, the fucking great Jeannie. philosophical question of our age. I think Socrates himself fucking pondered that one. He's like, ugh, do I wear leggings? Do I wear jeans? I mean, leggings are so comfortable, but jeans look so good. Ah -ha! Can't decide. Jeans is our first garment to combine leggings and jeans, giving you a fashionable, stylish new look. With jeans, comfort so never. So there are leggings that look like jeans. Yes. Is that weird? Eh, big deal. It looks so good. They look just like my favorite pair of jeans, so I get the comfort of liking. Genie's smart fabric makes your legs look firm and slim. How you do know, they do it? I wear jeans pretty much every day, and I'm never like, just like, holy shit, are these jeans uncomfortable, man? That'd be so funny if you wore leggings. <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm... <laughs> I'll, I'll fucking try it. I don't care. I'll yeah. wear leggings around. That would be hilarious. I'm going to stuff the front, though. Get a bunch of socks. Yeah, my dick is huge. The secret is Genie's triple layer technology. Triple layer. The ultra comfy layer is so soft Which against apparently made They a, look so fake. They look... Uh, there's like a layer that... Why is that one layer moving around? Is it like full of fucking little microscopic bacteria and shit? Just like, ah, scrambling around. I mean, look at it. Let's see uh, how much they cost. Designer jeans are $89, dude. But here's for this a special TV offer. I like how they pretend like this isn't only offered on TV. You know, like... Special TV offer. In this special TV offer, get your genies in classic denim for just nineteen ninety five. But fuck. ladies, we know you can't get by with just one pair. Look so how good we'll you're looking. So nineteen ninety five for two pairs of genies. They're like jeans, but they're leggings, and they look like jeans, kind of. They look really. like leggings painted like jeans. Is what they look like. <laughs> yeah, they look like leggings that are pretending to be jeans. I have a pair of pajama pants that are that like have a jeans design on the front. 
Hmm. You know? So I kind of already have a genies, but it's not tight like leggings. It's like loose, like, you know, pajama pants. Next one here is right or uh, big vision eyewear. That doesn't sound too bad. Why is it no matter what you do, oh, the view is never big enough for you? It's just all a big blur. It looks a little bit like Get reading glasses. Small lens. I'm having trouble. Really trying to put my arms away. Very hard. What you need is big vision, the magnifying eyewear that makes everything bigger, clearer, and easier Did to do. review another product that was like this? Yeah, or maybe this was even the same one. I don't no, know. No, it was different than this. But, I mean, it's, it's like... Just Get fucking reading glasses. I don't understand why they, like, reading no. glasses already solved this problem ages ago. Why do you need some special new, like, oh, the Super Mag Mega glasses? You know, now you can see shit close up that used to be blurry because you're old and your eyes suck dick. And it's just like... Just the clarity. With this, the print is really so nice and so clear. I can read it perfect now. Oh my god, this is amazing. <laughs> I would never have been able to do it without these. Big Vision's design brings the power of a magnifying glass to the place you really need it. Your eyes. Big Vision brings 200% uh, magnification to yeah, both Yeah, what the fuck eyes. else? What, what other part of your body would use a magnifying glass? It brings it to your eyes. It brings it to the part of you that needs it. Your eyes. Like, <laughs> yeah. What, what the fuck else? Where... What if what, when if people ever use magnifying glasses for any other part of their body? Like, you know, my knee needs a magnifying glass, so, you know, it looks bigger to itself. I don't know. What the fuck said? I mean, it's like a pointless... Ah, whatever. It's with no distortion and no prescription needed. The goal is to reduce eye pain, eye strain, and eye fatigue, and that's what good magnification eyewear does. It's very clear. It's amazing. They do not make reading glasses that do this. It's like high definition. I don't even see any reason to wear readers anymore. These are great. Big Vision can be worn over prescription glasses and contacts and gives your eyes the extra boost they need. It's perfect for reading small print on medications. So clearly this is being marketed towards a specific right. demographic that needs to read small... And takes medication. Yeah, medication labels and shit. I hate how all these things that are clearly being sold to the elderly are, they have commercials that act like young people want this shit too. Yeah, oh, this is great. I d definitely don't look like a piece of shit wearing this. Oh, this doesn't look fucking dorky as fuck yeah. at all. Yeah, this is great. Now I can read that small print that I already can because I'm not 80. We're going to give you another pair free. Just be processing and handling. That's two pairs of Big Vision, a big value, with carry cases and I can't believe price. it. Okay, yeah, so almost everyone we've covered so far has the double offer thing. Yeah, they love that. Yep. It's like their, that's like their greatest gimmick. They're like, yeah, you think you're just getting one for that price? No way. You get two. So in case you lose one, you still got one. All right. Or you could give the other one away to someone else as a really lame gift. And you get two uh, uh, cases for them too, Ben. So really it's worth it. Next one we have here is called Teeter Hangups. Teeter Hangups? Yeah, Teeter Hangups. Okay. A better back and a better body. Since 1981, that has been my passion. I created Teeter Hangups so people could live healthier, more active lives. I know what it's like to have back pain. When I found Inversion, it changed my life forever, and I believe it can change yours. I am proud to present the newest and best Teeter Hangups. Teeter Hangups is some sort of medieval torture device. Yeah. What is. I mean, he said inversion. So I would never upside down. I would never do that on that thing because you know, at my size, I mean, I just don't trust that fucking thing. It, it is kind of like a trust fall because you have to like lean, like you know, you strap yourself into it and then you tilt, you I like mean, tip yourself if back. If that thing falls apart, the first thing hitting the fucking ground is your fucking skull. I mean, that's no good. 
easy to use. Simply set it, lock it, recline, and relax. Just three to five minutes a Doesn't day in your own relaxing. home to help relieve back pain, relieve stress, improve posture, rejuvenate joint health, and build core strength. The How would teeter hang of that? I don't I mean I how does it how does laying upside down like uh, upside down at an angle for 3 to 5 minutes fix your posture and relieve your back pain? I don't I don't get it. Offers relief from back pain, naturally targeting the source of the ache by relaxing tense muscles and providing decompression that can help to restore the nutrients to the discs, How's reduce nerve pressure anything? and realign the spine. I can get on it, hang upside down for 10 or 15 huh. minutes get up and my back pain is gone so so we we've well, missed it this was the cure to back pain all along hanging upside down i mean but apparently he has to use it often because he's like oh i get on for 10 or 15 minutes and my back pain is gone but apparently it comes right back every time so doesn't seem like it's actually solving the problem at the most even if we assume that it works for temp it, it works for temporary relief at best and right underneath what he says, it says results may vary. Consult your physician. So it's not like they have some supreme confidence that this shit actually works. Yeah, It's amazing. Instantly, I was feeling the effects from it. My lower back was feeling better in the mornings, and, and I just kind of felt rejuvenated getting off it every day. Medical and scientific studies around the world have shown the benefits of inversion, and over 2 million oh, have, people have, have put their trust in teeter hangups for a better back and a better body. I'm over 72, and I feel. <laughs> uh, 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 um. <laughs> uh, can we go back and, and watch that again, please? Yeah, let's let's see that again. That was that was the greatest. Yeah, a little further, a little further. There we go. Okay, everybody, prepare yourself. We're gonna see that again. <laughs> he jumps like Mario, and like a fucking inch off the ground. Two. <laughs> <laughs> It's like I'm 72 and I could kind of jump still a little. We need to. Someone needs to photo. Like, well, I guess not Photoshop, but like, get that commercial and like put one of the Mario blocks above his head so when he jumps, you can like have him like break it and a coin comes out. You know, because that'd be pretty sick. And I feel great. Only Teeter meets UL's tough consumer safety testing standard. Standards. No one else even comes close to Teeter quality and performance. Now you can try the latest Teeter hangups in your home for 30 days for only $14.95 with free shipping. We'll also include two of our most popular yeah, accessories. How much does it cost if you want to keep it there? Massage. <laughs> oh, so it has acupressure nodes yeah so not only can you hang upside down in an awkward looking piece of you equipment have little knobs digging but yeah in. you can have little like yeah little knobs digging into your back does that sound like a good time ben i said it looks like a fucking torture device how would you and, like and one of these the lumbar stretch plus you'll receive the healthy back and core system but that is not all if you call now we'll also upgrade your order to free expedited processing this thing is mine you can't have it, it it's one of my most valuable possessions it really is um okay well your life is meaningless then you should probably just you know quietly leave this world because if this is one of your most valuable possessions I mean, it's just like the saddest thing I've ever heard, honestly. How many more you want to do? As many more as you want, Ben. All right. It's up to you. Next one is called Quick Bright. Quick Bright. Open a refrigerator and the light goes on automatically. Open a car door and the light goes on automatically. Wouldn't it be great if you could have a light go on anywhere you need it? Well, now you can with Quick Brights, the super bright LED lights that go on any. This is not the first one of these that we've covered. Yeah, it's not. I mean, light a light with a sticker on it, basically. Um, also, here's an idea. If you want to go look through your drawer, just turn the lights on in the fucking room. And, you know, I mean, if someone else is sleeping, I mean, I guess that this 
comes in handy then, but I mean, how often are you having to rummage through drawers with someone else sleeping next to you that's going to wake up as soon as you turn a light on? So you need the quick light. I mean, just turn the fucking lights on. God damn. Where they install in seconds. Simply also, most people have cell phones now, and guess what? Every fucking cell phone pretty much has a goddamn light on it. Yeah, I mean, if you're not using the screen for a light, then you can use the flash for a light, which is super bright. Place on any door, drawer, or cabinet, and quick brights go on automatically when you open and off when you close. Perfect to light up dark drawers, bright enough to light a closet, or to help you see clearly in dark cabinets. They can even light up your medicine chest. You can even <laughs> count on them when the power goes out. Quick brights go on when you open and off when you close. Now you Amazing. Truly, quick brights are the most amazing technology. We can pretty much wrap up the whole humanity thing because we have reached the pinnacle of innovation now. Thank you, quick bright. We find small things in sewing baskets, toolboxes, and tackle boxes, too. You can even light up the inside of your mailbox. And quick brights are guaranteed to never burn out. Or we'll replace them free. So stop straining. Yeah, your right. Mind. Like you'll even be fucking still in business in two years when that piece of shit breaks. <laughs> We're sorry, we no longer offer quick break. I wonder if it has a like a replaceable battery in it over the house with quick brights you've got the light you need wherever you need it auto okay how much does this piece of shit cost you probably get like four for 20 bucks whoa you get oh you get eight, eight. you get eight of them for probably 20 bucks lights to mini spotlights just like that and swivel holy all the shit. way around the flood to see where you are the spot to see <laughs> what you're doing Swivel spots are great under cabinet lights, right? Oh my a $100 God. value, all for just $14.99. That is not a $100 value. Oh yeah, how do they, where, where do by, they get that By from? what fucking, I'd love to see the math that says that, that this is a $100 value. No fucking person on the face of the earth would look at what's on the screen right now and say, ooh, how much is that, $100? Like, no, sir, it's only $14.99. Whoa! I'm blown away, mind blown. How could this be? Yeah, hundred dollar value, Ben. All right, so next one is called the Easy Egg Witch. So basically, it's gonna be like some kind of like cylinder or something that you put your eggs in to cook them, and then you can put it on a sandwich or. Everyone loves a delicious breakfast sandwich, but fast food sandwiches are loaded with oil, grease, and fat. And That's what we like about them. Sandwiches. Who wants to eat that? Introducing Easy Egg Witch, the fast, easy way to make fresh, flavorful, healthier breakfast sandwiches at home. Just add an egg and your favorite fixings to the non-stick Easy Egg Witch. Place on the lid and pop it in the microwave. In just one minute, you have a perfectly sized round egg that easily slides onto English muffins, biscuits, bagels, and more. The secret is the unique steam circulation design that cooks fluffy, delicious egg in the perfect sandwich shape. Make a crisp. What's your opinion? It looks like the... Just, just go to fucking McDonald's and get the goddamn egg sandwich from there. Be bacon, egg and cheese, English muffin. Scramble eggs for a tasty sausage egg and cheese. A mouth-watering ham egg and cheese biscuit. <clears throat> or enjoy a bacon egg All and right. cheese. Here's the thing. You could sit there and you can fucking cut up some bread and make some bacon and get some cheese out and dirty up this fucking piece of crap contraption that you're going to have to wash later. Or you could just go to McDonald's, buy the fucking same sandwich, and then all you have to fucking throw away afterwards is just a wrapper. It's way fucking easier. This thing is not convenient at all. Fuck you, a Easy Egg Witch. Your egg's on hard mode. I didn't see a price, but who cares? I don't give a flying fuck. All right, so... Any price is too high. We'll do one more here. This one's called Bull Bright. Bull Bright. At least Going as... to the bathroom in the middle of the night can really trip Jesus you up. Christ. Ladies hate when he goes with the seat down. He leaves the light off, but misses makes a. <laughs> like... Oh my God! She's... I can't believe we're really going there. Yeah, like... she's cleaning the piss off the toilet seat. Stupid son of a bitch pissed on the seat. 
mess, and that could ruin everyone's night. What you need is Bulbrite, the nightlight for your toilet bowl, so you're in control. Just enough light without having to turn on the dreaded wake-up light. Bulbrite is battery-operated, fits any toilet bowl. No tools needed. Simply adhere to the back of the lid. Stays right where you put it, no matter how many times you open um. and close... Are we so stupid as a society that <laughs> we feel the need? We have perfectly good, like, we have so many options for light, and yet there's people watching TV like, man, if only there was some way to light my bathroom. Well, it also, it's an indicator of whether or not the toilet seat is down. Right, I mean, but you know what else is an indicator is just turning the fucking light on. And looking at the toilet seat and seeing if it's and, down. And they're like, oh, you don't have to turn on the dreaded wake-up light. How about close the fucking door? Most bathrooms have a fucking door. The lid, Fulbright, provides perfect light for years and years. It's so simple to install. It just took seconds. It was actually easier than changing the toilet paper. The secret is Bulbright's smart motion detection system that automatically turns on when you enter and turns itself off. Why is it shooting him in the groin? Did you see that? Yeah, it was like shooting was like sonic waves, like sonic boom. It's shooting his junk. System that automatically turns junk on attack, you. junk it's attack, off. junk attack. When you leave, it's the light that cares because it knows that you're there. Fulbright is so smart, it even knows whether the lid is up or down. Red if you let the seat up, and green if the seat is down, so you know if it's safe to go. Now, every time when he leaves the seat up, I'll know. Red tells me the lid is. Next time he leaves the seat up, it'll shoot a. It'll shoot lasers. Yeah, it'll shoot his dick off with lasers. <laughs> up. Green tells me it's down. It's safe to sit. Turning the light on in the middle of the night will wake you and everyone else up. But not with Bulbright. It's just enough light to make the bowl bright. Making sure your family sleeps soundly all night. Bulbright is perfect for the master bath, kids bath, any bathroom in the house. I bought one for my mom and dad. And as soon as I saw how well it works, I bought three for me. Just turn the fucking light on in the bathroom, you fucking idiots. What is this shit like? It, it's gonna wake everyone in the house up? Close the fucking door to the bathroom, and then they're like, oh, it's gonna wake you up too. Well, you're obviously already up if you're fucking going to the goddamn bathroom. Fourteen ninety nine plus ninety nine. But handle. to make this the brightest offer on TV, we'll send you a second yep. absolutely Another free. Double That's two Fulbrights for only fourteen ninety nine. This offer is not available in any store, so call now. Is it stupid? <laughs> Oh, so tired. Catching a quick nap hunched over your desk at school or work probably isn't too comfortable. Well, a new product in the works offers hope. Dubbed the Ostrich Pillow, it is designed as a micro-environment, enabling nappers to stick their heads and hands inside a fluffy object and snooze anywhere. At only the price of your dignity. The product description states, Ostrich Pillow God has been designed- <laughs> Like, God seriously. Damn it, humanity, what have you done? <laughs> What if I like piss and like, piss in, like the look, top of that? They're all looking at him. Yeah, everyone's like, like, "What the, the fuck, fuck is doing? that?" The, going they're that crowd. There. They're like, "What's wrong with that guy? Is that guy okay? What, what the fuck's going on?" Yeah, here? What, what's on his head? Is he like a hammerhead shark? Calling like, airport security. Like, uh, there's a crazy guy wearing some kind of f strange fetish mask yeah. or something. You always see some like weirdo at the airport doing something like that too. If you fly, it's just you always see some guy. It's like I have this wacky device that's gonna help me sleep. It's like that doesn't look like it's very comfortable. I got it out of SkyMo. Skyball no longer exists. A little private Whatever. space within a public one to relax and unwind. Designed by Studio KG, the unique pillow was invented with oh, one well, basic idea in mind. I didn't know it was Short developed by Studio KG. I with NASA-inspired technology. Yeah, NASA. Now that I know that Studio KG was involved, I actually think it's pretty cool. Our patent-pending, you know, relaxation system enables you to have, you know, the perfect rest. Anywhere, so anytime. Productivity by thirty percent. Oh, thirty percent! Yeah, wow. For that one year a fucking giant pillow that you wear around your head, so you could sleep at work increases productivity thirty percent. I, I hope we're at the end of it. It's just ridiculous because if this is a real product, it's it is. It is a real product. Oh wow. Yeah, I, I always I always check to make sure that there's like a real website for it. Materials and sizes. They have used Kickstarter for fundraising what? and seem to have done very well so yeah. far. Hold on, what? Be... Hold on, what? Hold on, what? The so Hold on, what? what? I have some, again, okay, if people are still so stupid, they'll fund this. I have some fucking farmland to sell you guys. <laughs> Come on. 
$122,000. Introdu- are you tired of your dick getting cold? Introducing the Dick Microwave. <laughs> a miniature microwave for your dick that heats it up when it gets Studio cold. Before the Dick Microwave, my dick was cold. Now my your dick is hot. Libraries at the office, on a sofa, and even on the floor. <laughs> How do you like the ostrich pillow? If I walk into one of my coworkers and I see them wearing that, I will kill them. <laughs> I would just leave. I'd be like, I have no future here. I am gone. <laughs> All right. So uh, next one here, um, the Wow Cup. The Wow, wow Cup. Wow. wow. Hey, buddy. I've, I've been waiting my entire life to be impressed by a cup, so this Oops. is their chance. Oh, no. When Damn it. Take a sip, their drink cup slips, flips, uh, and They're drops. so obviously knocking them over. It's like, uh, how can I hold a cup? Off the table. Notice the stupid shit is always like in black and white at the beginning. Yeah, it always is. Ad. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take a sip now. Oh god! <laughs> There's gotta be a better way. <laughs> well, now For some reason when I punch my cup in the up. face, it falls. The spill free wow cup. Winner of the prestigious It has a lid! It's the amazing now featuring a lid! Can roll, jump, and spin, and the drink always stays in. It's easy. Just add a favorite beverage, attach the spill free lid, and they're off. Then you can drink anywhere along the rim, just like a regular cup. No more spouts, levers, or caps to worry about. Watch. Using a clear bottom, look how this guy easily gulps down his drink. Then, after he's had enough, it automatically seals itself. Oh. Okay, is this the product we've been missing from our lives? You know, this whole I, time I didn't realize the necessity until now of holding a cup upside down. Yeah, you know, because before, if you held a cup upside down, the liquid would pour out, and there were cups with lids, but you know, so, you couldn't drink from uh, the side. You had to deal with some kind out. of fucking stupid straw or something. And you know, who the fuck wants that you know, mess? This has been a lifelong problem for me, and I'm glad someone's finally had the courage to address it. Amazing! The secret auto sealing technology oh, that auto allows sealing. liquid to flow only when you drink. Once you stop, it forms a watertight seal, guaranteed. Even over this expensive, <laughs> computer, not a single drop of grape juice. Amazing! Mom and Dad will never clean up messy drink spills again or change soaked outfits at the last minute. Wow Cup is BPA free, virtually never indestructible, again. and blocks dirt and debris from ever getting in. Use it to quench thirst on long trips or prevent embarrassing accidents in public places. And it's especially useful during the middle of the night. You couldn't just use a normal cup for that. No, no, you need, you I mean, need assistance. A at least you can see that even though this product is totally unnecessary, at least there is some utility to it. Like, we see some products that just have Yeah, they have, like, remember nothing. The, the jump rope that was uh, just, it no, was just two sticks. But no, the, I think, oh, the, yeah, happy I think the dumbest man, one was yeah. the jump rope with no rope. It's just like you just swing two oh, sticks yeah. around while you jump. It's man, like, I'm, getting this, I'm getting my burn on, man. I feel good. Scotty, uh, your guess as to the price and if there's like a special deal. Oh, or... it's probably really cheap. I'd say like nine ninety nine. You probably like, get a bunch nine, too. Nine, 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 nine. Fourteen ninety nine. Ah, oh, you had to okay. go there. What do you? What about you, TJ? I would say, <coughs> Scotty. I don't know. It's probably around like. <laughs> but if you act now for for only, uh, it's probably like nine ninety nine. But four. I think you probably get like four cups or something. All right, yeah, here we exactly, go. Exactly, they're gonna throw in more. <laughs> Cup and your choice of pink or blue Bam! for only ten dollars. Oh. But wait, order right now and you can double the oh. offer. Nope, That's you only right. get two, you I guess. You can double the offer. The amazing Wow Cup, just ten dollars. This offer is not available in any store, and supplies uh, for this promotion are limited. So, so go online now. Oh, supplies are limited. You guys have figured out how to make people pay ten dollars plus shipping and handling for cups. So That's, congratulations. It, it's, it's a thing of beauty how stupid some people. That's are. the part that makes me say wow. Okay. <laughs> This this next ad, I totally thought was fake. Like, I thought it was fake as fuck, and then I went to the website and confirmed <laughs> that it's real. I don't want to believe it's real, because it's because uh, when I watched it, I got, like, uncomfortable watching it. But uh, so, here, we, here we go. Are you an African-American citizen experiencing money problems that have you stressed out? God, it's a money. And desperate? Before you turn to your family members or one of those sneaky payday lenders, log on to www.moneyforblackpeople.com and let us. Mo money, mo money, mo money. No, this, this is, okay. this is 
not fucking real. It is real. Go it's to moneyforblackpeople.com. No. Money Go to the black people. Please. Please. Go there right no. now. Moneyforblackpeople.com, my brothers and sisters. Louise, this is progress, damn it. We Go finally getting our reparations. Let's help you get the cash that you need. You're smelling we that money. You no matter what your money needs are, whether you're searching for money for rent, Bills, groceries, court fees, municipal. Oh, they had to do. They had to go there, court didn't fees, they? Right. Yeah. They had to go there. Bail money. Bail money. Oh my Come God, on. it's real. Vehicle purchase or return. <laughs> oh, <both laughs> fees. Money for black oh, people. Traffic related fees. Huh? What are they talking about? With general spending cash. We can help you. So go to moneyforblackpeople.com today, so you can get the money that you need, and not only breathe easier, but spend easier. Where the hell is money for white people dot com? Oh god! Racist! Coming! I want well, some uh, money. TJ, we have all the money. Oh no. right, I forgot. TJ is obviously racist, guys. I oh, forgot we just god. have the secret white people oh. vault that we can all access. It's kind of like Jew gold, only we don't have as enough. Check your privilege, man. Check your white man. Check your fucking white privilege. Man privilege. You white man privilege piece of fucking shit. <laughs> all right, next one is called I'm the. I'm talking here, fuck face. <laughs> I'm reading here, fat face. <laughs> Amazing. All right, the next one is called the Wubble Bubble Ball. Red. Wubble Bubble Ball. I want the Wubble Bubble Ball. Wubbles. Wubbles. But is it for black people? Dot com? No. Ball. It looks like a bubble, moves like a bubble, but won't pop like a bubble. <laughs> Even if you sit on it, it's no Holy bubble. Holy shit! Your Wubble Bubble Ball starts out small. Two minutes later, Kill it's it. three feet tall. Made from super thermo stretch spectacular stuff. Super thermo. Super thermo. Awesome, extraordinary, amazing. Did you guys know that su awesome. super thermo was found in the debris at 9/11? Dude, the wubble caused 9 11, man. That's fucking crazy. <sighs> he just blew my fucking mind. We have a bubble just ball. Burst my bubble in the towers, y'all. Just squeeze it, kick it. What about building three, TJ? Can you explain that? Can you explain that? Yeah. Can you explain building three, TJ? Can, can you? Can yeah. you? Loose can change. You? Can you yeah. explain change. building three? Okay, 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 go. Explain. It was it was the little hot dog man or whatever the hell his name was. Uh oh, happy uh, hot dog man. Yeah, it was happy hot dog man. He took down building three. Oh, right? I see. Or building it's six or fly. whatever the fuck it was. Awesome. No, so. I love it. If I would have got this as we a gift as a kid, kid, I would have been like, "This is shit. <laughs> this is shit." Seriously. Better be like, "This yeah. is shit, mom. This is <laughs> shit, dad." Fuck you guys. Inside or out. Listen to that crazy wobble sound. I mean, guaranteed to make your parents go insane. I don't know. I think it'd be kind of cool if you're like six or seven. Do you? Do you right yeah. Out. I, I, this probably product have, uh, I probably would have dug this when I was uh, not in my teens. Yeah. Dude, this could destroy so much property now. It's like, you throw it in your house. Like, oh, dude, this will just bounce everywhere and just knocking shit over. Like, Wubble is awesome. Yeah, just take it into an antique shop. <laughs> parents like, what? Parents like, what have we done? Squishable and squashable. It's even. Doesn't they put a GoPro in it? Yours in red for nineteen ninety nine plus eight. Okay. Nineteen ninety nine. Ordering right now. Scotty, if, if I don't get one of these, I'm gonna cry. That's your birthday present, TJ. A wobble. Well, my birthday's gets, too far away. So. My birthday is close. Directly, All right, Ben, you're get, Ben gets a wobble. Well, no, no, my birthday is in six days, so, so, so I don't have to buy shit for anybody. Yeah, Ben's getting a wobble. Oh, well, you're getting a wobble <laughs> then, buddy. All right. You get a wobble bubble ball, Ben! $8.99 processing and handling. It comes with a portable pump and deflator. It's so durable, it comes with a replacement warranty. Plus, you'll get a second one for even more fun for $8.99 processing and handling. You can log on at wobbleball.com. Batteries not included. Must Oh, batteries for the inflator. Oh, I was like, what the fuck? I'm, I'm picturing people like filling them with batteries and th throwing them around. Oh shit! You know, like. I'm so glad this isn't battery operated. <laughs> yeah. All right, next one. This one is chair dancing. This uh, finally. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to chair dancing through the decades. <laughs> So awesome. I'm Jody Stolove. Hi, Let's Jody. enjoy moves and music for the best of times while okay. we achieve the health and fitness benefits of oh, aerobic yeah. exercise. <laughs> Finally. Sitting down for exercise is ideal in many circumstances. For example, a family can conveniently exercise together at home. 
all generations. And okay, is this like exercise at the nursing home or like what is this? I mean, do you want to exercise but you don't want to move? This is right up your alley, TJ. Yeah, <laughs> well, no, except for I don't want to exercise. I just uh, don't want to move. You know, it does uh, defeat the purpose of just sitting the fuck down. Yeah, you know, if I'm just sitting around, I want to sit around. If I want to exercise, I mean, well, make sure it's actually. TJ's like the South Park episode of Wow. He, he all he does is adjust his glasses and like eat chips. Like, mm. uh, I adjusted my glasses. That's my workout for the day. Enjoy chair dancing for fun and fitness. You can get together and chair dance as a group activity or exercise on your lunch hour at work. Um, chair dancing is also a good program. <laughs> what the fuck? At, at least this guy has an excuse. Looks like he's fucking had yeah, a knee replacement. Him go. For people with a physical or medical yeah. limitation and are more comfortable exercising while sitting down. Wax on, wax off. Down. All you'll need to get started is a chair. And you'll also need two paper plates. We'll show you what they're used for later. Ooh. Chairs Pretty sure. The problem is, like, this entire program, like, if you've seen this commercial, I think you can pretty much figure out what to do. Yeah, you don't really need a program. I don't think you need to, like, buy anything from these people to, to know how to sit in a chair and move your arms around like a moron. No. All right, so we're going to move on. This is the, uh, wear the wearable towel. The wearable towel. Holy shit, a wearable towel? You know what? You want to stay cool. covered after being wet, but your oh, towel fuck just yeah. won't oh. let roast. Fuck yeah, baby. Take oh, it yeah. off. Yeah. They're heavy and hot, and towels uh, and fasteners, uh, I think uh, not. Now there's the wearable. Hi, I like the no, towel. The I think we've watched this before. Did we? Yeah, because this is. Yeah, I remember commenting. I remember it's commenting just on. It's a goddamn dress. I remember commenting on how this was Lee Doran's yeah. music, too. Oh, is okay, yeah, that's you're right. Great. You're that's right, all. it is. Let's move on. Next one. Oh, man, Ben. Oh, man, Ben. Get Back in the day when you were feeling chilled, you could always rely on that oh. soothing hot water bottle. Here, this'll keep you warm. Thanks, yeah. Mom. Problem Shut was, Mom. they got cold too fast. Mom, Mom! Bitch, give me a new hot water bottle! Mom, you stupid bitch! Even worse, they Bathroom! But now... Yeah. No. Hey, honey, your bed's all wet. Uh, the water bottle leaked. <laughs> uh, yeah, it leaked. <laughs> you can have that old world warm. warmth in a totally modern Just way. Spilling water over him. There, you're warm. <laughs> with my little warmers, the amazing new warming packs my that provide warmers. instant warmth and relief with complete convenience. Mm. Look, just press the tab and the soft gel heat crystals activate. You can actually oh. see them warming up to create a soothing heat pack to oh, warm yeah, you up on it. the spot. And they'll even keep you warm for up to six hours. Just press the tab to activate and the special gel rapidly changes color as it releases stored heat. To let you Molecular know, shit happens. 100 degrees to keep your feet warm and comfy while you watch TV, or to warm up a chilly bedroom. Now, John you- Socks. Yeah, no. that's- That would take effort, wouldn't no, it? No, no, what? So socks? What, what the fuck are socks? No, I just- We need my little warmers. Just douse yourself in gasoline and light yourself on fire. Socks. Socks are not, for not, queers. Yeah, not- Quir. Not, not, fucking queers, I Never heard man. of it. You can turn down your thermostat and still beat the chill without raising your heating bill. Help ease the chill. Oh yeah, that'll, that'll make you warm. My little warmers a are tiny little fucking over pouch. Over. Keep them anywhere and they're ready whenever you need them. Warm up chilly sleeping bags when camping. Stay warm when traveling. Take the chill out of those ice cold bleachers. Now available in a variety of soothing shapes. Uh, what? Hold on, hold on. There's a banana shape. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we know which one TJ wants. God, it's TJ, warm it's warm too. Right. Was was that your main complaint about the banana? Was that it was cold? Because this solves that problem, it was my too friend. Cold, but man, yeah, look at you that. can also shove hands and feet up your ass, or I already do, Ben. Or I already do. Liquor flasks. Yeah. Either way, every part of me can be warm, but especially my asshole. Put one in your hat to stay totally warm. Add soothing warmth and relief to a stiff neck and other aches and pains. Oh, yeah, and yeah. keep hunters and outdoorsmen toasty warm. No water, no microwave, no electric, no problem. So why be cold when now? All right, so what do you think the price is? $19.99. $30. Uh, $10. Set up two My oh, Little Warmers for playoff. just $10. It's As a bonus, you'll also get two hands. Yeah. And warmers and two foot warmers. But wait, you'll also get our neck and muscle wrap.
Wow, it just. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <my neck> <laughs> Ooh. It's just, just by separate processing. That means you, you can get all the neck seven wrap? My Lil Warmers for just ten dollars. Sweet. All right. You can be warm anywhere without raising your heating bill. Next one is called the, the house is freezing. Just take the warmer. This is only gonna warm one insignificant part of my body. I'm still freezing elsewhere. Uh, It'll be warm. You will use it. The next one is called the shower wow. The, the shower wow. 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 The sham wow. Wow. The shower wow. The bar wow. Shower now. <laughs> shower wow. I think we did this one too. We're, we're this one. Oh, did we? Damn it, dude. People keep sending me the same People one. People are like, oh. Uh, have we you... seen this one? The TV hat? Yeah, we did that we one. Did this one too. TJ, like, kissed his pants. Ah, uh, yeah. I remember. We've done so many, it's hard to remember. All right, this one yeah. is the no spill chill. Have you heard? I, have I we don't know. That, that doesn't sound familiar. All right, here we go. Uh oh. Look out. Let's face it, getting an ice cube tray to your freezer is like balancing on a tightrope. Uh, <laughs> what? Out with the nose it's, like what? Having, it's like walking in mag like, you know, solid magma. It's like, what? what are these people fucking talking about? Balancing your ice tray is like walking a tightrope. <laughs> Just like crossing the street is like being in a war zone. It's like playing Russian, ru <laughs> it's like playing Russian roulette. <laughs> with a, with a semi-automatic handgun. Yeah. Chill, chill, the revolutionary ice cube tube that's 100% spill-proof. Watch how easy. Just fill the flexible sleeve with water, slide in the ice cube insert, and freeze. Wow, what a breeze. Now look, just pop and the cubes drop directly into the cup. It's that easy. You know, that is kind of cool. I know, I was about to say. I mean, honestly. Yeah, well, that's not, that's damn, yeah. Far, that's... Far from the dumbest ad you've shown. Right. I mean, like, I could actually see utility in this. I probably wouldn't bother, especially not fucking ordering it off TV, but if I saw something like that, I might give it a shot. Right, yeah, you are a regular tray. Go ahead. But you still gotta love that opening line, though, you know, about ice trays. Oh, yeah, it's as hard as a tightrope, man. You fucking can't barely do that. You know? It's like making... Ice. Making eggs for breakfast is like having to return the one ring to Mordor to destroy it because only in the fires of Mount Doom can the ring be destroyed. And it's like, yeah, that's just like cooking eggs, man. That's why you need the fucking Eggatron 9000. Pop and, do any Pop size and drop. Glass. Quickly prepare iced coffee for. Okay, but the next question is is it overpriced? Let's see. I'm going to go with $14.99. You always go with four. Everyone else is guessing. Actual retail price nine ninety nine. You nine, think nine ninety nine? Nine ninety nine. You think you get two of them free or something? Probably. You probably get a, a, at least. You probably get more than one. If you act now, you can probably double the offer or some shit. Heck yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They really love like ho holding shit over a computer. It's like, look, it doesn't drip. See, even your stupid ass can't fuck this up. <laughs> Hey, oh, TJ, you, yeah, you could use that on your ass. Room. So stop splishing and... Oh, I guess it doesn't show the, the price. Oh, that's lame. Yeah, that sucks. Lame. So yeah. there's no way to know. Yeah, I don't see it. Anyway, all right, next one. This hey. is uh, Jewel Views. Jewel Views. For years, reading glasses have been old granny wear that nobody would wear in public. Not anymore. Introducing Jewel Views. The eyewear that's beautiful to wear. Jewel um, sure. They're glasses. It, they start out they're reading glasses. It starts as a necklace that looks horrible and then becomes reading glasses that you have to manually hold up to your face. Um, most people, like, especially women, carry bags of some kind, so they could just, even if they didn't want to wear their reading glasses around, they could just put them in a bag and then retrieve them and then yeah. take them off when they're you know, done. Stop being so efficient. We need to, we need to waste money, goddammit. But We're not wasting money, point. is this really America? It's a beautiful, stylish necklace! And then it transforms into reading glasses! Wow, guys! And this. That's amazing. Transforms into wasted time. You have to reach into your purse and look for your readers. This is great. Why is it great? No one will know What's readers, great about it? Everyone will notice your stunning pendant. Oh, wow. Oh, Girlfriend, what? you look so good. Ooh, that pendant is beautiful. 
You know, I have this one that's like gold and embroidered with all these fancy designs, but you're two cheap, shitty pieces of glass with a weird metal frame around them. That really spellbinds me. Oh. Jewel Views look fantastic with a dinner dress and help you read the menu at dinner. Take Jewel Views shopping to beautifully read price tags, <laughs> ingredients, and receipts without. Women style. be shopping! Yeah. All right. S supernatural scope sound. <laughs> Guesses on price. Too much. Uh, no matter how much it is. Fourteen ninety five. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna a say dollar seven. is too much for this piece of crap. Nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. All right, let's see. Ten dollars. Uh, Ten dollars. Incredibly beautiful. We are going to give you a second pair in crystal clear for an additional fee. You get two pair of Jewel Views for just ten dollars. Call or go online to jewelviews.com. Who the now. fuck came up with this shit? People sit there and they're like, what, you know... What's... I'm an inventor. What will I come up with? Hmm. Reading glasses are pretty, pretty much impossible to carry around, so what if I make a pendant that opens up into reading glasses? And it'll look cheap and shitty, but we'll tell people it looks classy and awesome. All right, we're going to do one more. This is Zippy Straws. Zippy straws. Who wants to take their creativity to the next level? I do. Your creativity to the next level. Me! This guy right here, I want to do it! This Introducing Zippy Straws. Zippy straws are super fun straws you create yourself. If you can think it, you can build it. Just attach your colorful connect. I have, yeah. admit, I have to admit, this does appeal to me. <laughs> this guy's like, I want my shit. It's so all shapes and sizes. For the you could build a boat, a car, a It is brilliant. A Scotty's car. like, I want my straw to be convoluted as fuck. Fucking right I do. I want a hat that's made of my straw. Yeah, I want a fucking hat with straws on it, bitch. The creativity never has to Give stop. Give me that fucking hat. Have your favorite drink and start sipping. You'll love watching your favorite drink travel through your crazy creations. Or watch it, it spin it's, around it's, in your yeah, I'm gonna do those. Bars, you could build a huge truck or a huge tower. And once you're done, just pull them apart and start your next creation. Moms, kids of all ages love their zippy straws. The connectors are made Do from 100%... This seems like it would make a pretty big mess, honestly. Yeah. Like, yeah, as you're pulling it apart, apart, all the liquid that's just stuck the in the different little shot. crevices and Oh, whatever, shit. TJ. You're just spilling out on the kill. table. It's, it's a shame. buzz kill. You're ruining it for the, you're ruining it for the kids. Come Good, on, Remember, TJ. we said so, we need to waste as you. much of our money as possible. Oh, yeah. Recycled rubber and create an airtight It's recycled. So come on. Leak or come apart. There you go, dude. Never leaks. There's never leaks, never asshole. To clean up or worry about. Zippy straws are easy to clean. Just rinse and use again and again. Zippy straws are awesome. I love zippy yeah. straws. Zippy straws are great. I love them. Bye now. I was not paid to say I like these. <laughs> Boat for breakfast, a lizard for lunch, and a dinosaur for dinner. Zippy straws <laughs> make the perfect that holiday, birthday. I was, I know, I was just, I noticed <laughs> that. I'm like drinking out of the dinosaur's dick, man. Dino dick. Pricing on the zippy oh, straw. Nine ninety nine. Death to I'm humanity go, is my price. I'm gonna, go with, I'm gonna say ten dollars because that seems to be the theme. Nine ninety nine. Nine ninety nine. We will also throw a free booklet of 20 fun oh projects. God, you can go book. online to zippystraws.com to get your very own zippy straws. And don't forget the zippy to ask straw your is awesome. special discounts for birthday parties. Must oh, be 18 years wow. older to order. Zippy straws. Oh. oh, you know what? It didn't show the. Hold on. All of this for ten dollars if you call yep. or oh, yeah. ten dollars. Ten. You son of a bitch. Ten dollars. Oh. La 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 zippy straws. Zippy straws. La 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 zippy straws. I'd like you to come with me on a little tour of a town called Muscle Town. Now the good Diggly. people of Muscle Town, Muscletown. they want to get <laughs> Jack. I love Muscle Town. And that's freaking awesome. Yeah. Let's see how they're going about doing it. Here in Muscle Town, everything's a workout. But working out isn't everything. All the exercise in the world isn't going to make a difference if you aren't eating right. That's true. I looked this up to confirm that this is real, too. <laughs> He's not eating right. What the fuck? While we're touring, let me tell you a bit about this beautiful planet of ours. By the year 2050, the Earth's population will have reached 9 billion people. Come on. Wow, Livestock that production guy is takes up nearly 50% of America's land mass. You know what doesn't need much land? A cricket. So we eat crickets. If we don't start making some changes in the way we live, soon there'll be no room left in this world for our sweet muscles. 
Nope. Okay. Nope. Oh, hello. This fellow's getting his swipe on and his swell on. Okay. Yeah. What the fuck is this? I don't know. What is this advertising? What am I supposed to be buying here? I think workout shit. Or they require like... 2,000 times less water. And they oh. require 12 times less feed. Sweet. I know. They're like, they want you to eat the crickets. I know what you're probably thinking. There's no way crickets can taste good. Well. good. It's like some sort of supplement or something <laughs> made crickets. out of crickets. Crickets. Paid, en paid endorsement. It's good. You can argue with that guy? Yeah. I, I, why not? Why wouldn't I? Oh. Crickets are the number one ingredient in crick nutrition. Good for you, good for the planet, good for the taste buds. <clears throat> Just cricket. Okay. Hi, uh, I'm Alex Dreisel, I'm, founder of Crick okay. Nutrition. I've been in the health and fitness. Okay, so you made this product and you thought that this was a good commercial to advertise your fucking product. It's like they wanted that zany random ad feel, but they just could not even come close to pulling it off. Yeah, it, it's just it's, awkward yeah, it's and slow. Really bad. They should have spent more money on like a professional video production if they wanted to try to pull something like this off and make it funny or even make it work well, at all. Well, how much money can they really scrape together? They're selling cricket guts. I mean... Well, a lot of people put together better ads. I mean, they most people nowadays they just do Kickstarter or they do, uh, you know Indiegogo and they get you know fifty thousand dollars for some revolutionary product. Oh, we're gonna save the planet! You know, there's so many different angles they could have approached this that would have made more sense and appealed to more people. Okay, but most people are not selling a product that literally when you tell people on the street like, hey. Like if I if I'm on the streets and I'm giving out like samples of like crickets, like, hey guys, you want you want to try this cricket? It's good, you know. You know, you wouldn't think they'd be good, but they are. I mean, like some people would probably try them. Like most people would be like on a dare or something. And I mean, are there different markets that feel differently about this that they might be more successful in? Maybe. You it's know? my entire life, and when I first heard the benefits of eating crickets, they almost seemed too good to be true. I went out to try and find a cricket-based protein powder, but nothing existed. So I made so it. So I made one. <laughs> wow. <laughs> when developing this product, I had three main goals in mind. It had to be good for you, good for the planet, and also... And we had to have a shitty commercial that was... Yeah, shitty commercial was number fuck. four. So it tastes great. Now that I've achieved all this, I need your help in bringing this innovative product to market. Oh, but back okay. Your project, so this is the th kickstarting th This thing. is their Kickstarter pitch. Okay, well, there you go. Yeah, we want to sell cricket guts to people. This going to be good. It tastes good. Don't worry. Yeah. You're going to help us raise this the funds be really popular. There's, there's, there's already plenty of sources of protein of our that are not based on animals to begin with, so I don't understand the need Let for Let alone this. crickets. Yeah. Or and like remember, large animals, rather. Every little bit counts. Even sharing this on your social media or telling friends and family. All right, so we're going to move on. Uh, crickets. This next one isn't a product. It's a, it's a commercial, um, I believe, made by a religious organization. Sweet. I think Catholics. These people are respectable, so whatever they have I to say. I am a little bit nervous about people um, kind of hearing that I am this way and then thinking, um, uh, well, sh you know, she's not welcome here. <laughs> I would say. What way are you? <laughs> We're all different. Catholic? What? Yeah, I think most so. Most people probably think I'm already weird anyway, so I mean, I don't think society's impression of me is going to change drastically based on one or two discoveries that come to light after this video or pretty scary you know you, you wonder how many people can i really truly honestly be open with i've tried to change this before but it's too important to me yeah yeah so at wow. this point they haven't revealed what they're talking about yet you think it's actually something important <laughs> I actually think marriage is between a man and a woman. I believe that marriage is between a man and a woman. I already have an idea of what marriage should be. That will never change. At the end of the day, I think we don't need to truly be ashamed of how we really feel about things. So. Okay, once again, for the 12 trillionth fucking time, if you believe that marriage is between a man and a woman, that's fine. You have fun with that. Just don't try to impose your definition on everyone else. Be you. No one should be looked down upon. No one should be suppressed or no one's views. 
Um, no uh, one should be looked down upon. You're no one the should one be who are trying. You're. Oh my fucking what god! Happened? I just can't fucking fathom the stupidity of these fucking morons. I'm sorry. It's just so fun. They're fucking so dumb. How can they be this dumb? Do they hear what they're saying? It's like, look, I'm a fucking bigot who doesn't want other people to be able to get married, and if you, if you don't understand that, then you're being bigoted against my bigotry. And I'm actually the fucking one who's looked down on and, and oppressed. I know a lot of people who are gay. I have friends who oh, are God. gay. Oh, God. Oh, fuck I know them. They're good, they're but they're going to hell. I love them. What I, I love feel them. insecure about is... Speaking from the heart and Speak from being the heart. really open and honest about what I believe. I mean, I uh -huh. love my friends. Several of them happen to be gay. Oh How my would God. it not be the case that the ever loving creator who gave us everything we have doesn't love us? Where's that balance? You know, where can you say no? Okay, the music is like getting louder than the yeah. people talking. Yeah, and they're say, "Well, that's actually kind of a blessing, though." So, yeah. So this is this stupid fucking commercial. Uh -huh. All right. So moving on. Here's an actual product. It's called Easy Feet. Easy Feet. How do you clean your feet? You I don't bend, know. stretch, and you can't reach. God, Keeping your tired feet looking young is There's such a chore, be but not way. anymore. Be a better way. This is Easy Feet. A Finally, <laughs> yes. That does not look. It's like it looks like spikes. It's like Evolution put some spikes into your fucking a feet. Foot massage every day. <laughs> it's like it does not look like a massage. It looks terrible. <laughs> it's like a fucking vice grip. It's like put your feet through the vice grip. It's like ah, Easy what are you doing has to over me? Easy feet. One thousand rejuvenating bristles to gently massage it also, and it clean. It almost looks dirty in a way. Uh, like, uh, 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 yeah. And even uh, has a built-in. I bet you hummus. Quentin Tarantino like makes women put their feet in this for him. He's like, oh yeah. Uh, Easy feet, the best heels. fetish for so I me. Mean, yeah. Ugly, dry skin. Oh, a thing yeah, of the rub past. your feet on this, Easy Uma. Easy feet makes me feel a lot more confident when wearing my strappy shoes. Uh, she's she wasn't... British. She sounds fancy, so she wasn't confident. She before. must be. She must know what she's talking about. She knows. She knows, man. Come on. Easy feet will literally change the oh, way yeah. you bathe forever. <laughs> literally, Easy feet's oh, unique yeah. design not only cleans your, your feet, foot in there. but oh, massages yeah. and gently exfoliates. And oh, yeah, eliminates exfoliate. dirt. And most importantly, Easy Feet cleans in between oh, yeah, clean, your toes. Clean those toes. It's Finally. great because you don't have to bend over and worry about slipping yeah. and falling. Oh, yeah. I Here's the real message. You shouldn't have to bend over. These yeah, old no. people who can't fucking... Uh, so they gotta fucking get the Easy Feet. Great it feels on my feet. Easy Feet is on We're automatized. Just secure Easy Feet to <coughs> any smooth shower. So how much do you think it's gonna cost? Twelve billion dollars and fifty eight cents. I'm gonna go with nine ninety five. Nine ninety five. Stevie, do you have a guess? I'm gonna go on the higher end, nineteen ninety five. Wow, nineteen ninety five. And and any special offers or anything like that? Probably just get like yeah, probably if buy, you buy one, one, get like Yeah, just two, pay processing three. handling. All right, here we go. Where is it? I don't know. God, this thing's so fucking long. It's like we already know what it can do. Oh, you get two easy feet. Four. Yeah. Easy feet for only fourteen ninety nine. Oh, this we're double fourteen ninety nine. I think that was my guess. Offer yeah, won't last sure. long, no so call now. Yeah, 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 that, 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 this is my favorite one. Clean your toes. Gotcha. I wonder if foot fetishists are watching this commercial. Like, oh, oh God. yeah, yeah. Those feet are dirty. Ooh. God, they're dirty. Ooh. Well, then they'll enjoy the next one because this one's called Foot Angel. Ooh. Oh, sweet. I think Ben might have a foot fetish. Damn. Suffer from aching heels and feet? Is yeah, stepping out of bed in the morning torture? Plantar yeah, fasciitis. Sure. Heel spurs and achy feet can all make it time. impossible to life. take all another day, every step. Day. Introducing Foot, foot often Angel, red. the revolutionary compression foot sleep with seven different with zones that provide yeah. soothing <laughs> relief for the foot and heel. Watch. Just slip on Foot Angel for instance. What? Uh, hold on. What does it do that's better than a sock? Is it a uh, brace? Well, hold on, Ben. Look, it's it doesn't have a brace. Yeah, it doesn't have the end of a sock. So it's uh, all day know. support. Support that lasts all day. Oh, Look, yeah. everyday activity can cause sore, throbbing feet and swelling. Ah, but Foot Angel's oh, heavenly foot seven angel. zone design oh, provides heavenly. targeted oh, compression seven to the zones of like, God, I touch my foot. And ankle for soothing relief. Yeah, it's foot like angel. God Himself came down and touched your foot and healed it of its maladies. <laughs> 
support your feet, stimulate circulation, and reduce swelling. Lightweight and comfortable, wear them discreetly under socks or hosiery. Discreetly. And with any shoes, sneakers, or boots. Even sleep with Foot Angel and step out of bed with ease. Ah. All right, so what's your guess? Oh, uh, this is going to be more. Probably uh, 1999. I'm going with Scotty. 2250. There's no way. 2250. Oh. A double offer. In handling. As a bonus, we'll also send you the AccuPressure Massage Ball. Pack. Absolutely free. Enjoy a soothing, energizing foot massage. It's like a, it's like a, toy. Yeah, it's like a to chew toy for a dog. Feet. And Foot Angel comes with a 60-day oh, money-back money guarantee. Back guarantee. That's wow. two Foot Angels. And Twelve ninety-nine. Oh. They're throwing you for a loop tonight. Oh. That's what I said. Twelve ninety-nine. Tired of tugging and loving your hose? Yes! Fucking bullshit! Everyone knows you it. need the X-Hose, the incredible expanding hose. Oh. Oh. Watch this. Turn the water on and the X-Hose Oh my god, it's amazing! It's alive! Turn the water off and as the water oh. drains, the X-Hose oh. automatically converts back this. in just seconds. Say what? Amazing. Take my money. Ordinary just fishing. take my fucking take money. Take your fucking money. I'll pay a thousand dollars for one of these. This is amazing. Twenty thousand. I don't almost, give a shit. Any amount of money you need, bank, I'll fucking get. Empty my bank. Sell my stocks. It. Everything. Empty my retirement account. This is all going. It this. almost like gets an erection, doesn't it? Oh my god! If I had to kill Scotty <laughs> to get one of these fucking hoses, I'd do it without hesitation. I'll fucking kill today now for fucking hose. You're dead. <laughs> oh shit! It's happening again. Give me the hose. Give me the hose. No! Ah! No, no. He's dead. He needs, he needs to Give be me the oh, no. You're fucking up my mic, Scotty. It, it's Scotty on roids. Yes. I thought so. Scotty's having roid rage. He's, he's on yeah. ve No, no, no. Scotty's having vegan rage. You, uh, <laughs> if you, if you insult veganism around Scotty, he's like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Don't insult it around me, or I'll kill you. Uh -huh. we, I kill humans, we were, not other animals. We were in the car and we were fucking with him. And we said a few <laughs> things. He's like, when Scotty starts screaming, you know he's pissed off. <laughs> yeah, right. So, how much do we think this is, by the way? Oh. Oh, $1,000 at least. I would, uh, at least $2,000 is my guess. I'm going to go a bit lower. I'm going to go for $99.99. That is a good what? guess as well. You're crazy. What do you think, Ben? Ben? Uh, twenty nine ninety nine. Wow. Wow. Yeah. This is amazing. Thousand bucks, so. guys. Two thousand dollars. One thousand dollars. The actual retail price $1. is one dollar. One dollar, Bob. Nine ninety nine. You've got the fucking keyboard. Dude. Oh yeah, I do. <laughs> fucking hoses idiot. Are so heavy. The so X hose heavy. is incredibly oh, light. Yeah. A fifty foot <laughs> X hose. These dumb kids can light. use it. Watering your plow now to get the amazing oh, X hose oh, for only nineteen ninety five. It's incredibly and light. Four cents we'll off. Sorry, not even close. I'm gonna fucking buy twenty of these right now. U.S. and international I'm pet. Pretty it sure I was be. closest because they mine began with a one and so does this. Oh, uh, you went over. That's though. how it works. Yeah, that's how it works. Yeah, you went over, don't you? Just no, I don't think so. You're wrong. Closest price without going over. No, that's not how it works. That is how it works on the Price Is Right. No, we're not. This is it. The Price Is Right. Drunk and fucking peasant. Come on, do you, do you, do you. I, I decide what the rules are, bitch. Shit. Yeah, I lay down Sorry, the law. Ben lays down yep. the law. Anyway, um. Next one here. Fantastic cap. Sweet. Wow. What's one of these? You want to stay cool when you're feeling hot, but when it's so bright and sunny, don't you, hate you when don't the world's have black a shot. And, white and you can't Canning do simple things. Will leave you so tired so and hot. Beat, so you're forced to sweat and suffer in the sweltering heat. That's well, there's got to be a better the way. There is a better way. It's called get the fuck inside when cool, there's air conditioning. No matter how hot it gets. That's because Fantastic what? Cap has a... <laughs> yeah! <laughs> so it's environmentally what? friendly. <laughs> what the fuck? I'd buy it. Looks good to me. I never go outside, so I wouldn't buy one. Yeah. <laughs> I agree with that well, statement. Keep, it can even keep you cool inside. That's it's what air conditioning's for. Might it. you cheap, probably cheaper than air conditioning, huh? Yeah. Wouldn't you get, like, a tan, like, imprint on your forehead? No. From the sun it's shining worth, through the hole? It. It's worth the risk. It's worth, worth, worth looking like a twat. <laughs> Once you realize how comfortable this fucking hat is, it's solar powered. Come solar on. Power it's worth the price right of looking like a doofus. And it converts the sun's heat into a cooling breeze, so you can enjoy the day. Uh -huh, because golfing. now the same sun. Oh my God! If I saw someone wearing this, I would laugh my I ass wish, off. I wish. I wish I would see someone wearing this. That'd be so great. <laughs> <sighs> 
Ask me, are you feeling fantastic today? <laughs> fantastic. Too hot will power the fan that keeps you cool and comfortable. Fantastic Cap is perfect at the beach oh, or yeah. when you're oh, out in the backyard. Hey, Scotty. You have no dignity. Hey, hey Scotty. Are you a uh, fan of the fantastic? <laughs> oh, yeah, I totally <laughs> how, much, how much is the fantastic cap? Uh, $29.95. Anything less than that is a joke. Um, we go for 9.99. We go for really low price. Oh. Wow! It's actually it's free, but then you're haunted by the phantom. So. 14.95. Oh. 14.95. The actual retail price is. Stay cool and comfortable. Oh my God! It just like loops. <laughs> as a man Wait having a, a stroke there, as far as there I was tell. some fat. Oh! Really? <laughs> Got it! Got it! Hey, you watched it before. No, yeah. I didn't. I didn't. I you seriously did. didn't. Go back, though. There was a fat dude in black and white no, walking no, down no, the beach. Come on. No, no. I seriously did not Ben know watched it. Ah, Scotty, it. Scotty will never... It. I want to see the fat guy. Anytime ben Scotty loses, it. someone has an unfair ben advantage. Ben watched it. Yeah, Ben watched this video several times. Wait, Anytime oh, Scotty loses, I this video. there's always an unfair advantage. There is. <laughs> Hashtag the controversy. I never actually lose legitimately. Hashtag <laughs> did Ben know. Uh, you, did you Ben know. You just spammed it. You spammed it, Ben. You spammed it. You spam it. watch this video, Ben. When when Scotty loses in fighting games, it's just because someone spammed yes. the move. If I spam, it's okay, though. <laughs> I thought there was no other way of playing fighting games other than to just do the one combo you know repeatedly. Yeah, yeah, for most people that is true. <laughs> I, I suck at playing games, if I really need. I'm not too great, but they I... are just button mashers for, I, for I, most people. I purchased tokens for the new Mortal Kombat game just so I could do the fatalities without having to know anything. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know you could do that. Yeah, you can. Sweet. All right, so next one is the car cane. Car cane. Have you ever struggled to get out of the car? Shouldn't this part oh, be in black and white? Pain make it hard? Do you push with your arm when you try to stand? Or yeah. ask someone to give you a hand? No. Oh, God. The, Should the... you even be in a fucking car? Would you eat out? it in a box? Would you eat it with a fox? <laughs> yeah. Would you eat it here? <laughs> that's, you eat it there? that's what it sounds like. <laughs> Dr. Seuss's yeah. less talented son wrote the copy. Then let us help you out with the incredible new car cane. Uh, now you can get in and out wait. of your car with ease. This new portable handle locks what instantly the? into the uh, door latches of any car. Simply open your door and so wait snap it on. So you reasonably think that people are just going to, like, carry this around. I guess you could have it in your car. Yeah. But in the UK, that would be deemed an offensive weapon, and you'd be arrested and tased on site. Wow. <laughs> I'm <joking. Yeah. laughs> Tase him. Tase him. Carcane locks into place and will not move. In fact, Carcane's forged steel construction <laughs> can hold 350 pounds. Amazing. Then, Carcane unlocks and stores away easily in the door or glove box. Right. If you are recovering from an injury or suffer from back pain, knee pain, or hip pain, I'm you say need the Carcane. And with 9.99, TJ. 4.95. I'm gonna say you get fucking two of the stupid things, and just pay separate processing and handling. Fucking fourteen ninety nine. Fourteen ninety nine. I'm gonna go with fourteen ninety five again. Oh shit, TJ. Ah, uh, Ben looked again. Piece Fuck of shit. You, man. He knows everything. He's got them written down on the back of his hand, haven't you, Ben? Yeah, I do. Now has a built-in flashlight. Finally. I do. There's a built-in flashlight for this, TJ. Flashlight? Oh, 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 1995. Oh, you don't even get two either. Plus processing and handling on this, this is exclusive a real fucking TV rip -off. offer. But wait, call wait. and get the amazing swivel uh, seat free. What? Just pay <laughs> separate processing and handling. I need this the swivel seat. Home cushion uses Fuck that! I want to buy the swivel seat. Is that a fucking like? Isn't that what you sit on after you've had like yes. ass surgery yes, or something? It pretty much is. It's one of the Dude, little I'm buying the swivel seat. It's one of the little hemorrhoid seats. <laughs> but it swivels because, you know, it's impossible to turn your body in your car. Cut out Can't do to it. reduce pressure and provide a soft seat for the driver or passenger. And when it's time to get oh, out, so it pivots and horrible. turns for an easy exit. You get them both. The car cane. All right. And the swivel seat. I think this commercial is not even selling the car cane. I think it's really just selling the swivel seat for people who have hemorrhoids but are too embarrassed to actually just yeah. go to a store and buy the little seat. Oh, this this next one is probably the best one we've ever shown. Okay. Well, don't build it up too much, Ben. 
Twinkle Tush. Twinkle Tush. Twinkle Tush. Twinkle Tush. I don't know who likes to show no sparkle on their plate below. My dunk a dunk. It's, it's jewelry to cover your, your pet's asshole. Finally. <laughs> This That's is a what product like the world. Are, are people really being that for. bothered by cat yeah. assholes? It's, it's a real I problem, am. TJ. You don't understand. <laughs> so is it that they like are so disgusted by the asshole that they're like, ugh? Yes. It's, or is it that like, they're they're so enticed by the asshole get, they just need something something to cover it? You when know? a lot yeah. of animals get shit all over this. When Lori McBride is around, you know. It's like it's like bestiality prevention device. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh, that sexy cat If ass. only and then Spot like, had been wearing one of these, yes. Brent yeah. Spiner yeah. never would have raped him. him. He would have saved and saved. And by the way, I don't know if you saw, but in another episode it was revealed that Brent Spiner's cock was like 18.7 inches yeah. or something. Well, so I've not seen that must have been one like, miraculous cat. You've never seen Brent Spiner's cock? He I is have. coming. Uh, he is coming to Comic Con yeah, in he, Columbus. He's gonna show us his cock. Uh, and it, we're gonna go to another Star Trek convention, and TJ is convinced yeah, I, that he'll he'll sleep with Jerry plan. Ryan. Oh, you did? Yeah, yeah, I watched your your private show. I think it was your private show. You talked about that, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah. 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 Anyway, you guys can visit twinkletush.com. Yeah, I guess. I don't know those. what the price is. I don't think they said it yeah, in this video. Yeah, they don't video. say the commercial. Anything, um, any, any amount of money would be worthwhile for that. <laughs> it's, like a, it's like a rape trap for cats. So, yeah, <laughs> but TJ is convinced that Jerry Ryan will be his. Yep. So, TJ, how are you going to get her exactly? What, yeah. What's going to happen? Are you going to show up and be like, I'm here? Yeah, hey, Jerry. Look at me. I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. She's gonna be. There's probably gonna be a line of people, and I'll just like go to the front and push like the whoever's there out of the way. I'll wait till it's someone really weak, so I can look really impressive. The 98 pound weakling. Then I'll slam my fist down on the table. It's like, all right, Jerry, I'm here. You want to do this shit or not? And then you know. You know what you did? Five minutes did. later, we're back in my hotel. You know what you did? If you do that, I'll be happy to film it. Okay. <laughs> I, I would love to see that. That would be. YouTube gold. He wouldn't do it. He's a pussy. Next one is card lock. Yeah, yeah. Uh, TJ didn't even want to go to the banana bar. No. But that's a banana whole bar scare me. <laughs> <laughs> card lock. Did you know criminals use scanners like this to steal credit card nice. information really? right out of thin air? But now these wireless pickpockets can be stopped with card lock. Card Simply lock. slide okay. your it's credit a, or debit. Yeah. yeah, it's a wallet. It's a wallet. <laughs> the box <laughs> RFID <laughs> signals. Now Who it's virtually. No, it goes in your wallet. See? It's well, different. yeah. Well, oh, it's, it's, a, it's a little wallet. It's a little wallet that goes in your big wallet and protects oh, wow. your card from magic air beams. Possible for anyone to steal your information. Unless they just knock you out and scan take your it. bank information from your purse or pocket when you walk beep, by. Beep. Then they Get can that steal bitch. your identity Bad. and slip your credit well, cards into card lock, and it protects so you. What? I like how he's got like an old baseball cap and like a flannel shirt and a ponytail. Yeah, it's like, oh, I'm a criminal. From credit card fraud and identity theft. Frequency blocking oh, polymers. Oh, you thought I'd get it, but you couldn't. Science, frequency blocking polymers. Frequency so woven right into the polymers, threads of the card baby. lock. Don't be a willing victim when it's so easy to stop. Don't be a willing lock. victim? Call and get so if you don't buy this, you're choosing to so be a victim. What do you think, Jay? I'm saying 1495. Oh, my God. If this is 1495. It's definitely going to be a double an offer, too. Probably, like, just pay uh, separate processing hands. I don't know. I fucking... 1999. Yeah, I'd say I'd say nine I'd say ninety nine. I'd say nineteen ninety five. I'm gonna say like nine ninety nine. Nine ninety nine. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. Oh, that's what you went over, TJ. But wait, I order go now. Over. We'll How do I go over ten? Over, Absolutely. Nine ninety nine is over, over, over ten. Do you get piece four? Of shit. Went over. Do you get four? Oh, you get four. four, oh, you get four. Bucks, yeah. I would say it's two fifty. And there's then. more. All of today's orders get shipped to you for free. Well, thank get you. card lock for just ten dollars. Call now. You know, you know that would actually actual be a pretty one. good deal if their product wasn't completely worthless. Well, it's not worthless, but I mean, it's, it is worthless. It's unlikely that it will ever happen. It's to worthless. You. You're a piece of shit. It's worthless. But it could happen to you. People get their, their credit card skimmed all the time. It's not even ah, true. So what? So uh, bunch of fucking pussies. So fucking Rover what? loves to play, but he ends up filthy from the day. You're Bathing filthy, Rover. A and what, <laughs> what a mess. fuck? Who fucking tries to wash their dog like that? The oh wow! Hell. No. <laughs> oh Did no they, way. Do you fucking? Do you idiots even know how dogs work? Come on. 
I know she's chasing the dog in the yard with the hose. But then when she has this, he's totally comfortable. Like, Alright. He, he loves it. It's like a, it's like, it's like a bun <laughs> Dude, no dog would fucking love this. This would terrify a dog. Washing system that washes your dog well, in obviously less not than this one. one minute. Guaranteed. Watch. I notice they, they don't show his face while that's happening, though. Your hose. And so, <laughs> his face. Slip the hoop on your agony. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, I'll tell the dog rat. That dog, dog is like... Slide to that dog, oh, oh, no. Open water. No, no they won't do it. Someone is holding the dog's head, for yep. sure. Someone's holding <laughs> Never him. see the dog's face. What is going on? Creating a sudsy oh, there we go. That scrubs uh, Rover clean from head to toe. Doesn't look like the water pressure is enough to me. And one for rinse. The secret is the 360 secret. degree design. The secret? The secret. Because <laughs> the secret. <laughs> it's a hula hoop with holes in it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pending. I'm pending, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> A ring of water jets gently spray your dog your for 360 like, degrees Scooby of clean. Amazing. No, he doesn't have Scooby-Doo spots. Oh, okay. But Wolf Washer 360's gentle spray Wolf washer. feels like a soothing massage for your pet. I'm going to say yep. 2995. I'm going to say 1999. Yeah, 1999, yeah. That seems like the price. 1495. Oh, Ben's seen it. Yeah, Ben's seen it. Ben's seen it. Every, every dog every will dog love, it. love it. I call bullshit. Every dog. If I, if I try to do this to my dog, oh, here we go. Oh. We, oh, no, no, no. This is no, we, this, this, not $50. Uh, we it's could charge you $50. Service. Now get Wolf Washer 360, starting at $19. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's, with, two sizes, it's with 70 it's with $7.95 dollars. Dollars shipping. Well, fuck, it doesn't matter. As a bonus, you get the Wolf Washer 360 oh. microfiber quick drying mitt to dry your pup even faster. Yes. You get it all. So call you and get it all, ben. now. Neat. I'm buying one. Wolf Washer. Wait, <laughs> not, yeah. not not for my dog though, for TJ. Scotty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I I was like I was like TJ. Why don't we make a challenge for you? When we go on vacation, you have to shower every day. <laughs> he also said, even though we're going to Las Vegas, he also said it's gonna like, be 115 degrees. No, by the way, he told us. It, it, I was like, okay, so what if what, what if a place is like two tenths of a mile away? It would take you like a few minutes to walk there. Yeah, I take a cab. I'm like, but what if there was a line? It would just be faster. Like, no, I take a cab. So you'd rather wait longer to take a cab and pay money when you can just walk. Yeah, too hot. Too hot, Scotty. Because initially we were talking about Ben's like, yeah, from where we're staying to there, yeah, that's that's too far to walk. And she's like, yeah, but anywhere, just have to take a cab anywhere. That's what I've always done when I've been in Vegas in the past. You're so fucking lazy, DJ. Yeah. I don't walk. I don't fucking walk. I don't do that. I hover. I'm tired. I wish I could hover. That'd be sweet. <laughs> just be like a floating fat ass. All right, so the next one is the Buddha board. The, the Buddha, Buddha board. board. Yes. You meditate on this board. Live in the moment with the Buddha board portable painting set. Okay. With just a bit of water, each stroke appears like black ink. Similar to watercolor painting, the medium produces soft, beautiful images. Then it's similar the water to watercolors, evaporate. except you know, no colors. Fades away to a blank canvas. With the mentality so no matter what you Buddhist, paint, it goes away. Pictures on a whim, without concern. It's all black to too. It appears. Yeah, Mr. Smith, my D-bag boss, tells me the whole proposal, and I have to start completely over with a, a clean slate. Mr. Smith, uh, how can I help you, sir? Hey, Thompson. Should we take a look at what you're working <laughs> that on? Evil, that evil <laughs> oh, no. Uh -huh. What am I working on? We're oh, working God. on Thompson. What if he sees what I did on the Buddha board? Oh, no, it's fading away. Will it fade on time? A clean slate. Good man, Thompson. You've got the championship attitude this company needs. I fucking hate wow. this man so much. <laughs> Worst like, acting of all track. time. <laughs> good job, Thompson. Old pat on the back. I thought it was pretty good. I don't know if he's, because uh, this isn't an infomercial, so I don't think we'll get a price on this one. VAT19, dude. Whatever that is. That's how much yeah, that's it costs. That's the website that sells it. VAT19.com. They, they want 19 VATs. No. That's the price. This is called... Oh, uh, of your blood. Rapidu. Rapidu!
to do is a plush hair wrap designed for hair drying that stays securely in place on your head. Or you could it use a towel. It looks like a turban when you have it on. <gasps> Feels comfortable and the will stay put. Team. I you, tested you this at home too. and found that it dried my hair more quickly than my towels did. And it wow, made them ready that much It dries it more really. quickly though, TJ. More quickly than the towel. Well, she, a lot of people are under pressure nowadays. They don't have time to fiddle fuck with the towel. This is a great revolutionary towel product. Towel took 10 this minutes This is revolutionizing the way people this can dry their hair. hair. Nine minutes and what, 50 why seconds. Why do we use towels at all when we could be using this on every part of our bodies? Yes. If it's faster. Yeah, why don't, we, why don't we just make towels out of the same material as that? Because How did towels catch up in the first place? What the fuck? This is yeah, really yeah, they're obsolete. Fuck. They're like the fucking telegraph at this point. Fuck towels. Horse and buggy. It goes on easily and eliminates the need to flip your head upside down. So if you don't know this is what almost the like, what the fuck? Yeah, that's too hard to do. How is too much? How can we even do it? I can't even. Ah, it's ah, like impossible. Ow, I struggle with on. this every day, every day of my life. Me too. You go, and I have short hair, but I struggle See with this. See this right here? That is the most delicate. The that one spot's gonna still be wet. What we the fuck are we gonna do? We need to be treated as it is, which is delicately. Treat so it delicate. So rapidly, simply go straight on right. the top of your head, much like oh. a hoodie. Look. Just straight on. Wow. It's like some crazy cap you'd wear in like <laughs> yeah. a cult. Or <laughs> I know. She, she's a cultist. She looks like, I am the grand priestess. Yeah. <laughs> Have you brought me tribute? <laughs> then back here you take the Velcro wings and you simply attach them. Simply. To your head so it fits you exactly. She's a fucking smurf. La 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 la. Now if you have curly ethnic or artificial hair. Don't be having that ethnic Don't have hair ethnic now. Ethnic hair. Stop having ethnic yeah. hair, TJ. If you got that ethnic hair, you can't buy this. It'll make that fall right the fuck off. You probably need to leave your hair down like this. This is a cocoon of terry cloth inside. So oh, all you have to do is cocoon. So your hair can emerge as a proud butterfly. Oh my fucking Excess god. Water. Now oh, I actually like to pull the, the butterfly. Uh, tail up. And simply I, like, I like the little fashion the thing on the front. Is that? Is that? Oh, is, 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 is that? Yeah, oh, no, it's, it's like it's sorry, it's a hook on. Sorry, I thought it was like a, like a gemstone or some shit. It, like, yeah, they case, made it look like one. In case you're one. a company and you're wearing this in your head, and you don't look like a total fucking idiot. Yeah, it's like, see, there's this. This is classy. It's got a little fucking shitty plastic gem on it. It's cool. Mm -hmm. I look like a sophisticate. About my morning routine. So besides Ooh. the elimination of the head flip, which is great for baby boomers <laughs> or anybody so who has a hard time. Um, with pain in their neck or headaches, you've got two fabrics, the inside two of being them. absorbent terry cloth to sort of extract all that water. And wow, look at how that water is, is extracted by that terry cloth. Then this is fucking riveting shit, dude. This bitch puts this thing on her head and it dries it. Cool. It's the way best better than you, you way better than a fucking TV. towel uh, ever could. All right. Fuck you, towels. Next one. Think you're hot shit? You ain't fucking shit compared to the fucking whatever this thing is. This one, this next one's called the window bully. The window bully. The yeah. window bully. Fuck you, window. Here for the window bully. Hold Get on. New... Is this is this like the bald Willie Mays? Yep. Yeah. Universal lock for sliding windows and glass doors. I was wondering when the Jesuits were going to clone Billy Mays. Bald is beautiful. And, and they have. <laughs> so was this, uh, uh, this looks like a security thing. Yes. Yes. You can let the fresh air in. Keep the bad guys out. Yeah. I can't like open it. The fucking Unabomber from the 80s is like yeah. trying to break in there and shit. <laughs> I can't break glass because, you know, shit, it's just too strong. Child your homes and create instant pet doors. Neat. Installing window bully is a breeze. Just peel, stick, and lock. It's that easy. Window bully's patented track and lock system allows for three different settings: fully locked, sort of locked, partially open to allow in the breeze, or completely off to open your window all the way up. Window Bully works on horizontal windows. That is windows. so incredibly fucking useful, and I don't know how I survived in my life without it until this point. Any guesses now? Look how he's like, yeah, he looks like he's getting his dick sucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> <laughs> Screenshot. <laughs> fucking shit <eating> grin. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that's, how, that's how it feels owning Window Bully. Yeah. It's like getting your dick sucked every time you pull on a window. Yeah. Oh. I don't know, what do you think, TJ? 9 dollars I, I reckon 9 99 for three. You gotta blow him to get it. That's what oh, I think okay. the price is. That's I'll why, say, that's why it's showing this. I'll save uh, 
Fourteen ninety five. Oh, three. Ben's thinking fourteen ninety five again. I've been wrong so many times. I I seriously got the first one right. It was total luck. You but watched it. No, I Ladies didn't. and gentlemen, why have I been wrong? Why have I watched it? Why Why have I been wrong every other time? To cover your to cover trash. Oh. oh. Wow. Damn. Nineteen ninety five. We were all wrong. I thought it was gonna be a blowjob. Or even that. Is it just, just one as well? What the fuck? You need like ninety of them to like cover a fucking house. TV offer, you get two window bully locks, what? two lock holders, and two cleaning pads for just $19.95, plus processing and handling, with a 30-day money-back guarantee. But I'm not stopping there. Oh, Order okay. now, and we'll double the offer. Okay, You'll four. get four window bully locks, four lock holders, and four cleaning pads, all for just $19.95. Okay, just, just hold on, just stop. Just look at how cheap and shitty this thing, these things are that they're trying to sell for 20 fucking dollars. Yeah, <laughs> even if you get four of them, it's supposed to be $5 I mean, a piece plus processing and handling. Like, what a real, ripoff. Realistically, you need like 20 of them as well to cover like a reasonable size house, right? Did oh, yeah, it? sure. Yeah. Yep. Processing and handling. So whether you have a family or live alone, let Window Bully secure your home. All right. Oh, that um, rhymes. Awesome. All, always the rhyming shit. This one is called the HD Twist. Get Window Bully in your house or I will fuck you in the mouth. HD Twist. Good. Taking music anywhere is easy, but it's hard to share your favorite song with earbuds. Ow! Fuck you, earbuds! Awful. Portable speakers have big sound, but you can't wear them over your ears. Now, well, why would you need to? HD That's why they have big sound. The powerful two-in-one HD headphones that cross over into speakers with just a. Yeah, well, he's at the club. He's all like, "I know there's some really loud music playing, but listen to my crappy headphones." <laughs> yeah. The girl's like, "Yeah." Is listening. his is his music fucking is is the headphones supply music for that whole club? Or something. Yeah, he is, dude. He's the fucking DJ. Instantly. Yeah, just we're white people. Yeah, white people. Yeah. Like, they just like Instantly. dancing. Ooh, it's time like, to oh, dance. Let me turn on the music. <laughs> so we look like we're fucking crazy. Headphones to hybrid speakers, delivering amazing audio that everyone can hear. I saw my girlfriend go from headphones to speakers. I just had to get a pair. Great for smartphones. Yeah. Woo. I am not reading from a script at all <laughs> great, right great now. Great for amused old people like. Well, actually, in like, bed. Actually, actually, the woman looks pretty young and the guy's pretty old. This so. is gonna spice up our relationship, yeah. baby. I don't even know if that guy looks that old. It just looks like they took a guy who was kind of old and then dyed his hair gray. <laughs> <laughs> You're old now. It's computers, MP3 players, and video games. Wait a minute, awesome. did you hear he said MP3 players? MP3 players! Players. Over from personal sound to entertaining everyone around. Crank up the volume. Two ways to play. Endless ways to enjoy. Anytime. Endless. Anywhere. Where how HD how exactly are there endless ways to enjoy? Well, because you can wear it while you're jogging. You can wear it while you're in the store. You can wear it anywhere. Today. Come on. Fun it's time. Like, stupid. You can be at a nightclub and be like, you know what? This music sucks. I'm going to be the DJ now. Everyone's like, yeah, TJ. <laughs> <laughs> I would say this should be at least ninety nine dollars minimum. No way. That's that's I how much it's worth easily. I reckon thirty nine ninety nine. Thirty nine. All right, that's way undervaluing it. I'm gonna say around ninety nine dollars. Come on, forty five dollars. Oh, you're a fucking garbage. Range. You're an idiot. I'll say. Uh, I'll say twenty nine ninety nine. Oh, it needs to be nine ninety nine dollars. Nine 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 nine. And what is yeah, it? yeah, yeah. Features a built-in mic. Wow. Who cares? It can do so much. Does it even give us the price? I don't know. Is that the, is that the guy from American Psycho then selling it? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look like they give us the price. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Jesus yeah. Christ, he does look like he's about to kill you. Do I kill you, Lewis in the, Lewis in the news? That's what you should be saying. Derma sleep. You toss, you turn, but you can't fall asleep. And when you finally do, you can't stay asleep. So when it's time to get up, you're still tired. What you need is you ain't got no space. You kick that fucking dude out of the damn bed. <laughs> derma sleep. Sleep. Derma the sleep. all new topical sleep spray that helps you sleep better a <laughs> whole new way. Then you'll be asleep all night. <laughs> Chloroform in a jar. Inhale. Done. <laughs> <laughs> Without the use of drugs, Dermasleep's active ingredient is melatonin, which is produced naturally in your brain and tells your body when to go to sleep. As we age, the body produces less and less melatonin on its own, which can result in restless, sleepless nights. Dermasleep's unique spray application delivers melatonin through your skin and directly into the bloodstream. 
It's what? Uh, it doesn't Finally. sound accurate. I don't know. I, I ain't a scientist, but I'm skeptical of these fucking propositions. How dare you, TJ? This is helping thousands of people achieve a full night's sleep, TJ. You're right. I'm sorry. I would pay any amount of money for this as someone who suffers from any. chronic insomnia, TJ. And I find your statements to be offensive. I think you should quit the podcast for those statements you just made. <laughs> as, on behalf of everyone in this country who suffers from sleep problems, TJ, what about sleep apnea? <laughs> you just don't care about the average person that no, suffers. No, he TJ. doesn't care because uh, he... My comments were insensitive and they don't represent... A race? No, they don't represent... A race the drunken They don't podcast. represent who I truly am. It's non-habit non for me. <laughs> Unless you want to sleep, up then it is it's habit like, forming. Oh, gotta get my fix the melatonin. Any price? I, I'm going with fourteen ninety five again. Nineteen ninety five. One million dollars. I think Scotty will be closer. Ten dollars. A special TV offer. Ten dollars. They're sixteen ninety five for a thirty night supply. Great nights of sleep. Dermasleep is guaranteed to help you fall asleep faster, guaranteed, sleep longer, guys, and wake guaranteed. up refreshed. I know it's guaranteed. Like winked at us. Like not really, guys. <laughs> it's not really guaranteed. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Illumask. I L L U Illumask. Illumask. I L L U M A S K. Illuminati. Illumask. I don't know about this. This is a mind control device, guys. You should look at it. Oh yeah, look at it. Oh my god. Acne. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Yes. I am the shredder. Tonight I dine on turtle it's soup. That's actually more like Cobra. Uh, Cobra. Coma Cobra Commander. Yeah, Cobra. Using Illumask, anti-acne light therapy mask. Now with the simple push of a button, um. you can light <laughs> acne with advanced light therapy. With a simple push of a button. <laughs> Doesn't matter. He's not gonna have, he's not gonna have so much acne. My skin is slightly blemished. In as little as two weeks. I will wear this Illumask ridiculous is device. And effective. Gentle TJ, blue light. You need this. Come on, dude. Gentle blue product. light kills acne bacteria. I, I'm sold. Consider this not being safe. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I would like, like, like the, the problem like is having... like. I would say the problem is she has a lot of uh, back acne. It's like back acne. So like, will it work for that too? No. He'll have to uh, buy like twelve of them. I'll just have to put the, some of the blue lights <laughs> in my uh, in top of them. You know. Just replace oh, okay. your light bulb with the mask. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. TJ will feel like he's in the blue light district. Sweet. <laughs> bacteria while well, soft red light reduces redness and inflammation with no uv rays no harsh chemicals and no side effects you no can get clear effects. in just 15 clear, minutes a day through this exclusive tv offer you'll get your first 30 light this is obviously some kind of Illuminati mind control device i mean come on or even 50 dollars uh, but just 20 how oh 20 uh, sorry Whoa. yeah and you can look like, you can look like a serial killer for 29.95 and get it cancer seems worth it to me bargain it, yeah, it's almost like, uh, what was that, uh, Battlestar Galactica, the Cylons. Oh, yeah. <laughs> almost looks like something like that. Cylons, man. It's also an exclusive TV offer. You can't get this anywhere else. Nowhere else. Only on TV. Offer goes on to We've about reached time to wrap it up on YouTube. Cool. Um, yeah, fuck YouTube. You guys don't even really like YouTube that much. No one I don't even likes know what YouTube. YouTube is. Yeah, it's, it's garbage. <laughs> never it's shit. Never post videos on YouTube. It's it's an evil place. It's utter total shit, and no one likes it at all. And it's filled with comments. Ever. So. Guys, there's a lot Good. of things you can do by yourself, but removing back hair is not uh, one of them. Uh, I, need, the I, need I need whatever this do. is. D do you have a lot of back hair? Oh, uh, I have a mountain of back hair. Is I'm not even wearing That's a shirt right now. It's <laughs> super back. The in shower rinse away back hair removal system. Ah, super back is fast. Easy. Looks Pain. painful. Free and lets you remove back hair privately. No more dangerous razors. Dangerous. No more stressful waxing. And no more crazy clippers. Ah, super back is crazy easy clippers. To use. Ah. Just apply, drape the cape, and wash away. You gotta put a in cape minutes, on. You'll this have store. a super smooth, Drapey super cape. soft, super sexy back she'll love to touch. See, this your back's is not super sexy until you get this. No. T TJ actually does have quite a bit of back hair. TJ, drape, yeah. drape the cape. Drape the cape to escape the rape. And of it's the a patented. <laughs> look, this rape. is a patented formula. <laughs> drape the cape to escape the rape. Of the that back is hair. Perfect. <laughs>
Superbacks patented formula that contains an effective hair remover, gentle exfoliator, healing aloe to moisturize, you guys and essential the oil. from like black to white. Yeah, what that's the hell? That's racist. That was, this is pretty racist. It's like that's if you're, racist. If you're black and use this, you'll become white. This that's is, racist. Michael fact, Jackson yeah, used this. Michael product. Jackson used this product, but eventually it kills you. So soothe and smooth your skin. Yeah, Superback is too. hypoallergenic and works on all skin types. Look, <laughs> even this full bag of hair was no match for the hair removing muscle of Superback. Amazing. Just the apply, hair removing muscle. The cape and wash away. Plus, it's not Ow. just for back hair. I know. Easily Why don't you just take a belt sander to your fucking back? <laughs> TJ, the hair removing muscle. The hair just <laughs> for back hair. And it's look, it's great for chest hair and arm hair. <clears throat> great for it. What about pubic hair? Is it good for that Ow. one? Ow. Kind of Whether you have a lot of hair or a little hair, in just minutes, Superback will get it out of there. <laughs> Stop oh, the aging. Stop waxing and start relaxing. Since Superback is Stop brand waxing new, we wanted to make it really waxing. affordable for you. Because they're something frolicking on a beach. Like literally frolicking. We're on a beach. TJ, the back muscle is not for pubic hair. And and what is the price of this extraordinary piece of merchandise? $19.99. I'm going to say $14.99. Seven hundred eighty one. Seventeen eighty one. $10. Ben, you, you already fucked it up. <coughs> Just $10. It. Super oh. back is proudly made in the Scotty, USA. And the comes with this guarantee man if it isn't alive. the... Five. $10. For, I don't even. Actually, I said 1999, but let's forget that. I did say ten dollars. Jim, <laughs> Jim has his memory is better than Scotty's memory. Ten dollars. Yes, it is. And this oh, show me ten dollars. This this next one is the Easy Reach loofah. Finally, the Easy a product reach that understands job. me and my needs. The easy reach around. You easy strain, reach struggle, deck. and bend in the shower. And it's so oh hard to God, wash your so entire high. body. But what are your options? It'd be funny if she Introducing fell and, like, broke her face and bled on the fucking ground and well, suffered and twitched. I took you down there. I didn't want to take a shower with you right away. Well, yeah. I'd basically be in the shower, and then I would come in and join basically you. be in the shower. So I got my hands basically in Basically be there. And I put it around the front. Basically. And you'd have yeah. your back to me. I would start to massage your boob, I want to massage, your off boob of massage your boob, massage your boob, massage your boob. The shower is sensation. Imagine Bill, o imagine Bill O'Reilly show up and massage your boob. Yeah. Yeah. You can have this or you can have Bill O'Reilly show up and wash oh, your back. What would you rather have, TJ? Really I wish Bill O'Reilly would massage my boob. I'd start to massage your boob. <laughs> Basically start to massage your boob. Bill O'Reilly has never massaged my boob. And you know what comes next after that? Anal sex. Bill. Anal sex. Anal sex. Yes. Use your favorite soap and or body wash to create a rich, luxurious lather. The Easy Ooh. Reach loofah yeah, is ingeniously that. designed. The premium terry cloth is perfect for cleaning delicate areas, while the linen exfoliates and lathers, leaving your skin smooth and refreshed. Simply grab the Easy Grip loops to clean and scrub your back, your legs, and your grab feet, easy all without loops. twisting or turning. Uh, wow! Storage space in your wow. shower is limited, so I like how they act like this is for some young, attractive woman when it's really for some old wash. chick who's like, I can't move right anymore. Exactly. Uh. Show, wow. show the real fucking target audience. Yeah. I want to see an old, disgusting yeah. hag using the product. <laughs> Plus, you know? come out of see a little ways. fucking realism in this ad, huh? I Skin flaking off dandruff. Oh, Keep that missing. looks useful. I'm going to order that right now. You rubbed that purple it. cloth <laughs> all over my wrinkles, and it... Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. <laughs> You're dying up there, Jim. You're dying. Suck it. Jim, you're dying. All right, Come what's, on, can't what's get the price? I'll say fourteen ninety five. Nine ninety nine. I'll say one hundred and fifty eight dollars and seventy three cents. Bam! Nine ninety nine. I think this time Jim remembers that you said something different. Therefore, you lose. Nine ninety nine, Michael. You lose. <laughs> nine ninety nine. You lose. Nine ninety nine. Hey guys, <laughs> just to let you guys know, nine ninety nine is also the price of the WWE Network, <laughs> the greatest network. The of Drunken Penance Podcast. Time. Always watch. A if you want to catch network. all of your favorite Hulk Hogan exciting. matches. Uh, 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 Hulk Hogan. Ma oh, hold on. Wait. No. Four or six months. Yeah, but they're still there, I think. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they, they ain't gonna work. take them down. No. Move them all. WrestleMania three is getting taken down, guys. No, he, he's just a pixelated blur. Yeah, they blurred the him out. <laughs> Good. Andre the Giant gets slammed by a blur. Giant four, blurry four, six, thing. Four, six month commitment. 
Everything he says is bleeped out. Four six one. Beep, 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 beep. This, this next one is called Magic Gate. They got rid of the six month commitment though. Ma- everything everything is bleeped out for a six month commitment. Magic Gate. Beep. Most Magic. times you want your dog with you, but sometimes you need to keep them from running out of oh, the house, no! running wild in the shit. house, or jumping on your gas. Regular He's dog gone. He's ruined our cocktail oh, party. Yeah, we're trying to have a cocktail food. party of this stupid fucking oh, dog. It's going to everybody's way. <gasps> oh, this dog fence is so inconvenient. I was having cocktail parties so you could spell your name. And a real pain to try and climb Fuck over. You, Plus, Calm they down, can ruin Scotty. your walls. But now, there's Magic Gate, the ingenious um, new mesh gate this that dog keeps is your an dog episode. where you want him, but lets you pass through with no he problem at all. It's Magic so easy. Gate. All you do is stick. Unroll to the size you need, and then just hook. It's all you have to do is stick to my dog. Dog will be terrified. Can you do that with like a blanket? And can't you buy the little sticky? No! Oh my God! No! You know you can't do that with a blanket. You have to do it with the magic gates. You know, uh, Scotty got a gate for Yujiro when he was a puppy, and like literally the first day he brought you. I had home. gates before you could spell is your Ujiro. name. Is that is Ujiro. that gate was was that gate point of the story? Was was that gate the magic gate? and everyone was dead. Why were they all dead? No one knew, and then the story ends. The magic gate comes out of my <laughs> penis. Every night. <laughs> okay. Every, Every night. Every night. Every night. The off. magic gate. Mute them both. And then uh, the uh, <laughs> Ujiro crawled over the gate. So Crawled over it? Yeah, he like climbed it like a fucking, like a cage fighter. So maybe it should have been put up. No, actually, it was funny. We put the we put what the we thing we put the gate up, and literally the first time he saw it, he climbed over the it. The magic gate that comes out of my dick installs in <laughs> seconds, <laughs> and it's got magical what's, stars what's coming the out of the. <laughs> what's the price of the this? The price of the magic gate is twenty nine ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. It's like a piece of a tent. Nineteen Like someone cut out a piece of a tent with with scissors. I spit pieces of tent out of the. Out of the hole in my dick. Thirteen pounds. And it installs it comes in out of the And it's twenty nine ninety nine. Holds a hundred pounds. Like that hundred pounds of shit that you saw with. Oh, hold on, hold on. This should. This could be ninety four. No. This piece of fabric could be ninety four. Well, oh, oh, ben saw God. it. Yes. Ben saw it first. Ben, ben watched. Saw it ben first. cheated. I ben didn't. cheated. Ben cheated as usual. I Fuck say you. the same thing ben every cheated. time. Ben cheated. <laughs> Oh, he cheated. If me, motherfucker. You Dis- saw that before you even played it. He's a disgusting You motherfucker, eater. Ben. You saw that before you Yo played motherfucker, Ben. Oh, hey, 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 hey
background that recurs <laughs> and is tied. Or the like, people that fucking download like the like the entire like volumes of NASA shit. It's like an image like 500 gigabytes. Like and they put for their background, so it takes like three months to load it. <clears throat> what is MySpace? Spy Mace. Tell me that all the kids did back in the day. It's nothing into now. I mean, it still creations. exists, but Cry, it's still nothing. The Cry Styler. <laughs> I'm so Wherever sad, but so fashionable. The Styler works on virtually any surface you want to add a little sparkle to. I love sparkles. But I'm sad at the same time. This Just glue it. For and all of you, it. for all of you women that never progress beyond arts and crafts in kindergarten, here's a great new product. It makes things sparkly. Yay! It's the Cry Styler. It's sparkly. Fourteen ninety-five. I'm not the guess. Fourteen ninety-five. Oh my God, I'm right. I'm gonna guess twenty-seven sixty. Oh, oh, sorry. Shit. <laughs> Wrong, That's TJ. A, damn Wrong. it. God what, damn it. That's what you get with the pen. Oh, this isn't even a real... Th Do you remember Cool Cat? Uh. Hey, kid. Hey, kid. Yeah. You get a pen. Cool Cat. Cool, cool cat. cat. And I love you. <laughs> Rolly Egg Master. Everyone loves eggs for breakfast. Now hey, Scotty, you're the egg bitch. Now this is the egg master. <laughs> this is your god, This is Scotty. why I obey. This, this is, is actually your fucking god. This, this is where I get my orders from. You need to get on your fucking knees and suck the egg master's dick. Egg bitch. Boy, I would, I you, would you assume. Like private. I would assume when she has her eyes closed and her mouth open, Scotty. You just no no it's it's not her it's it's the actual device yeah Scotty likes to fucking ram it up his asshole like ooh egg let's master. start with our basic rolly egg eggs master. that are perfect for a quick meal any morning first, first spray the rolly I'm buying cheaper. this fucking with thing and buying it for Scotty spray. for his fucking Christmas present thank you TJ you get the but fucking I, I, egg master but I already own one uh, you get the rolly it owns you Scotty I hung it's right? the master you are for oh, eggs. Hey, Scotty, do, that for every recipe do you hunger, Scotty? No. Do you hunger <laughs> for eggs? TJ, I did not know about the practice of the egg industry at the time eggs, of the video. So. Eggs, Scotty. Eat eggs, do you want to eat eggs, Scotty? No. Do you want to eat eggs? No. <laughs> do you want to eat eggs, Scotty? What is wrong? I, I do not want to eat eggs, TJ. Anything wrong? I bet you can't, you no, no, Scotty, I bet you can't shove 50 it. eggs up your ass, dude. You win, DJ. Scotty, I bet you you can't. Scotty, you win. Scotty, do you do you eat eggs? No. Do you shove eggs up your ass? <laughs> Only if I'm paid large sums of money by people. Would you have to like ass. freeze them or something to do that? I mean, you could probably just hard boil them. I'm gonna hard boil uh, the eggs. They might. They might I guess they could come off. They'd like the shells, crush. I, I don't know. Scott. Well, if, you're, if you if you clench too ben, much, Ben, do you maybe. want some eggs? Scotty, if I hard boil, I don't like eggs. I, I don't eat egg. them. You have to eat them, Ben. But Scotty. it's it's not because I have a moral problem with you eggs. Have to eat them, it's though. because I think they're disgusting. I don't. You still have to eat them, even if you think they're disgusting. Ben. Why do I have to eat them? Why do you think God they're disgusting? Is the better point? Because I, I, I just everyone, don't like them. Everyone loves loves eggs. I'm no longer ben. an atheist. Not I love I love eggs. Because God told me Ben eats I love eggs. My mission in life is to make Ben eat. I love eggs. I love eggs. Outside Ben's he's house trying to he's morning. trying to turn this around to Scotty. me. Scotty, trying, trying, like, trying to make it seem like he's not the egg bitch. Scotty, if I bitch. Scotty, okay. Scotty, he is the egg bitch. Scotty, Scotty, Scotty. 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 if I hard boil eggs, eggs directly into the chamber, will you stick them. <laughs> stick them up your ass. I will. I will stick them up your ass, Jim. No, no. <laughs> I'll stick them up your ass. If you need someone to do it, I will take one for the team, and I will help you I'll out with that. The, I'll take one for the team by making you take Whoa, them. Whoa, you'll take one up your ass for the team? I did not say that. I said I would help. I would assist Scotty. you, Jim. Scotty. Jim, I will assist you. Please, I think. Scotty. I think they need to have a contest. You could say my name a hundred <laughs> times, Jim. It's not Rumpel's. Who Dumpster. can get the most <laughs> eggs up their ass, Scotty <laughs> or Jim ass? It's not Rumpel still skin. Rumpel egg skin. <laughs> Rumpel four skin. Cook for approximately <laughs> six to eight minutes, Rumpel or until skin. the egg pops up from the cooking chamber. And it's convenient. Oh, that looks disgusting. Eggs, that it's too. convenient, Simply TJ. Pour the eggs out I don't like it. Oh, come ah. on, man. That's delicious. That man. is delicious. That, that looks mm. gross. It looks like a fucking disgusting. It looks like, like a big egg dildo or some <laughs> shit. <laughs> TJ. How do you think? How do you think it fucks you? Come on. Okay, I'm gonna show the next ad here. I have to. TJ, 
TJ. I like marginalized people. This I like butterized. TJ, people. here's Neat. here's an ad that I someone sent this ad to me and said you would like this product. Okay, is it a banana? Pornhub presents. It's it's already gotten TJ's interest. No, we did um, this in my episode. The banana, like the cover. This is like we are interesting because. Yeah. So <laughs> meanwhile, how do you feel so Pornhub far? Laboratory. I, I feel like this is epic. Like, is this Pornhub's real location? This is where <laughs> they do all of their cutting edge research. This is somewhere. There's a server with TJ's porn videos on it. There's like a Bukaki lab. Yeah. You know. Earlier this year. A top secret program began to create a revolutionary new product. Sweet. Yes. Tis. Yes. Whatever this is, yes. For days wow. they worked around the clock. <laughs> Work around the clock. She just like, you know what? This is some research I would be in on. I want to know why the government isn't observing. funding more research like this. I don't Until know. One day, it was born. Now. People all over the world are using the twerking butt. <laughs> the twerking butt. Yes. The twerking butt. Eric Iglesias. Loser. No, why Eric Iglesias? Come on, don't do that. Oh, give it to me. Stay back! Oh, it's the twerking. So, how do you feel about the twerking butt, TJ? I think TJ would empty his bank account right now. Uh, I'm kind of pissed because mine was supposed to arrive yesterday <laughs> and it's still not here. So, I Dude. feel like Pornhub's got some pretty piss poor comedy writers. Yeah, man. All right, here's here's another uh, sex related ad. <clears throat> this one's called <laughs> the Jizz Dildo. <laughs> the Jizz Dildo. Mr. S Leather .com. Hey guys, Dildo. Dildo Day here at Mr. S. We're cool. talking about the Oxball Jizz. Neat. Um, this is the curved knobby ass stuffer. It's got some really nice knobs. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Not the ass stuffer. What? Whoa, what? The curved knobby ass stuffer? Is the curved uh, knobby ass stuffer 9,000? Hey, <laughs> superior to the, the, I like how the I like how these guys can keep a straight face when they talk about it, that, too. That, real, that's that's all this that is, is just a day at the office for him, man. He that is all shit. you have to play. He's got a just fucking, go like, <laughs> little jail cell behind him, too. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? Just go to the next video. You know, this is the curved knobby... Whoa. No, I'm not going to the next video. Yeah, we need to, we need to see Think more. It, it does stuff. Anal beat. Um, it's the Oxball silicone smoosh. So it's that Oxball. new, stretchy, ah, soft silicone. Wow, it's it nice and soft. kind of that realistic oh feel of a real dick with a real heart on in you. Yeah, because um, it looks like a real dick for sure. So it might as well feel like one, too. So, Chidi, as a connoisseur of it's butt like plugs, a, how do you rate the quality of this it's one? It's like an elephant titus. Yeah, it's like, but, like, do you want to ever get fucked by the elephant man? Here you go. Yeah, like a, a, a deformed elephant dick. It's like in sections, too. Elephantitis, Scotty. Elephantitis. No, it's not the same as being an elephant, you stupid fuck. <laughs> You're so dumb, Scotty. Elephantitis is not an elephant dick. No, it Scotty. is. It is an elephant. You're stupid, Scotty. I take Scotty's uh, side in this one. No. I Obviously, you guys Ben is also no, stupid. No, Scotty. You are stupid. <laughs> If I don't have to kick you out the window, but I might have to. If you like peanut, might coladas, have to go three hundred on you now. Dancing out in the rain. <laughs> if you're not into yoga, if you have half a, a brain. brain. Fucking bad. Some really good girth to it. So you're eight inches at the biggest portion. Scotty, and Scotty. you're eleven inches of penetrative power. Eight inches is ridiculous. Is not, eight inches is not an elephant dick. It's 11 inches of insertable power. <laughs> is, that, is that what he said? Yes. You've been paying good attention to this well, one. Well, I'm considering would, this product. I would Jim, say... Him and Jim know a lot about this. Seems like they've almost... Like, they've seen it before. Yep. I am considering buying, purchasing this fine product. It looks very interesting. This is the video... Like, I would out, like to know more. Out of all the videos that we've watched tonight, this is the one that you're paying the most attention to. I would say... To. I'm going to say... Oh. It's probably about $70, maybe. Um, super easy to keep clean. Hot super water easy. Detergent, dishwasher safe. Dishwasher safe, TJ. I just give it a spit shine. For a ride. We'll see you guys later. Uh, Is that it? Yeah. No price. Where's the think, price? I don't think he says the price. <laughs> oh, you stupid Is piece of shit. The official rapid ramen. Official. 
You know you love ramen noodles. I do. Mm -mm -mm. But it right, takes okay. too long to cook in the pot. It takes so too long to the make ramen. And it yeah, it takes too what? fucking long. It takes too long to order McDonald's. There's got to be a better way. Dude. You ever been sitting there, you're like, man, I could go for some ramen, and then, you, you know, the noodles, just, you know. I have to boil water? What the fuck is this? Is this like some cooking show shit? Are you, like, channeling TJ right now? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you say I gotta that? get up and burn. Why the fuck now? I gotta Taco Bell. <laughs> then I gotta drive somewhere, though. Or get Scotty <laughs> to drive somewhere. Scotty, <laughs> ramen. I've been eating ramen for years, and this is about the best I've ever had. Wow. It's great. Oh, that's that's the best ramen, ramen you've ever had? had? This is the best. Sold! <laughs> TJ, this is, I want this for Christmas, I want this for fucking Easter, I want this for every holiday imaginable. It makes every ramen the top ramen. <laughs> top shelf ramen. An easiest way to cook ramen noodles. Just drop your noodles in, add water up to the line, and pop it into the microwave. In three minutes flat, you've got a rapid ramen <laughs> feast to eat. Rapid a coffee it's cup. a feast. <laughs> No one should ever describe ramen yeah, as a feast. But this is patent pending technology to cook your noodle exactly to perfection. You to cook ramen. ramen is like, what I ate when I had like a stove, dollar to my name. <laughs> Whatever you want. Well, if you only had a dollar to your name to get the ramen, how much do you think this thing is? Yeah. Ramen makes perfect noodles in half the time. Look at she's amazed. Like, oh holy God, ramen. shit, ramen noodles? You spoil me, Mom. It doesn't even look like they put sauce packets in it. It's not a real it. Mom. Yeah, I know, like, right? There's no flavor packet So in fast, it'll blow your mind. Rapid He's ramen heat-resistant handles make ramen. handling safer and easier. Handles. I feel more comfortable having them use the microwave than putting a pan on the stove. To yeah, because this uh, fucking 12-year-old kid can't use the Yeah, this kid, <laughs> he's trying to fucking shove his head in. I want to cook my head. Thank Ever you. since we got the vaccines, he's had the autism, so, you know, he can't cook too good. I feel a lot safer him just pressing Dude, buttons on the micro They were so lazy, they didn't even have a studio. They're sitting in the middle of a fucking mall. There's, like, some little random kid walking in the background. Look at shit. him is working he it, though. <laughs> yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. He's he like, is damn. He is. No, he's got it. He's got a hand. <laughs> Just a weird angle. Creaming oh, ramen into regular bowls leaves noodles mushy or un. I wish that kid was oh. missing a hand. Look how disgusted she is by a bowl of overcooked like, ramen. Like, oh, oh God, it might as well be oh. cat puke now. You're it's good, but rapid ramen, ramen is expect? engineered in the same dimension as a block of ramen noodles. It's the same dimension. The patented reservoir the design noodles. circulates just the. Yes, the patent pending shit. The patented reservoir design circulates water. Right amount of water for ideal heat distribution. <laughs> it's even. Right the texture's great. The important. flavor is awesome. This is fantastic. Rapid ramen. This is fantastic. Look at her, she's licking it. <laughs> He's just really passionate about his ramen, dude. That should be his, like, title, Ramen Enthusiast. Ramen it for lunch at the office. Dinner in a hurry. Rapid ramen it for the after-school snack attack. Uh, 17.99. 9.99. I go on 14.95. In your dorm room, anytime, any day. All you need is rapid ramen and a microwave. And rapid ramen's clever cooking design means you can use half the sea's sodium. It's okay, healthier from recipe book. Hmm. Two right. recipe book. Also probably a spork or something. Recipe like book for ramen. <laughs> yeah, a recipe, you know, and then like a, 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 a ramen specific utensil. Oh, you can do anything. Whoa. Ben, look at spaghetti Whoa. and meat. Perfect for eating and eating spaghetti, canned soups, oatmeal, wow. and so wow. much more. Anything. It's rapid ramen time. It's, like a bowl. it's almost like one. a bowl, guys. Oh, fucking there's two. Crazy. There's two. Dude, it's two. 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 Rapid. Oh, okay. bam! Come on, keep going. Ramen cookers for ten dollars. Oh. Order now and get the rapid ramen cookbook. Oh, cookbook! Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> cookbook! Cookbook! <laughs> Oh my God! All right. Uh, so many different recipes for ramen. Here's a here now here's all we a. Need is the ramen specific utensil, and I'm in the money. I'm in the. Bin. All right. <laughs> but for rapid meals like Get ramen rancheros, jambalaya ramen, and more, yours free. But wait, order right now, and we'll give you a third rapid ramen Whoa! cooker free. Oh, three. Oh, holy How shit. do they even make money on this oh deal? I don't know, man. Because those things, you figure they look like bowls, and they're like, I don't know, we got them. <laughs> no, man, they look like they're worth it. They're, they're BPA they free. <laughs> they're just silicon. <laughs> <laughs> they're BPA they have free, guys. Patented designs, dude, that circulates the water. One? Why is there only one black one, though? This is a waste. <laughs> Yeah, the other two are red. Uh, they yeah, favor true. Native Americans. We are canceling our t-shirt deal with the Rapid Ramen Cooker. <laughs> <laughs> Done.
They're too racist. There's three rapid ramen cookers plus the cookbook, all for only ten dollars. Call or log on now at rapidramen.com. All right, yeah, that's enough of this shit. What's next? All right, the next one is the dog dicer. The dog dicer? Oh shit! Yep. Jesus! About time. How that you made this? How he knows about dogs? this? No, it's Japanese. Oh, okay. <laughs> just, just Japanese guy. Guys, it's obviously Did Chinese. you know it's that thousands of children choke on hot dogs every year? <laughs> Look, at <laughs> Look at these kids. They're, they're, they're almost fucking dead. They're about to choke. Hey, didn't did She's like, no, don't eat that hot dog. Put the hot dog down. Didn't Ray Comfort mom, want proof of Darwinism in action earlier? There it is. There you go. The mom had a stressful day and was like, she forgot to cut Jimmy's hot dog. She's like, Fuck, not the kid. He's, he's, no! like, no! he's deep throating the fuck out of the hot dog. My kid's gay. <laughs> it's a simple way to help reduce the risk of your oh, kids no. choking. Now there's the dog dicer designed oh my by. God. Wow. It's this called is... a knife. That's too much work, Ben. But, Ben, they've cut these to the size of a Nico wafer. <laughs> yeah, and also, Ben, uh, with a knife, you have to sit there and cut over and over again. Oh, this there's thing, got to be a better way. Just every cut at once. You Do you know? think it cuts them while they're hot? Oh, it cuts parents them for parents to help make eating hot dogs safer for kids. It's Finally, so simple to use. To eat Just hot place dogs. your hot dog into the dog hey, dicer. Know, if you're concerned about your children's safety, you probably shouldn't be feeding them hot dogs anyway. <laughs> right? Sound like vegan gains now, yeah, TJ. TJ. Huh? I mean, it's a hot dog. Even That's just even a long egg slicer. Even <laughs> it is. that is exactly what it is. Even, but even even when I, even when I was a carnivore and I ate hot dogs and knew people ate hot dogs, we all knew hot dogs were bad. Even as kids, people were like, "This is like made of assholes and." Like beaks and fucking waddles and shit. Mm, and press assholes. for safe, bite sized pieces. Dog dicer is a must for. So, TJ, you have stopped eating assholes. Just to clarify. Uh, I would not say that. <laughs> Come on, man. That's a bridge too far. Every household with kids. Choking is such a serious hazard that now. Wow, she seems like a real doctor, doctor to me. Choking is such a serious hazard that you need to be worried about choking. Do I get the $500 now or lighter? Corn syrup and dextrose. Sodium phosphates. The dog dicer was designed to reduce Dextrose. the risk for choking by cutting the hot dogs up into safe, appropriate size pieces for small safe children. And that's why we use the dog dicer in our home for our kids. I love it because I feel safe right. knowing that they won't choke. What, what, what kind of world do we live in? It's like in the background. People, <laughs> people look at hot dogs and they like just look at them with terror. Like, imagine someone could choke on that. Oh man, you know what you do? If you take a bath, you might drown in the bathtub, buddy. Happened to me back this in the 70s. You know, it happens to people all the time. Back in the 70s, it so happened. Like, I remember the 70s, and hot dogs like dicks, and there was lots of dicks in me. And I choked on a few. I support the dog dicer. And they'll swoop, and they're the right size, and they're safe. We do hot hey, dogs. Yeah. I'm glad these poor kids are safe. Hugo, if I gave you, like, $550, would you let me put your dick in the dog dicer? <laughs> are you going to slam it closed? Yes. Yes. Obviously. Okay, $600. I'll consider it. All right, we'll talk after the show. Okay. Carrots, cheese sticks are really great. Grapes, bananas in the morning for cereal. The dog dicer. Bananas. Don't cut those bananas. <laughs> yeah, come on, you're ruining the banana then. Ah. <sighs> These people, they don't know how to handle bananas. Your infomercial is next, buddy. Neat. Who feeds their kid cold fucking hot dogs? Monsters. Jesus Christ. It so quickly creates dogs. easy to eat bite sized pieces like every meal right them. out of the microwave or off the product. stove and don't have to worry about burned fingers. Cleanup's a breeze. It's dishwasher safe and it's compact size fits neatly away. Very portable if I'm going out on a play date. If portable. I take portable. Portable. It's portable. <laughs> Spread <laughs> everywhere with you. Bring lukewarm hot dogs to a picnic <laughs> and I fucking cut them. Dumb kids, so we just choke. I used to have a hot dog slicer that wasn't portable. It was fucking huge. It yeah. was the size of a 70 <laughs> supercomputer. It was just a meat slicer, and she used it to cut hot dogs with a giant spinning blade, like a Jewish deli. <laughs> Grandparents, you know they're going to be safe no matter where they are. This is really one of our favorite what? gadgets in no. uh, the kitchen. It's it easy, it's fast, safe it's simple, pedophile. it's safe. So if you drop them in Compton, but you so give them the dog dice, they'll be safe. 1299? It says it's 1299. Three ramen bowls for 10, okay? Yeah, what a ripoff. 
I'm gonna go fourteen ninety nine. They're overselling you can put, this one. I'm gonna go you, fourteen. And plus it's already on the screen, like unfortunately. I, I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go something. with twelve ninety nine. But you can put the hot dog. You can put the hot the hot dog slices from the dog slicer into the ramen. We oh, let it play yeah. too long, and it's showing the price already. It is twelve ninety nine. Uh, twelve ninety nine. It's garbage. So sad. But I also think you're gonna get it. Probably a recipe book. Maybe they'll get like a bun thing, something for hot dogs. Probably buns. buns. Probably buns. A okay. bun toaster. You're definitely getting two. Yeah, you get a second, second one free. Uh, oh no, you gotta buy the second one and they ship it for free. Oh, okay. Oh, That's lame. That's garbage. Free shipping on the second one. That's Boo. it. Oh, I'm bummed out. Boo That's all. Do they also yep. have one for bratwurst, or is this double as that? I think, you know, you it gotta get a larger all. one for brats. Okay. Here's one for the tech-savvy generation. It's the PC-matic. Finally. We are the revolution. We are the revolution. We are the revolution. Viruses, ransomware, adware are our enemies. But there's a new enemy. Security software made in foreign countries where these threats are originating. Oh, no. It's like a Tea Party-based fucking... Fuck you, thing. foreign countries and your shit. Why is she... Why is she having name? assault right there? Because <laughs> she's American. That's how you deal she with computer keep, problems. You she shoot keeps her them. computer safe. We are the revolution there's, against him. There's a tank in the background. <laughs> Damn right there is. What are we, why are we militarizing? <laughs> Viral warfare, buddy. Here your security software that we pay to protect us, but they don't. That's a threat to you, me, and the USA. Yeah. Nothing blocks What's modern threats. My porn viruses, they're fucking threatening national security. Yeah. Maybe I shouldn't download them on my Pentagon computer. <laughs> Look how they're just deflecting the it's like virus off into Canada now. Okay, yes, but not Canada. the West Coast. Oh, uh, that's destroying Canada. That's fine, then. Let White Canada technology. be in ruins. And we proved it in the prestigious virus bulletin rap test. We are the revolution. We are the revolution against security software that slows your computer. PCmatic optimizes system performance even after years of use. We are the revolution against gun. expensive security software. Pizzamatic costs just fifty dollars for five computers Whoa. for a year. What? Wow! Fuck you guys. I feel like this is gonna fucking add wear the shit out of your computer. Oh yeah, it, it would. It definitely. Vote would. for Trump. Vote for Trump. <laughs> or is it vote for Rand Paul? It's probably probably Trump. Yeah. Or less than Cruz. Yes. I agree. One dollar per computer per month for enterprise and government agencies. Join the revolution. Join the revolution. Join the revolution. Go to PCmatic.com. This is not a revolution. The in the end, you don't get to be a thing in this. <laughs> He's just the opening and closing guy, you know? He just introduces it and then closes it. He now doesn't have any inner seal kind of appearances. Yeah, so... Six silhouettes, because yeah. that's important. <laughs> So they're selling antivirus software. This is so patriotic. It, it, it's too. revolutionary. I've never heard of this product before. No Next one get this. <laughs> yeah. Next one's called Kitty Shack. This sounds so much better. I, I, Cats I, I, love to I, snuggle up in a warm, cozy corner, but fur goes everywhere, and cleanup oh. is a nightmare. Introducing Kitty Shack, the only pet bed with two perfect places that keeps kitty warm no and furniture fur free. Look, just unzip Kitty Shack to convert from a comfy tube bed to a full size cat mat in seconds for double the snuggling. Cats love God, this bed is fucking wonderful. Oh my God, yes. What the fuck this bed? Of to cuddle on your that bedding, but fur flies everywhere, and that means tons of wash from shedding. But Kitty Shack's boat is lining and extra plush foam steps is off that for a second. It yeah, won't. It's gonna get fur everywhere. Yeah. I'm pretty sure no. once you lay that out, your cat will just be like, "Holy shit!" And then it, you know, it just it stays <laughs> on there and just rubs around it, and it doesn't want to go Box. anywhere else in the house. The cat eventually actually shit. dies. It won't even eat. It just like I want to oh. be on this fucking thing. Yeah. Oh god! Unless you put the foam, you got to put its food bowl on there and everything. The only person who can get the cat off nice the bed is Brett bag. Spiner. Just throw it in the trash. <laughs> Biodegradable. The perfect retreat for Kitty's cat nap, keeping the shed off the bed. The secret is in the electrostatic charge that works like a magnet, trapping unwanted fur and damage. It works like a Fucking magnet, only magnet. it's not. Yeah, this woman's kind of obsessed with her cat's fur. Like, the cat jumps off, she's immediately touching it. Like, ooh. It, yeah. 
God, it's so sexy and soft. Saving it in a bag to glue it to some part of her body later. My cat Daphne loves the cozy warmth of Kitty Shack. No matter where I put it, on a bed or a couch, she just will sleep on it for hours. My cat spends all day lounging on the Kitty Shack. I love the Kitty Shack. All fucking day. Back now, and they'll throw in the cat Merkin kit. Because I can now, move it to all the cat. <laughs> favorite places and keep the cat for off my furniture. Every cat, big or small. Why even have a fucking cat if it's that big of a yeah, deal? Yeah, if you're that concerned, you probably shouldn't. Small will crave the cozy comfort of Kitty Shack. Kitty Shack's super strong double stuffed outer rim. What, before they get to it, what what do you think is the cost? Uh, this is twenty nine ninety nine, and it's, it's going to come with one of those lint brushes. Lint brush I'm going nineteen ninety five too. Seventeen seventy six, America. Oh God, America. I'm going fourteen ninety five. Yeah, keeps nice. Kitty Shack open for the perfect cozy cave. Portable and lightweight, Kitty Shack keeps Kitty warm and cozy on the cold kitchen floor. On the couch, give Kitty a comfy mat and keep All furniture right. fur free. Just yeah. look at the difference. It's I the perfect the playhouse. <laughs> Cats can hide or play all day. Kind of and Kitty Shack it's is machine astounding. washable. Pet beds can be expensive. Now $50. Kitty Shack, in your choice of brown or leopard print, for just fourteen ninety. dollars Yeah! Oh, bullshit! Yeah! Bullshit! Ben looked. Ben looked beforehand. Must've ben looked it. again. Yeah, sure. Ben looked beforehand. Yeah, that's ben exactly always how... looks. No, have you fucking noticed, I, I guess, fourteen ninety five every time? No, no you, looked. Uh, you looked. You look in my... Oh, there was something wrong with this controller! Yeah. You looked. There, there was, was lag! There was! You spammed everyone! There room. was! There's, Five. there's more. There's even a built-in thermoreflective core Damn, to reflect Kitty's wow, body. Wow, a built-in thermoreflective core? No, but I'm just wait, no better. Sounds like someone would be on the fucking Enterprise. The what the fuck? They're going to double the offer? Go out and get another cat. Oh, my cat. fucking God. I can't handle the savings. <laughs> <laughs> The processing and handling. I don't even know what Keep to say. Keep one is a tunnel and one my is a is complete. You get it all for just fourteen ninety five. dollars Call or click now. No brush or anything? No, no fucking God, they're brush. They're really disappointing me today with it. these deals. Mom. Yeah, these deals are bullshit. Yeah, they only double the offer, no brush, no fucking manual. I want a nothing. side gift. You lazy pieces of shit. They told you it was machine I want a washable. Cat book. I want a fucking toaster with my fucking thing. We're going to do one more before we end the show. This one's called the Bullseye Pee Pad. <laughs> I need it. If you have a dog, then you know that accidents happen. You've tried pads, but they just spill off the corner onto the floor. Tired of coming Pieces home to a shit. mess every single day? There's yeah. got to be a better way. Introducing the yeah, Bullseye Pee Pads, specifically out. designed so your dog only pees in the center. The problem with regular pee pads is that your dog will pee the anywhere problem on the pad. The problem with fucking lazy-ass people be. is they don't take their dog outside, so it pisses on a pad. <laughs> right. It's, it's like, take the dog out. No, you take it out. No, I'm more laid down than you are. <laughs> this, this should have said, tired of your dog peeing on your pad? Try the outdoors. Yeah, right. How the fuck does A the new dog... product. How the fuck does the dog know to pee on the bullseye? I know, that's what I was just thinking. The bullseye, of their... Ben. The dog Everyone sees the bullseye, the bullseye and he's ass. like, Ooh. yeah, aim for that. Messy. But the bullseye pee pads have <laughs> concentrated <laughs> pheromones right in the center oh, of the pad right only. Dog, now man. your dog hits the target the every time guaranteed. <laughs> <laughs> the dog's like, oh, why, why are you watching me? Come on. You're filming this? What the fuck, man? What the fuck, dog? You dude. people are sick. Bullseye. It even locks in odors and releases a pleasant scent. The revolutionary it bullseye. It does, is does it? It locks oh, in odors and releases scent. a pleasant scent. <laughs> I just, how pleasant of a scent is it? with pheromones this, right this in the center of the pad. <laughs> Plus the layer of odor-eliminating micro-lock absorbent dots absorb the liquid so it stays off the floor. Does your dog think your rug is his pee pad? You've tried treated pads, but it's still a mess to clean. Why Try the bullseye. Why are you pee pad on the rug? Right. <laughs> yeah, don't put Looks it like there. Fucking stupid. <laughs> Looks like they have hardwood you, floors. Why are you <laughs> actively teaching your dog not to piss on the rug? This is fucking more it's, work it's than just taking dog, your dog out. God, more people need to beat their animals. <laughs> It'll keep your carpet clean and dry. 
No one likes to go out in the snow. The bullseye no, keeps me, you I both don't. inside warm and dry. Wait, it's so the best for that. puppy training yeah. inside the no house problem. and teaches your dog exactly where to go outside too. So your grass will never what? look like this again. Use it outside even? even? Use it outside, guys. Even, to, even to protect your grass. To protect your grass. <laughs> fuck about my grass? Piss on the fucking grass, dogs. Because, you know, once your dog pisses on the grass, it just dies, you know? Yeah. You know what looks time. better than dry patches on your grass? Fucking pads all over it, apparently. <laughs> just staple some pads out there. If you live in an apartment, your dog will never need to wait for the elevator again. And you'll never feel the pain of needing to walk in the cold, pouring rain. Stop yeah, using pads cold, that leak on the floor. Rain, With the bullseye, yeah. you'll never clean a mess oh anymore. It's almost like Go you shouldn't have a dog. I don't know. Not so convenient. Ugh. Get a 30 bullseye pee pads for only $10. Uh, but $10 wait, if you order pads. right now, you can double the offer oh, and get 30 more. Pads. Plus, you can also get our famous Crazy Critter. Oh, Stuffed it's toys famous. can make a mess. Crazy Everyone Critter knows about Crazy free Critters. And so much fun for the dog you love. Doesn't so matter now, where you, you go can in get the world. It's a toy? I yeah, guess. It's a dog toy? Yeah. yeah. It's a dog toy that doesn't a make a mess. Toy. Just annoys the shit out of you. That's the most bullshit ad ever. It's pretty amazing. Fucking hot dog uh, how about the PC Matic? Would you rather get that? No. No. <laughs> no. You're so unpatriotic. I know. Probably a terrorist. I'd rather have the, the bulls. Because at least they're bulls. They're bulls. <laughs> you, you want some eggs, TJ? Yeah, you could, do, you, could, you could actually use them at least. Well, you're doing <laughs> a lot of cereal, TJ, so I guess there would be something. Yeah. What's your favorite cereal, TJ? None of your God. fucking business is too All personal. Alright, this product is Flipjack Pancake Maker. I want it. So much fun, you will flip. It makes pancakes so, so quick. It's Flipjack. Yeah, flipjack. Yeah, it's flipjack! It's fucking Flipjack. <laughs> it's Jack's and it's it flip. What is it doing? What is this it's, fucking it's, creature? It's, that, that is, is a fucking, horrible abomination That of is nature. a fucking smiling <laughs> pancake. That is not a smiling pancake. It's a fucking fetus head. No, it's a smiling fucking <laughs> pancake. It's a severed head of a human fetus just smiling at you with soulless I dead eyes. You know, well, I don't care at, how much they're selling this for. I'd pay a million dollars for it. Let's watch it look, like this. Look into, the, look into the pancake's distant murderous eyes. <laughs> with butter... <laughs> Play this in slow butter, motion. Butter slow -mo? the... Yeah, play, play this in slow motion. I had sped yeah. it. I had sped it up. Okay, let's hear it like that. This is Pancake Jack, and I flip for Flipjacks. And now you can too with the Flipjack Pancake Pan by Obrinic. The fast one yeah. will bring your parents to make delicious pancakes. All right, I'll slow it down now. Here we go. I really want to hear the song at the beginning in slow-mo. Just slow -mo. mix up your favorite batter. All right, here we go. I don't like that. So much fun, you <laughs> Then I shall have your soul for all time. I guess fourteen ninety five. I would pay a million dollars for it. I guess nineteen ninety nine. You guys are totally wrong. One million US dollars. Pancake pan by Orbrainic. Like the million fast Canadian. fun way for you and your parents to make delicious pancakes. So it's two pancake or it's two frying pans like stuck together, basically. Yeah, so No, no, no. It doesn't look like that. So that you can more frame than that. Uh, it's a pen and penny NASA based system. Just mix up your favorite batter, pour it in the pan, and watch your parent flip it fast with one hand for perfect flapjacks every time. Watch your okay. parents. So basically, they're trying to get kids to get their parents to buy this piece now, of shit. These kids love pancakes. Like, most people I know can maybe eat a couple pancakes. We're like, oh, the taste is, it's kind of a repetitive taste. But these fucking kids are just like, fucking yeah. It's Shuffle funny. Shit in my Scotty, mouth. we got to go to IHOP tonight. I want you got fucking, you know what? The minute I saw this, I'm like, I bet she is going to sell it. Like, man, this is a pancake, man, pancake. Dude, Paul, tell, back me up here. You're feeling pancakes <laughs> right now, right? <laughs> okay. okay. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm always feeling pancakes. <laughs> Paul's like, damn, I want to go. I, I was about to go, like, run out the door. Fuck this show. I'm thinking. Of, I'm thinking about flying to uh, fucking uh, Columbus right now so we can all go get pancakes. Fuck together. yes, dude. Do it, Paul.
All right, I'm on the plane right now. <laughs> yes, Sweet. he got on it that f He was thinking about it, and now he's on the plane. He predicted this would happen, so he bought a plane ticket anyway. One time, Paul Paul was thinking about d doing some kind of live event with me before. Or he was going to fly out or some shit, but then it never happened. Yeah. Shit. Never happened. Because he, he's a piece of shit. Well, I mean, yeah. hookers and ice cream, TJ. You dashed my hopes, Paul. I thought we were going to get it on. <laughs> well, get it on. There's always the future. It's yeah, fast, future. fun, and best of all, yummy! yummy! Make hot fluffy uh, blueberry, awesome strawberry filled with whipped cream, or amazing no, man, chocolate chip that. and marshmallow cakes. Yes. And hey, mom, yes. no more pancake disasters. Because oh, Flipjack is designed retarded? with the organic, non-stick ceramic surface, so nothing... Yeah! The Apple family. Ah. It's so easy now, every mom can flip perfect pancakes with just one hand, then slide them right out of the pan. Cool! Flipjack <laughs> 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 pancake pans are for nineteen ninety nine. Oh, this is bullshit. TJ knew. TJ looked yeah, beforehand. He looked. He looked. I sent him the video before uh, we did I the show. It. I believe And he it. looked at it. I believe Piece it. Piece of shit. I, I, I would pay a million for I'd this, I'd do it though. again, too. Hey, kids. It's Pancake Rock. <laughs> Hold on. Is that, must, is that must destroy all? You know what you need? <laughs> you need. You need two frying pans both of the together. <laughs> so you don't have to use a... <laughs> we gotta get on me having some kind of weird voice changer thing. You know what? That sounds familiar. That sounds like that video that someone sent to Brett Keen wow, calling him the hey, N-word. Hey, yeah! Huh. Brett Keen. <laughs> You're just a stupid nigger. <laughs> you are a nigger, Brett Keen. <laughs> oh, I love Paul. I think we might know who's behind it, TJ. Paul's behind it all. Yeah, I think it was Paul that threatened Red King's family. Yep. We've cracked the code. The case. You know what's funny? They call pancakes flapjacks, and in the UK, like, flapjacks are something totally different. What are they? I, they're, they're like... I don't want to say the wrong thing, but they're nothing like pancakes. They're like little muffins filled with jizz. Are these Gale <laughs> muffins or something? British people have no fucking idea what's going on. Who cares what they call pancakes? <laughs> yeah, fuck That's em. true. They're crazy. Fuck them in their No, no, ass. it's flapjacks, not pancakes. Fucking retarded limeys with fucking poor dental hygiene. Fuck Fuck them. Okay, apparently a flapjack in the UK is an oat bar. Here, here it is right here. Oat bar? That's not even a fucking flapjack. What the fuck? It's a dessert. That's Rolled not... oats and brown sugar and butter and golden syrup. I'll put our flapjacks up against their flapjacks yeah, any fuck fucking things. day. <laughs> fuck you, you know United what? You know Kingdom. What? I've got Canada, I've got Newfoundland. What the fuck? Of course Canada fucking gets on that fucking trend. Canada sucks. God, what a shithole. I've got People a fucking idiots. idea, dude. Yeah, I, I, let's do it. I'm, here's the deal. If you are British and you want to believe that your flapjacks are better than American flapjacks, I want you to put 25 <laughs> grand in escrow, okay, and show up at my door with one of these raisin-filled dry oat bars, okay? And I will bring, I will bring some fucking, some actual flapjacks and we'll eat them and then you tell me that you're shitty. <laughs> Bar looking raisinette filled piece of shit <laughs> is better than my flapjacks, okay? <laughs> the challenge has been issued, people of the UK who are listening. Oh my god. They'll probably be listening like in a few hours here. When oh, they there's, wake some, up. there's some there's some over there that are listening now. Oh sure. Absolutely. They have no lives, come on. Paul's on fire. <laughs> Paul's having this, uh, like a 60-point game tonight. Don't fuck with flapjacks, apparently, when Paul's around. Yeah, man. No, Paul don't, takes don't. that shit seriously. Oh, I do, dude. There's nothing more serious in the world than fucking flapjacks. <laughs> and the fact that these piece-of-shit colonialists are sitting there in their fucking crumbling country going, Oh, have a flapjack, and they pass you a fucking oat bar? You know how pissed that would be? <laughs> if I went to fucking Britain... And was like, oh man, you know what I really want is a flapjack. And I went and ordered flapjacks, and they're like, hey, you know, sir, here's an oat ball with raisins in it. I, I told everybody in that fucking restaurant with this knife. With this knife. This knife, <laughs> <is my> <laughs> 
Oh my god. Shit. Paul's for fucking real, dude. Oh, uh, that's beautiful. Let's watch another commercial. All right. Magic pens. They're magic. Magic pens that can change colors or reveal a secret message. It's magic. No, it's magic. It's magic. magic. It's all the magical pens that change color by magic. And it's magic. magic. Right before your eyes. How easily impressed is this fucking kid? He lives in the age of smartphones and shit. <laughs> it's magic. <laughs> it's magic. Just like fucking Harry Potter. Wow! I like how they were making it white. It's like, so we're making it have no color now. It's like, well, that's not really coloring, is it? It's or an eraser, well. Scotty. Pen, turn one color into another, or erase the entire color like magic. Now you can turn ordinary artwork into awesome works of art. Shoot fire! Sweet. <laughs> awesome works of art. A fucking purple diamond for $14.95. Yeah, some shitty castle. Okay, I'm gonna say it's $9.99. $12.99. Tie into the sky, or make this underwater scene come alive. Watch the colors pop right before your eyes. Sending secret messages has never been this fun. To keep them super secret, erase them when you're done. Magic turn a princess dress from purple. Secret <laughs> messages. <laughs> Let's kill <laughs> mommy and daddy. To create amazing artwork, never possible. Let's kill them all. Mistakes can't be undone. Magic pen easily erase mistakes from perfect pictures every time. Combine both magic. Are you too stupid to color the lines? Yes. Magic pens are non-toxic and easily erase off your skin. You can start creating your own magic today with magic pen by Camel for fourteen ninety-nine. Oh shit! I didn't quite have it, but I made it. I was the closest price without going over. Ah, that's garbage. Which Ben looked. <laughs> we all know TJ did Ben look. Pika Ben, that's what I call him. Yeah. Yep. Hash, hashtag Ben looked. Yep. yep. Yeah. Pieces of shit. All right, the next one's called the Egg Extractor. Egg. Oh, Scotty's. Egg. Scotty personally endorses this product. Because he wants you to get cancer and die. Cancer. Yes. Actually, I want them to get heart disease. Ben, cancer Come on. is the answer. He'll film it and put it on the internet. Retired man has a feeling for what seems to be hours. Whenever you want to enjoy delicious high protein eggs, healing is such a pain. And one has there has to be a better way to kill eggs. Delicious high protein eggs. Better way. The most amazing new patented invention that will change the way. It's amazing. That's a whole lot of eggs. What happened? Hard boiled eggs instantly. It peeled a hard boiled egg instantly. Egg egg salad, apple egg delight, egg triangle. Any egg dish you could possibly want, and I personally endorse this product. I personally look, Ben. You, you know, we've all been there. Maybe not you, Ben, because there's something wrong with you. You don't like eggs. I think eggs are disgusting, but I don't think they cause cancer. Okay, Ben, they definitely do cause cancer. But you know what? <laughs> I still endorse this product because you know what? It's delicious cancer. Come on, guys. Delicious cancer. Look at, this, I mean, look at, this, look at this picture that you froze on. Like, want to fill, wanna fill, egg, wanna fill <laughs> boiled eggs with runny dookie? You need the <laughs> accelerator. Like, come on, dude. Actually, in uh, Britain, those stuff. are called pancakes. Just... Yeah. The... Oh, okay. <laughs> those are British pancakes. <laughs> yeah, we're watching the, uh, the British pancake infomercials. Tap the top of the egg. Place vertically over the specially designed extracting hole. Cover with the peeling bellow <laughs> and press down. Extracting Voila. hole. A perfectly peeled egg. And great taste. Of... That's a tattoo on TJ's ass, ironically enough. The extracting hole. Extracting hole. With an arrow. See, it's not going to appeal to Paul or TJ. It's like a salad. They're, they're like, what's this shit? Like, where's the egg? It's all crumbly. It's on top. There's I no don't, bacon on it, though, for you, TJ. I don't really like hard-boiled eggs that much, even though I do like eggs in general. Eggs. eggs. You like some eggs? I like eggs. Protein to all your favorite foods quickly and easily. The magic behind the extractor is pure science. Pure Look, science. At the tip of every egg, Not there is diluted a science, pure chamber science. of air called the air cell. The air cell. Inside the extractor, <laughs> pressure forces air... From the air cell and causes the shell to separate <laughs> from the egg. Wow, oh, how phallic and beautiful. Perfectly de-shelled. Wow. You guys, you guys it, have got to buy one of these for eggs, too. Extra you have to. yeah. it's, it's mandatory. The peeling by hand. Discover how many delicious joy when peeling eggs is a snap. And the extractor is so hot because have fun decorating eggs. Even stupid ass kids right. can use it. Everyone guess the price. Uh, I'm gonna go with, um, I'm gonna go with, uh, 10, uh, 9.99, 9.99. 14.95. I'm, I'm gonna go with, uh, I'll go with 19.99, but you get some kind of free bonus. Ah, you're an idiot. Delicious. Delicious. Your family will love. You never knew eggs could taste this great. But wait, that's not all. Call now. Yeah, you get some free microwave, egg microwave cooker. Egg cooker. Absolutely free. Look how Just fucking awesome it is. And handling. Easily make hard or soft separate shipping and handling for that right piece of shit. Order now and no. you get the extractor, 101 egg recipe booklet, and the microwave egg cooker all for just $9.99. Oh, that's over a $40 deal for Paul. Yes! Paul looked. 
Paul, you fucking look, you piece of shit. Yes, Paul man, looked. Dude, dude, Paul owns one of these. Yeah, Paul already has one. You probably one. own one, man. You motherfucker. Paul was watching this shit late at night jerking off. He knows. He knew. He's a piece of shit. Hashtag enjoy all delicious high protein egg dishes as often as you want with the extractor. You can make egg dishes as often as hey, you want. Hey, thanks for watching that commercial. Be sure to like. Uh, who the fuck are you? No one cares. Yeah, no one cares. Yeah, who's shit. this fucking weirdo and his kid? Next one uh, is Stream Machine. Stream Machine. Does it help you piss better or something? That was your favorite song. Now for some annoying commercials. That was your favorite song. <laughs> Introducing Stream Machine, the clever little gadget that connects to your phone and music player and streams music right through your radio. Imagine being able to enjoy all your favorite songs broadcast with crystal clarity. Yes, my favorite song. I listen to royalty free music. Isn't this, wait a minute, isn't this just a cell phone? No. A lot of cell phones can do this. Plug your fucking cell phone into a fucking car radio and. Even if, even if you have an older car that, that doesn't have the cell phone jack, there's still devices that you can use where you don't need this. Yeah, Absolutely. but old people don't know that. And that's who but Ben, there's a convenient thing right there. Come on, Ben. It makes, makes you, you the, the DJ. DJ. Your very own FM station. Well, you can make white people works. dance. Tune your radio to any unused FM station, adjust the numbers on the LCD display to match, and you're done. That radio wow. station now... That's actually harder than just hooking up your cell phone. <laughs> they really are trying to rip off old people, aren't they? Yep. Like, uh, tired of listening to your favorite jazz tune on your phonograph? On well, your now... Victrola? <laughs> on your Thomas Edison Victrola. <laughs> tired of having to crank it up, you know, it's too much work. No, you have to crank it literally with your arm to keep the record moving. <laughs> yeah, while the it, time. Yeah, to keep it playing. <laughs> <laughs> Mary had a little lamb. If you could hit turn, if you sh if you turn it too slow or too fast, it speeds up and slows down too. It plays only what you want to hear, and if you're using Sweet. it in the car and you get a call, no problem. Hey, are you close? So just left the grocery store. I'm close, ben. <laughs> I, hey, by the way, There's I have something AIDS. so subtly wrong with this scene here. Stream it's Machine is also a hands-free mobile device. No wires and no Bluetooth required. Stream Bluetooth Machine is works evil. With any device that has an earphone jack, including tablet. None of that Bluetooth shit you can't figure out. Don't worry, old fucks. Because Bluetooth is so. If you understand FM radio, you understand this bullshit. FM radio. I only, I only respect AM radio. From apps or internet radio too, and it can take over any sound system. With I only take tuner, telegraph no messages. Shit. Jimmy fell in the well. Oh my god. $14.95. Look at this. And again. Nineteen ninety $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.95. $14.
I'm gonna go with. Hold on, I got. I really gotta think about this. Speed it up Ooh. when you play it again, TJ. Gotcha. Hit the hit the plus sign like three or four times. Gotcha. 1999. I'm going with 1999. I'm gonna agree okay. with Paul. So we're all agreeing. Yeah. Jacket. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo! 29. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> what? Plus 9.99 shipping and handling. Oh, processing and handling. 40 ben. bucks for this piece of shit. <laughs> processing and handling. Not shipping and handling. That's fucking so That's crude. That's extra. That's extra. Well, you want to ship quick? You got to pay, Ben. Yeah, it's so it's so inexpensive. Who's your favorite? My favorite's giraffe. My favorite's the monkey. The monkey. All right, we're gonna do one more, and then we're gonna drop off of YouTube to do the post show. Fucking YouTube, the post show. One last time before we do this final video, we just want to remind everyone: for the next 24 hours, the promo code TJ sucks ass. Five dollars yes. off. Five dollars off anything from our Teespring store. There's a link in the description, and I'm sure uh, there will be a an annotation in the video here. Yep, indeed. Do so. it. Do it to it, y'all. There's two new products there, as well as our old favorites. So, all right, here we go. Uh, this is. S I don't even know how to say it. C uh, S C O U R. S C O U R. Scour, scour power. It's scour, scour power. Scour power. That's weird. Uh, scour power. Scour power. The power of scour. You clean and clean your kitchen sink, but can't get rid of that stink. You need scour power. It's the first and only scrubbing brush made specifically for cleaning stinky kitchen sinks. Look. Wow, these bristles are scouring down there. Uh, awesome. Yeah, look at how they're My doing life is so empty and meaningless. I often think about this. how my sink, like, what's going on underneath my sink? What's going on in my sink? I'm finally glad. I'm so glad there's a product that finally addresses this pressing concern in my life. This is the. Do the Twitter thing anyway. That ordinary sponge is always Boom. missed, but with scour power, you just plunge, that, twist, and to remove that sticky rind. All right, we'll just speed, speed through this as fast as possible. Yeah. Yeah. Look at it. Fourteen ninety-five. One million dollars. Nineteen ninety-nine. Jesus Christ. Ten dollars. And you get all kinds of free shit, too. All right. We're going to read wow. some I, I want, shit. I want everyone to know that the last bit there was an act of desperation from a sad man who absolutely needs to go to IHOP, like, right away. <laughs> I need 30 cc's of pancakes, that. This man's flatlining. Give him some ch double chocolate chip pancakes. Oh, God, I'm coming back to life. Okay, someone asks, um... Do me a favor way, and just lay a flapjack over my face and cut <laughs> the damn butter. Flapjack is in is uh, a raisin life? oat bar. No. And if you bring me a raisin oat bar, I'll fucking kill you, bitch. I'll fucking kill you as long as you're within arm's reach. No, I'll probably be too tired. Never mind. I'll put it on my to-do list. Stupid commercials. Sweet. <laughs> what? This is an this is the intro someone sent to us. Oh, okay. I love it. <laughs> I don't know the music's like bah, 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 bah. Send, someone sent us another one. But thanks. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's, that's damn. pretty good. So, someone sent us another one quickly. Please, <laughs> please. Oh god, that one's terrible. I mean, you like it, Paul? I, I I I thought it was okay. I didn't <laughs> get it at first, but uh, I got it. Uh, it was it was you know, it had its moments. Paul's like, what the it fuck had, did I? It had a tuba in it. And I, was I thought a kid, that was the I intro. Tuba. That was the actual ad itself. No no no. That uh, someone made us an intro. Oh okay. I thought I was gonna say I thought that was the intro. I, thought, <laughs> I didn't yeah. know if it was the ad or no, not. No, it's when the you guys ad. Here's, here's gotcha. the first ad. We're gonna look at it and then we're gonna guess what the price is and if there's any extras. Uh, Oh, that's awesome. This sounds like fun. Yeah. Going to bed is a tug of war. Yeah, Not it anymore. Is. It's what's up, defiant ass fucking kids? Like, step up one more? When I was that age, I go to bed when I want, bitch. Going on. <laughs> I go to bed when I want. <laughs> what are we watching? <laughs> We're watching a stupid ad. 
BFF. Draw jammies. Are draw pajamas. jammies. We're you watching draw jammies. Draw. Yes, I Watch. want fucking draw Use jammies. One of the Finally. To draw a picture. With draw Couldn't jammies, you pretty much draw on any article of clothes? Designs. Ready Look for the this. wash? 1999. I'm guessing 99. Wash. Yep. No. I'm going 29.99 on this. Oh, Listen, 14.95. Fuck you! Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? Come on! I'm going 19.99. No, 19 it's 14.95. Well. 19.99. Paul, if it's 14.95, I might buy it. Listen, you incorrigible little bastards! You've ruined my life. You don't listen to a thing I say. Please, for the love of God, go to your rooms and color on yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep or die. Or whatever. <laughs> Watch this. Your design disappears, and you can draw on them again. And then your Finally! Kid, design and next then your kid time. cries. Every wash gives you fresh pajamas to draw on. Draw jammies way. come with glow-in-the-dark and scented markers. I say markers. 19 dollars This is, this is $29.99. Just look pink draw jammies and Hold message it. that can only also send you six scented markers, okay. stencil sheets, and uh, three glow it comes. You get it all. That's a deal, though. Like, yes. lie, that's a fucking deal and a half, man. I might buy those. Yeah, you things. would have paid thirty bucks for it. See, we saved you fucking money. <laughs> <laughs> now you know about this great oh, deal. That's, that's a great price, man. Yeah. I, I give credit to this company. <laughs> I'm fucking ordering this shit. All right, here's the next one. It's zip it betting, as seen on TV. Oh wow. Mom always says make your bed, but it's too that hard. Fucking so bitch, it's not a. Oh my god, it's too hard happy, to make my bed. Because the cool kids know how to zip it. Introducing what? Zip yeah. It yeah. She it's zipped the bed, and her mom was like, "I'm so proud of you, sweetie." You make your bed super fast. Zip it's it bed fucking revolutionary. Like so it's easy, fast, and fun. It zips in just a second. Look, your bed is <laughs> done. Lazy, our country and oh, mother shit. Shit. What about kicked off covers? Cutting this loose and all wrong mean oh my like god, it's all year long. What's but going on in this country? Just one tug, and your kids will stay your snug as a bug. Your fucking covers off your fucking bed. One store, all your I stuff. I say thirty-nine ninety-five. <laughs> I'm going twenty-five ninety-five. Dude, this is like oh. a fucking, it's like, you know, the double down of fucking <laughs> products. It's like, your kids are so dumb, they need to be like fucking zipped into fucking bed. Zip yeah. your fucking kid into a fucking bed. They like, just sell this straight. But, like, it's this huge you know? problem, like, your covers fall off your bed. Oh, no. What will happen if the covers fall off the fucking bed? I want some of those hospital <laughs> beds from the mental yeah. hospital in Terminator 2 Judgment Day, you know? The one yeah. I'm going 14.95. No Fuck way. you, Ben. Wow. Fourteen ninety six. That's a deal, dude. That's Fourteen ninety six. Thirty nine ninety five, y'all. Fourteen ninety six. No, I'm, I'm going. I'm going twenty four ninety five. I just dropped it a dollar. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, all right. No more I'm changes. I, I I I haven't even locked one in yet. Yeah. So I'm Come waiting. on. I'm yeah. Go ahead, Paul. Wait. Ten seconds, ahead. Paul. Ten seconds. I'm going. I'm going. Uh, I'm going. Time is up, Paul. What's your answer? Nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. Like your phone. What is your actual retainer and flashlight? Zip it has cool side pockets built in. Yes, yeah, side pockets. And your duds, trundle beds. Zip it go face. Fantasy yeah, it does force. all this shit. It's Rider wonderful. Princess. It's great. Sweet wow. stuff. Yep. Your bedding is it's never cool. a bore. Right. Zip it is radical bedding. That's yep. sure to excite. It sure is. Plus they glow wow, in the dark. Wow. 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 The matching zip it fashion pillow. Bed. You can go free pillowcase with your paid order. Free zip it bedding is not sold in stores. It's only available online. Right. Never How struggle much? with making a bed How again. Just zip it. Must be 18 years or older. Favorite oh, no, style. When us. now you can just oh, I gotta look it. it up. You can go up. I'm gonna have to look it up. Oh no! Come on. Yeah, in yeah. They didn't put it in the <laughs> ad. They usually do. It's gonna be 14.96, ladies and gentlemen. 39.95. 14.96. Plus and handling. Plus processing and handling, TJ. Mom always I would, says. I would mock the laziness of this, but I'm not gonna lie. When they make the robot that beat you off, I'm okay. I'm immediately oh. gonna buy. Wow. Holy shit. Well, I'll tell you what. It, it, they The price ranges by bed size, for one thing. Okay. And right. uh, a, a twin bed is fifty nine ninety eight. What oh, the fuck? Oh, oh, no. Damn. Plus shipping Freaks. and processing. Fuck this bed. Yep. Fuck and that. Give me the pajamas back. Is... Man, my fucking covers wait, can fall off who's... the fucking wait, bed. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's available in Queen? Yes. Who the fuck is buying the <laughs> zip it for the, their queen size bed? Dude, that's something oh, you would do. Nah, well, when they get it in King, let me know. When they get it in King, shit, that sounds really convenient. Zip oh. my fucking bed up to make it. <laughs> sounds like the life for me. Is there more for this? I like this. This game is fun.
Yes, there's yep. absolutely more. We're, we're still right. playing. <laughs> I was I win by the way because I was the closest. No, we're bullshit. gonna do this until the I end of the $50. show. You, you said uh, you didn't I said fifty dollars. You said fourteen. No, I never said that. I never. You're oh, yeah, a fucking you liar. <laughs> you bitch ass. I said mother. Show me the evidence. It's right you guys there are liars. Video. It's right there in video. That video's been doctored. Shut up. <laughs> this is the air curler. Air curler? Does it take forever to get that perfect curl in yes, your hair? Yes, it does. And it sure the fuck does. Ow! 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 God damn. I curl these luscious locks. What is happening here? The revolutionary what? new styling tool that creates <laughs> she the is perfect fucking curl every time. Curling the shit out of her hair. It sucks and the it cuts. Place a the section of your cut. hair in the air curler. Then turn on the blow dryer. Look what closely, the fuck? Just like a it's curling the hair. Air curler spins. That is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. It looks like it, it is just curling. Her, her it, it would just yeah. tangle your hair up. This That's is a revolutionary product. I'm gonna step out of the room for a moment, but I I do 14.95. 14.95. Nah, this is 19.99. Not all your garbage. No, you're wrong. You're wrong. No way. Too? What are you smoking, buddy? What are you they're, smoking? They're selling this to women. It's 19.99. 19.99. Yeah, you go, TJ. You're a fucking smart guy sometimes. 19.99. Very rarely, but sometimes you have your moments. Your hair for loose, go luscious, 99. trendy curls in less than. You, I like that. Yeah, yeah, 1999. Like Man, that fucking democracy at work. Here's how You're gonna it works. win, Paul. Curler spins your hair like a tornado to dry and curl your yeah, hair. Yeah, it's like a tornado. Air curler That's is great. a hair dryer and a hair curler all no, in one not. for tons of curls instantly. Air curler eliminates dirty teeth, so it's the safer, healthier way to style your it's hair. Healthy. No how long your hair is. How is this fucking healthy? It's healthier to subject your well, hair to a mini healthy. tornado to curl it. That's what's <laughs> My hair feels so <laughs> healthy. I own this product. My hair feels so healthy. God, it feels so lush. You'll be amazed at it's the lush. results. Now create a whole head of yeah. loose, tiny curls that I feel, like, I feel that like this commercial could be condensed down to, Hey, you stupid bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you need Put this. the wind tunnel. <laughs> all day. Style a sexy I had the hurricane experience when I went to the mall. It was oh, crazy. Yeah. This can apparently do that. Yeah, right. Or a flattering face frame. Or just create a few flirty... Yeah, well, your hair ain't gonna fix ugly, bitch. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm going up in price, though. Unique curling attachment. You are? Oh, Go damn. I'm going up. I'm going, going up. I'm going... I'm going... I'm going 29.99. I said it. No, yeah, said you're it. wrong. Ah, oh, you're fucking wrong. It's 19. <laughs> not, even, not even close. It's 19. It's a hair dryer, and it guarantees beautiful, soft, tangle-free curls that last wow. all day. It sure does, It's never been it? so easy to create hair that looks so good. Look again. Select the hair you want to curl, and watch the beautiful yeah, curl take shape. It's proven to work. It is a miracle of science. <laughs> you can see it. Jesus Christ, you can see it. Praise the Lord. Go from straight hair to wonderful curls. Yeah, let's figure out. All right, let's costs. see. It's 19.99. If it's anything 14. else. 14.95. Bullshit. I want to see I it. I win. 29.95. No. Bullshit. Boom. That's just Watch. his guess. I was the closest. We haven't announced the fucking price. We yet. haven't announced it yet. It's gonna be 19.99. Oh my god, they just show the same shit over and yeah, over. Yeah, yeah, it's no. great. What is this? It's like an illusion. Oh. oh, it's bullshit! Oh, oh man! What? Five fuck or four shit. cents off, motherfuckers! No, fuck yeah. Oh, yeah! Yeah! Bullshit! Yeah. yeah! You looked at this ad beforehand. <laughs> the game That's is rigged. Hashtag ben look. The game is hashtag rigged. Ben yes. Ben look. Ha ben hashtag Ben Look. Put it now. <laughs> hashtag Ben right Cheated. There. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater. Hey, look, Ben Gazi. Ben, right come on! You get two. Your offer. I'm you impressed with the players. All right, what's next? I was impressed with one. that price, I must say. Yeah, you, you like these products. Oh, I win. <laughs> they gave it away. I yeah. win. They gave it away. That's a All fucking right. deal, man. It's 14 bucks for that thing. What the fuck? Or not, it away. They got me with the 14. You don't even have long enough hair to use it. Come on. The next one is yeah, <laughs> Swifty Sharp. Can can you even guess? Is it, what some, kind of, a, is it some kind of pen or something? I yeah. don't know. Is it? Uh, got to be. I, I have no idea. That makes no Look sense. Look familiar? A drawer full of dull oh, okay. I'm totally tomato wrong. squish, bread loaf squash, and a dull blade just chews up meat. Don't yeah, it's called sharpen the fucking blade or buy a better <laughs> There's knife. got to be a better way. <laughs> Toss Don't your be favorite lazy. dull knives. Get Swifty Sharp, the incredible new what? cordless motor. What? like sharpening a knife? It's like a revolutionary <laughs> thing. Like, when a knife gets dull, what do you do with it? They just like, look at it, throw it away. It's like, no, you can sharpen it. Oh, oh my God. This is a revolution. Eureka. This is going to change the way the kitchen works. Yes. <laughs> a knife sharpener, everybody. ...that restores the razor edge on any blade in seconds. Look, this knife is dull, but to really destroy the edge...
Not as dull oh. as you. We cut into a rock again and again. But never fear, Swifty Sharp is here. Just press the power I, button, I was insert the blade yeah, in the guide, I was and terrified. Slide. Now hone that edge once, twice, and those blade precision slices as fast as one, two, three. Wow. I like how they brought Casey Kasem back from the dead to do this info. <laughs> Hi, this is Merkel. Casey Kasem. And today, yeah, yeah, it's like. Can you do Shaggy? <laughs> uh, I would need to practice it. Okay. I, 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 can do, I can do some Shaggy. Do it. Do I can, it, Paul. And I can do Scooby, too. Do awesome. It. Do it, bitch. Uh, Shaggy is. Oh, uh, soaring. Come on, <laughs> Scoob. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty terrible. Good. You gotta add something sexual no, for that Shaggy. Was, that was actually you know, good. It was, it was good, freaky man. shit. And then, no, and then my Scooby. Scooby's much better. It's the Scooby laugh. It's all I can do, so don't ask me to do anything else. It's a... Okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Like, don't touch me there, Scoob. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Oh. <laughs> don't touch me there, Scoob. <laughs> yeah. It's getting Zoinks. dark. Zoinks. <laughs> wow. With Swifty Sharp, it's so as how easy much? as I, I guess fourteen ninety five. No, nineteen ninety nine. Twenty nine ninety nine. Fourteen ninety five. Uh, nope. Man. Can't do it. I already got it. He doesn't um, never. I fucking guessed the same thing twice. Twenty nine ninety nine. I'm gonna I go, say I gotta go price is right style then and, and do uh, thirty flat <laughs> and everything above. Flat. I win. <laughs> Let's see. Simply place the blade in the guide yeah, and we slide. Got it. Yeah, the you guide holds us. the blade at the perfect angle as the, the professional grade angle. high speed they sapphire say sharpening it's stone rotates. They gotta say 800 times more. It's mandatory in infomercials. <laughs> This is how it works. 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 <laughs> oh, you know, normally this would cost you a hundred dollars or more, not but it cost one hundred dollars or not more. That. Swifty Sharp is safe, compact, fourteen ninety-five power bitch. sharpening at a fraction of the price. And now the Swifty Sharp is oh, yours. Oh, Call now. Man, fucking cheated. Sharp.com. And as a man, one, cheated. I'll tell you what. The, the, the thing. Ben, straight up look. Oh, if, if I would have if if looked, if I if I would have looked, why wouldn't why didn't I get the exact Throw us off. right price? Because, yeah, Throw because that's no, no, no. you can say this like, now. It's the it's same off. reason. Oh, I'll tell you what. Hold on, hold on. Already up in this bitch. No, 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 no. It's the same reason why you guys couldn't figure out how I could win money in Vegas. Basically. No, Ben. Yep. No, that's self-aggrandizing. I'm aggrandizing. That's You're self-aggrandizing, sick. Ben. You looked beforehand. The reason, <laughs> the reason you won money in Vegas, I'm just Ben, guessing the, is because you cheated. No, no, I'm just guessing like the average price of all these things, which is usually around fourteen ninety nine, fourteen ninety five. That one looks more expensive, though, than knife sharpening. It thing. looks it that way, but it's garbage, and that's why it's not. All this shit is garbage. It, it, it is garbage. always fourteen ninety five. And, and, and also the thing, the thing not, about Vegas too was that, the, that was not TJ. The jammies, that was TJ that said you couldn't win oh, the money. Oh no 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 no! You're right. And you're I was right. like, no, Ben's won money before. Yeah yeah. He knows you're what the right. Fuck he's doing. I was wrong. Yeah. Scotty Scotty did say that. The draw jammies. Those aren't worth it. And then TJ, I remember you won that fucking seven hundred dollars, and you like, fuck you, Ben. I'm better at gambling than you. Then you ran away. I did not say that. That's what you said. You're like, fuck you. I'm the best, and like ran away. <laughs> you, that is what you did. You okay? You're like I'm the best. Still, I'm the champ. I still left with more money than TJ. Around. No, I no have I have the best strategy for a casino, yeah. man. Yeah, I, if you that? use my strategy, you're like almost guaranteed to win. <laughs> I say almost. It's like fifty. He's figured out the secret to casinos. Right, let's hear this. Yeah. No, uh, let's I did. I did this the past this three or four times. I went. Have you ever, have you heard of the Martingale system for uh for roulette? Nope. No. No. It, it it's it works so well that the casinos have like added new rules to to like stop people from doing it. So what you do is you either you pick red or black, and you you put down the minimum bet, and then if you win, you know you take your money back and start over. Uh, if you lose, you just double the bet, and it, so whenever you lose, you just double the bet. And then what happens is you're making it so that in order for you to lose all your money. You have to lose, like if so. Let's say you're putting the money on red. You have to, black has, has to come up like within five or six times or something like. Like it has to be all black five times for you to lose. So the idea is you like nickel and dime them away, and then you usually end up walking away with a lot of money. So, but the the, the downside to it is now that they put maximum bets in there, like you could win four or five times going to the casino, and you probably will. And then like the sixth time you go, you might just have an epic disaster and lose it. Tremendous amount of money. But I it most me, of my... I've done it. I've done it a bunch of times. It, it works every time I've done it. 
I won most of mine uh, playing craps. Yeah. 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 I don't even know how to play craps, but I should because it, I've been gambling for a while. It's funny. It's funny because craps is made to look like the most complicated game ever, when really it's very simple. Like. That's true. And it, it's made to look that way on purpose. To, to try to confuse people, but it's really, you you look at it and it's like, what are all those things on the table? But really, it's yeah. it's, yeah, it's about rolling yeah. dice essentially. Yes. Do you have a strategy <laughs> that you use all the time or no? Yes. Or is it, okay, so it's not dependent on the other people around you. Like you can stick no. to the same thing. No, no, actually, you're all playing together in craps. Mm, okay. So so like whoever's rolling the dice, you you want them to win because that means you're going to win. Mm, okay. Right. Oh, that yeah. That's why every, that makes sense because that's why everybody's rooting for everybody. Yeah, and yeah. if you'll notice, if you're ever in a casino and you hear like a crowd of people cheer, that's usually from the craps table. Yeah. Yeah. yeah someone's yeah. rolling well. Yep. And every now and then you'll get we. Uh, I was actually yeah. at a table where a guy was rolling in this really weird way, and he kept getting yelled at, but he kept winning. <laughs> oh wow! And, Don't and, roll like that. Yeah, yeah. And me, and, me and Ben saw at times where people rolled like they rolled well at five or six times. People were just winning like thousands of dollars right in front of us. It was crazy. People been like ten thousand, twenty thousand dollars each roll. Yeah. I mean, Someone near me would win five thousand. I'd win like a hundred. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. <laughs> like yeah. That's good. <laughs> You'll also. Re well, this is. Yeah. So next one. This is quick. Quixels. Quixels. Yes. Uh. Uh, Build your world. Oh, Blast man. your world. What? Play your world. Play with Minecraft Rip the that fuse with the black Are you I too poor to afford a computer? Yeah, that's essentially. I gotta what be this honest is. with you though, those are pretty badass. Yeah, <laughs> I used to like uh, Legos back in the day. Yeah, but Legos is like better than this. Yeah, Legos is This is garbage. Fourteen ninety five. Nine ninety nine. I I was gonna go with fourteen ninety five too. <laughs> Nine ninety nine. I'm sticking it's to garbage. my guns. I'm using I'm, the Meinhofer system or whatever the fuck that was. I'm, I'm sticking to my guns. 1999. Meinhofer? Yeah. Meinhofer. The Meinhofer. Yeah. The Meinhofer. Uh, it's a Nazi know. set. Meinhofer. I don't know where to go with this, but I'm gonna say. TJ is shizen. I'll say 1499. 9.99, bitch. You're a bitch, TJ. Yeah, you're a After bitch. After one, Quixels lets system. you craft your own real-life pixel monsters, fierce warriors, and more. Choose your design and position pixels one cube at a time. Then use the special blaster Sounds to tedious. 9.99. Just a blast of water lets you create an entire quixelized world to stage an epic battle. Sweet. You can even quick. Wow, that kid is really lame. He's really fucking into it, dude. <laughs> Quixels are awesome. Quixels will change your fucking life, DJ. Own designs. Build a walking mind. This is such a blatant ripoff of Minecraft. Space. Deep sea adventure. Jesus. Even build a kingdom of castles, dragons, and knights. Dragons. Tons of designs you yeah, can yeah. create. The only limit is your imagination. I am a dragon, though, in all honesty. The only limit is my imagination. No, there's way more limits than that. I mean, come on. I you feel can't. Like a child, because. It's not like you could, like, recreate the Mona Lisa with this shit or something. Maybe you could. <laughs> Maybe you I could, like a TJ. Because I watch this and I'm getting into it. I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, hey, look at that thing he built, man. It's fucking awesome. He's already got an order going. He's like, shit, I need that, I need that. Man, you are the, yeah. the starter pack. You just need to not even watch commercials and shit. I know. you literally wanted everything. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm like, ooh, that doesn't look I'm bad to me. I don't know. <laughs> That'd be like if I was like, man, that egg rolled, I need that. You don't even need eggs. Oh, I need it, though. I want to make yeah. the eggs and look at them. It's like a work of art. Your Quixel's like, design pack for 1999. Oh, yeah. bullshit. Oh, oh, yeah. Bullshit. I should have gone with, with Paul on this one. Paul wins. Oh, Paul yeah. Luck. Paul Luck. Oh, our, shit. put in our guesses before we saw the water. Paul and Ben are in on it. Paul looked. Paul and Ben are in on this one. How dare you. Clever. Clever. Paul's honor. Paul. Make it rain, baby. Just pay Paul. me. Just pay They're me. They're on to us. We guessed before we saw the water shit in this, where they spray the it water on it. It plus shipping and handling of $9.99. Yeah, so really yeah. it's like, yeah. Sammy's I mean, right. $14.95. Pay him. $14.95. <laughs> what? <laughs> Shut up. That should be good. Just cut that in half, $5. subtract oh. it, and there you go. Next one is the Genie Hourglass. Sweet. Ladies, what's the trending new secret oh, to a perfect? What? It's a girdle. 
<laughs> what the fuck is going on here? It's like a corset. Oh basically. my god, it's a fucking corset, dude. Oh, that's not yeah. a girdle. I thought it was a girdle. No, a girdle's a uh, girdle's like turtle. below turtle, that. Turtle, turtle. Oh, a girdle's okay. like turtle. around like your turtle, pelvis. TJ. Turtle, oh. TJ. Turtle, turtle, turtle. It's turtle. hourglass shape. Turtle. Celebrities and fashion models are tweeting all about Tell it. Me this. If you buy this product, wait, Anastasia Pierre, hourglass shape in seconds. Has what happens when body? What happens yeah, when you get naked is. to have sex with somebody? Then what happens? Waste then you training. Know the terrible and choice. now it's as easy as fourteen ninety five. Two. It's one, a waist trainer. Two. Your uh, perfect body in seconds. Is too skinny. Oh my god, this is the stupidest product. This is fucked up, man. <laughs> I've known, I've known some people that have like corset trained and like. Oh no. Yeah, yeah. I've known people That's that. Weird. Yeah, yeah. They make their waist like. So small, it's unbelievable. Yeah, but like, uh, why? It's not like we're still gonna want to fuck you. Why, what are you uh, doing? I don't know. <laughs> Genie hourglass price, guys. Oh, disaster. Nineteen ninety nine. Twenty nine ninety nine. You looked. No, I'm going. You're fucking locked. Must be wrong. Fourteen ninety five. I'm staying yeah, nine ninety nine. With the genie hourglass, the amazing waist training belt it's that instantly shapes, slims, and trains your feet like clothes. I can wear it when I'm working out, and it really works. The secret really is genie's I double think some compression of our fans waist training fapping. technology. Like, well, like, well, I can the hear, shaper, like, oh, oh, hold on, stop it, 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 just listen, do you hear the collective fap? Yeah. I can hear it. <laughs> All right. Your back improves your posture, improves oh, wow. your waist for the, the length of that hourglass shape. Nice. Heck yeah! Oh, TJ, you stopped it at the perfect. You wear the perfect that hourglass. Yeah, because you know if you wear this fucking thing for a while, all of a sudden, you lose all of your fat. <laughs> you look like that. You're gonna look just like that. Come on, you didn't buy one, man. Baby and body, fake, too. God. Baby all body, God. Bye bye, baby to look body. Two sizes smaller. Fuck is baby Why body? wear it? The oh, better okay. I look from plus to perfect. Gotcha. Wear it over or under Jesus your clothes Christ. at the this gym, around the house. I like how they look miserable before they have it. They're like, life just isn't good enough. I'm yeah. sad by the fact that people have definitely bought this. Like, don't do not do that. There are just clearly some of the women in this commercial where it doesn't make a difference at all, and then some where it mm. does. Yeah, and some of them look like when they put it on, they're already skinny, and then they just look freakishly right, skinny. Right, right. That's... Yeah. Yeah. Work or a special night out. Everyone will notice, but no one will know your secret. Plus, uh, yeah, your yeah, teeny yeah. hourglass is totally oh, adjustable. Yeah. You Sweet. can loosen it or... You can make it as tight as you need it. Make it really tight. It's, it's pretty... If you can Fucked breathe, up. you've done it wrong. You Find can it shut down your order. I have to wonder who came up with this. This garbage. The difference. $14.95. Will hide a boring thing and give you a look that's wearing a shape and sexy. Plus, the more you look, the better you look. You're fucking mistaken, you fucking mistaken dude. Are they going to show it? Oh, God. Are they not going to show it? It's a fucking ripple. We it's gotta go look it up. Genie hourglass waist belt. We'll have that in just a moment. It's definitely Anyone more than 99. Because if it, if it was 99, yeah. they would have said it here. It's probably That's why I 30s. said 29. Like, oh, shit. It must be a like lot more than I've, Look, I've noticed that when they gear this shit towards women, they always charge more. You're really? Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, true. for sure. Is that your uh, male guilt? Yes, I guess. You're sexist. Guilt. How dare you say that? Oh, well, no, TJ Saxon. Come on. What's the uh, let's. Oh, it's 1999. Bam! Plus uh, 7.99 oh, shipping and count. handling. Yeah, oh, that doesn't. Handling doesn't yeah, so it's, yeah, it doesn't. But you know, whatever. Fuck. They them. make up their fucking shipping and handling prices. Why is shipping and handling so yes. different? It's oh, a of piece of fabric do. with Velcro. How the fuck are they charging that much money, man? This one's a ripoff, bastards. This is a great price. Do not buy this. Buy yeah. this. I don't know, man. I think it might look good on you, Kyle. Yeah, it would uh, do, it t put a, take away my gut a little bit. I probably should get it. Can you yeah. imagine the absolute tsunami of cellulitic fat that would happen <laughs> if I put one of these things on? <laughs> and then let it, you make a video of it. Go? It would look like two giant muffins on top of each other. <laughs> We, we I, would, I would I would literally look like two muffins like 
one right side up and one upside down. Yeah, that's together. what I was thinking. This needs to be shot yeah, yeah, yeah. with a slow motion yeah. camera so we can just that see the release. It's like it's like the dam bursting. It's like <laughs> it's like when you squeeze a water balloon in the middle. Did you guys see that uh, that that uh, Nicole Arbor woman yeah. and what she did with her video? Yeah. 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 And the, the funny. I mean, th uh, look, she, I don't care that she she said the shit she said, but I mean, she was an annoying little weirdo. Can we agree to that? Yeah, I can agree. You, you know what? I wasn't even gonna bring this up, but ironically enough, <clears throat> on our last show, we showed Lacey Green's response to that video, where she played clips of Nicole Arbor's video. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. And right. we ended up getting a content ID match. Oh, what a on that fucking oh. vicious prick move that is. For for less than one minute. Yeah, Lacey wow. Green. Lacey Green. Even though she was using other people's clips in that's her okay. video, that's okay. But that's when we try right. to use her clips in our video, no. No, that's the we must be the stopped. thing that annoys me is the hypocrisy of it, because she's made, Nicole Arbor's made free speech arguments afterwards. And then meanwhile, you shut down all the comments in the video, you shut down the likes and dislikes, and you're going around doing stuff like that. Like so, th it works both ways. You can't just say I want free speech for myself and fuck you. That's yeah, I, I noticed about that. Sarkeesian too. It's true. Yeah. yeah, Kyle, did you ever hear about what happened uh, with Anita Sarkeesian? And you guys? Yeah. No, what happened? Uh, I was hanging out at, in uh, in some uh, public place, mm -hmm. and in in through the door walks Anita Sarkeesian. And I'm like, oh my God, Anita Sarkeesian. Like, what are? Sure, they? wasn't Anita's uh, hotel room, Ben? No. Are you sure? About and then that? I'm like, what are the odds? You know. So I I snapped a a, a a picture of like part of my face with her in the background. Uh huh. And then I and then I left, and she and she remained there after I left. Uh huh. I didn't say a word to her. I didn't do anything. And then I I, I tweeted the picture of it. Right. Next thing you know, I'm like a predator. Oh no! Are <laughs> you, you, you know, serious? Yes. You know, isn't it convenient, Ben, that you happen to just so, just go to a place that Nina <laughs> Sarkeesian was going to show up to 30 minutes later? You know, Ben, we can't prove that you know, but isn't it convenient? Isn't it just? Just by chance that you run into your one of your arch nemesis, Ben, someone you profess I, to hate. I know. It's so Many occasions said no, you hated. I never said and that. And wished their life away. I don't hate her. I really don't. How don't convenient, though, Ben, that that. Luckily, it was a public place and there was other people present. I don't hate her. I think. What her, would have happened that faithful day? We never know. We'll never know. I think her views are pretty crazy. Oh. Uh... That was supposed to be a stupid ads intro. It didn't go very well. Yeah, so <laughs> stupid ads. All right. All right, stupid ads. The genie hourglass. <laughs> what a great intro. The genie. Uh, yeah, yeah. I don't even know what the fuck that was. Yeah. Ladies, what's the trending new secret to a perfect Did hourglass? Did we watch this? Yeah, Some I think so. Yep. How about this one? Up. How about this one? Love burritos, but <laughs> hate the mess. You fill, fold, and roll, have, but could never no, get that perfect that. hole. No, we have to watch and this. store bought burritos are just not the same. <laughs> Introducing burrito store perfect. Store bought burritos. Paul, you fast, need this. Mess free way to make perfect burritos yes. any day. Watch. Finally. Just place a tortilla on the burrito perfect. Fill it with your favorite toppings such as rice, beans, chicken, lettuce, cheese, <laughs> okay, there's and way guacamole. Too many vegetables then fold in there for one, Paul. two, three, chicken and, and cheese. you get a perfect burrito with these. Uh, is all we can do. Maybe this some beef. There are you, have, <laughs> you can't fold the fucking burrito. Just changed forever. You know, do you not have functional fingers, Paul? I mean, what what's going Paul on? Paul needs this, TJ. He okay, needs this. I'm going to reveal something on the drunken peasants right now. All right, oh, I'm shit. a big guy, right? I'm a big dude. I got big feet. I have broad shoulders, but I have tiny little sausagey fingers. <laughs> Do you see these? Uh huh. Do you see these stumpy fingers? You have the, hand, fingers, you have the hands of a child. Cabbage hands that I have. Well, um, your I your wedding ring looks like shit. it's fucking like squeezing your <laughs> finger to death. What the ring? Yeah, you it know. Does, I, you know it, yeah, it does. It's, it's fine. I mean, I got I got the ring mark though. You know. Yeah. The, like, the, the, it's too tight. You need to get it up to a few sizes. Paul has the hands of no, a five-year-old. No, no. Look, I got space and shit. Look, there's space. No, uh, you're bad. You're bad. I don't know. So you need this product, is what you're saying.
How yes. much would you be this, willing to pay for a product like this, Paul? Fourteen ninety five. No, 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 not quite. I would give them nine ninety nine for this. No, I, that I'm sounds good. Nine ninety nine as well. I don't understand what it does. Does it just fold a burrito? Is that <laughs> yeah, nine ninety nine. That's what it does. <laughs> what do you mean? That's all it does. That's all it needs to what, do. What more do you fucking need in life? I, I'm just. <laughs> You're a cat. You can't even. You don't even have fucking thumbs. That's that's an amazing. No, look, Scotty. That's an amazing thing. This is an incredible product. I okay, pay good. Eighty-five dollars right. for this. Okay, good. Make sure you're on the same page. You don't even have thumbs, man. Come on. You know you need this. Nine ninety-nine. I'm buying this. One million. One million dollars. JF, how much do you think it is? Zero. It's ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, okay, I have to guess what it would be. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I would pay zero, uh, but it's probably, <laughs> it's probably, yeah. The guys are right. Seven ninety nine. I'll, I'll go for that. Oh, seven. It's one million dollars. Fourteen ninety five. Because you'll you'll probably get like two of them or something like that. Uh, you need that. Look, you can make crepes. I mean, this takes oh, more. Oh damn! Whoa! You also get the, the hard go, shell taco. Oh, wrecked you, man. Yes! Nine, 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 sir, nine. Son. I'm a burrito uh, king. I can do anything. Free. <laughs> Hate holding the taco shell and mess in your hand? Yes. Now just place your taco yes! shell in the taco gotcha. holder. Oh, oh my god. god. Rise with lettuce, this is cheese, amazing. Your favorite my salsa, life has changed for the better. Classic meat tacos. Classic chicken tacos. tacos chicken tacos. What? You can do chicken tacos, seafood tacos? What's next? Even tofu tacos yeah. are possible, TJ. You can TJ. do catnip tacos for yes. creationist cat. This is amazing. I'm buying several. All right, so the next one is Eggies. E Eggies, as TJ would say. Eggies. 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 When it comes to eggs, hard boiled means hard work. Yeah, Messy yeah, shells, TJ broken knows that whites, and you'll be peeling all night. Oh, well, no. not anymore. Introducing Eggies, the eggies. fast, easy way to cook hard boiled eggs without the shell. Just crack and pour in your egg, boil it right oh, on your stovetop, then twist it over for a perfect hard boiled egg every wow. time. Look inside. Holy eggies shit. cook your eggs just this like a real a shell. And the non stick to our interior means the egg slides right out when no you're done. Really Spend and hours some peeling eggs. Where's the yolks? You know, the crazy thing about this is, is that eggs naturally come with a shell. So why do you need to fucking crack a shit? If you're just gonna boil an egg, throw it in with its shell on, dipshit. No, need, because then the shell is impossible. She, it's impossible to get the shell off after. She'll be peeling all night. She'll be peeling Paul. all night. All long. night, Paul. You're all right. night. She's gonna be slobbing your knob all night or peeling eggs. Fucking disgusting fat fingers who can't do shit. You should be elated that this product exists. I would pay nine ninety nine for this product if there's a bonus like two for one or something else useful. I would pay it. And that I feel like that probably is the price again. Nine fourteen ninety five. Yeah. Nine ninety nine. You're fucking stupid. Nine ninety nine. Look at all JF, the eggs. JF, uh, what what do you think? I go for nine ninety nine, but I also think that it's a big insult to cuisine. <laughs> this is ridiculous, and I <laughs> hope that none of you will ever use this. You own several. Come on, you're now you're embarrassed. Like, oh shit, Part I've been out on the show. I hate this. Eggs is cracking the shell. You take your time. And by the way, I'm starting no. a YouTube cooking show soon, so I. I like oh, wow. what we see here because I think that people need guidance now. Nice. Uh, if people need help to fold a burrito, I will make a video for it. <laughs> <laughs> will you make a video about people that have little sausage fingers folding a burrito? I yeah. could. I could simulate. I, I could add an handicap and show you that even with small finger, I can be successful at cracking an egg. Yeah, I want possible. I Not once saw impossible. a man with no arms or legs roll and light a cigarette. If there's true. a will, there's a way. CC, do you have a guess? Well, you know, guys, if this folded an omelet rather than just did this, then I'd pay more than nine ninety nine for it. But um, seeing as how it just seems to do this one thing, nine ninety nine. Oh, oh, ten dollars! As a bonus, you'll get, you get the eggy slicer. Them. Just and the slice slicer. and slice. For Look at this. Hold on, JF. Come on, you need this in your kitchen. A Look at this. For egg, you yeah. Need no, no, no. You <laughs> win, bitches. You went yeah, over. Yeah. Do you really want to trust most Americans with knives, JF? We win. Well, They're buying Americans shit like this. Knives. Do you really want them to have knives? Anyone who who falls for this commercial TJ, probably does I'm not. I'm pretty need sure I said ten bucks. 
No, I'm pretty sure I said 10, but I win. They went over. 999's <laughs> over that now. <laughs> Fuck. I'm, Scotty, I'm reversing Scotty. the rules of math. Scotty, math doesn't Scotty, count anymore. Scotty, yes, Scotty would know eggs. He would know eggs. I don't know anything about eggs. I don't know anything about eggs. I'm right. I'm correct. <laughs> I'm, I'm scientifically correct. Do a study on it, somebody, quickly. Prove me right. <coughs> Next the first time that a, a price has ever been like ten dollars flat, zero. It's always no. Yeah, it's, it's happened before. It has. Happened. Also, uh, here, here's the here's the here's the next one. It is fashion flowers as seen on TV. Oh shit. I fucking need this product. Introducing Flash and Flowers by Mia. The flash magical fashion. headband with yeah, flowers that fashion, shine. But it's flashing. When nighttime is near, there's nothing to They're fear. Flashing. From the park to the dark. Flash and Flowers transform the ordinary into the extraordinary. All right, so Imagination's basically, look, what's happening Magic here. is created by wearing this product. What's happening here is that they're hoping that a little girl happens to be watching this and is like, Mommy, give yep. me the no, they just want these little girls to have a magical day. No. God, DJ's you're, you're garbage. <laughs> a magical hey, uh, day. <laughs> hey, 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 Kitty. Are you there? Is that the true Scotsman speaker? Listen. I want to buy these and wrap them around your live little kitty body. I'm going to make it look like a fashion tool for me. Can we do that? We can do that, especially since this just seems to be a glorified <laughs> Can anybody even fucking hear me over that? <laughs> ah, hopefully not. The, the, a glorified <laughs> crown of thorns? <clears throat> that's what he said. I think that's what this is. I think it's just a wannabe crown of thorns. You know, 1495. Wow. Twelve ninety nine. I think that's too high. I, I'm gonna go. Um, I'm. I'm gonna. Dude, I'm feeling nine ninety nine again on this one. I think you're too high, Paul. Mm, well. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go crazy high and say nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. You're fucking insane, DJ. You're fucking I crazy. Twelve ninety nine. I'm gonna say twelve ninety five. Ah. Oh, please. what is the price? Oh, oh fourteen ninety five. Ben yes. locked. Yes. Ben locked. <laughs> Ben fucking looked. <laughs> wow. Ben totally looked. But no, I come on, we all know you looked. 695 shipping and ending. Oh, oh ignore that. that. Uh, this is America. We only look at the actual price. Yeah, come yeah. on, The Jay. true price. Come on. Come on. <laughs> the true price. <laughs> yeah. 1495. I did not look. I'm the champion of the world. Yeah, you looked. All right, next one is Brow Perfect. Maybe we should have a Ben shirt that says fourteen ninety five on it. Yeah, and it, we could charge fourteen ninety five for it too. All right, so this is the Brow Perfect. TJ really needs shaping product, your seriously. brows is a real ow. Tweezing, mm -hmm. waxing, ow. threading, ah. all that painful stuff. Ah. It's enough. Oh. Hi, ah. I'm Laura Baker. Here to show you the fast, easy, pain-free way to shape your look. brows without the look ow. Look how your brows can look. No, I like bushy perfect. eyebrows. Just look at this nah, beautiful it, shape buddy. that was so easy to create. It's Simply that easy. Simply hold brow perfect at a 45-degree angle to gently remove hair. Wow, Instantly you guys invented easily. a razor blade. Okay, ladies, Congratulations. I want to know what you think. You're amazing. This is a perfect solution. It's so easy. This is it's definitely amazing. the answer to my hair problems. What makes you know, Proud Perfect so special? The thing is about stuff like this is that I, I don't really see that much of a difference between the before and after. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, no. women think that, think that this is such a huge deal breaker. <clears throat> and, and, like, I've never been like, damn, that, that, that chick's eyebrows are fucking banging. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, sure, you have. It happens Paul. all the time. Given you know, the intensity of your beard, uh, I don't expect uh, you to perceive subtleties. <laughs> no, ouch! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Boom! Just drop the mic. MCJF is fucking dropping bombs. Tonight. <laughs> Holy shit! He's all. He's also like. He's also Chef Jean Francois here. Also, <laughs> is this is how you cook. Way, I would like. You know, what I'd love to do. 
I'd love to hire Jeff as uh, my personal chef and then have him make me like spaghettios and shit every night. Spaghettios. Yeah, okay. I want some more thing, top ramen, the, Chef. The, the, the first thing is, is he would lecture you. Craft macaroni he would lecture and you cheese with some cheap hot dogs. Okay, if he's truly French, he would them. lecture you on like why he would never make that for you and make something totally different. Then I kick him in the balls. <laughs> you should make a. They're low hangers, I hear. JF, you should make a video on your cooking channel about how to make poutine. Because you told us that. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the, there will be many receipts of poutine. Okay. Wow. TJ will even try your recipe. Let's see if TJ can imitate the recipe. <laughs> That's just alert. Fail. No. No, so, dude, you so, have to do it. It'll be so you, terrible. J, JF, are you saying are you saying then that you have indeed seen a woman and been like, those eyebrows are on point. I really want to bang that. Uh <laughs> yes, I think that eyebrows have to be taken into consideration. Most of the eyebrows <laughs> effect on sexiness is subconscious, I would say. It's like I don't analyze the eyebrows and say, Oh wow. I, I don't say like just like you did. But, uh, yeah, I do think that the definition of the eyebrows is definitely part of sexiness. Huh. Well, I have to so think. he's an eyebrows way. guy. He's like, damn, those eyebrows. I don't think, I, I don't think it is for me because, you know, I, I imagine, like, any hot chick, and then I put, like, the ugliest eyebrows I can on her. and it's. I ain't looking at the eyebrows. It still is not making much of a difference. I can put some Groucho Marx eyebrows on a bitch, and it's still like, okay, still. Well, still, still all you're like, looking at is the ass. TJ's looking at the ass. That's how strong that claim is from TJ. And I would like the uh, viewers of Drunken Peasant to come with nice faces that become very ugly once you change the uh, eyebrows. And right. I'm pretty sure Do that it. TJ will be convinced. We should I all get... I have, a, I, I have a scenario for you, JF. Will you, will you, will you, will you, will you indulge a, a hypothetical with me? Go, oh, yes. I, I, oh, okay. I live in the hypotheticals. Okay, okay. So here's a hypothetical. Do you know who Cindy Crawford is? Yes. Okay, supermodel, right? Super hot back in the day, right? Mm-hmm. Let's say Cindy Crawford showed up at your house right now, and it's Cindy Crawford from back in, like, 1995. Super fucking hot Cindy Crawford. She's, yes. wearing, a, she's wearing a sexy bathing suit, and she's like, JF, I need you inside me right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. The only downside is, is that she has an, a, a unibrow, like a major, like, fucking caveman, straight across <laughs> unibrow. Mm -hmm. Are you telling me? That given that there's no sex, there's no consequences. I know you might, you may be in a relationship. Let's take hypothetically, you're not. Yeah. Okay. And and you and you can be assured that you're not going to catch any diseases. Do you turn down Cindy Crawford because of her eyebrows? Uh, I mean, the question. You, it's an experimental question. You would have to show me photos. I would have to see how big the eyebrows is. Uh, <laughs> The eyebrows could be theoretically so big that it actually obstructs the act of sex. Uh, <laughs> I, I would have to see what you mean. And I would <laughs> These eyebrows are obstructing my cock! He would go and grab an electric razor. All right, let me just ask you another question. Yeah, right? no lie. <laughs> would you have <laughs> sex? Shave this shit. No, no, no. Would you have sex with a giant sentient eyebrow that's nothing but an eyebrow if you knew for a fact that it would be the most pleasurable sex <laughs> in all of existence? Uh, no, but that, that's because I'm a traditionalist. So. Oh, okay. I, I'm more into complete women, not just the eyebrows itself. No, but if there was just an eyebrow, but you're only you're not like you're not marrying the fucking eyebrow. You're just fucking it once. <laughs> All right? And you're going to have you're not, you're not you're not whining and dining. Yeah, you're just fucking. You're going to have the best sex it of your life. It's demonstrably like you could talk to a future version of yourself from an alternate timeline where you did fuck it and he assures He's you like, like this is the bro. moment that your life turns around and everything goes well for you from here on out. Would you I still not fuck that eyebrow? No, I don't listen to future versions of myself. I want to warn uh, any future versions of myself that's traveling through time. I will not listen to you. <laughs> All right. I, I make that, my own fair. stuff. He takes that's a stand. Fair. He takes I, a stand. I, All right. I just wanted to test your metal on this eyebrow. I hope issue. you never invent time travel and have some, like, sidekick, you know. Tells you, put like, take precautions when you meet these Libyans. He's like, no, I'm not going to do that. It's like, I, that's I'm stubborn he's enough dead. to listen JF. to my own <laughs> advice against my future. Oh. JF's future self comes in. JF, you're going to be shot tomorrow. Don't stand on this street corner. I'll show him. I will stand on that. <laughs> Boom, dead. <laughs>
All right. How much is this eyebrow uh, removal tool? Nine ninety nine. I'm right. I'm letting it ride on nine ninety nine. Fourteen ninety five. Nine ninety nine. Fourteen ninety five. Fourteen ninety five. If it's more than nine ninety nine, it's ten dollars. Oh, oh. Fucking bullshit. You get two oh, of them. Ten dollars. Okay, Paul fucking looked. No. Paul, now, Paul no, fucking Paul looked. <laughs> we guessed nine ninety nine, not ten, Scotty. You guys yeah. are still fucking closer though. That pisses me off. That one cent really threw him he off. He gets Paul. so mad. Yeah, I know. This is fucking bullshit. I've been fucking robbed. <laughs> fucking see you guys later. Fucking parking lot. Let's see. Paper bling. Finally, a product that understands me. Paper bling. It's colorful and bright and looks just right. It's easy to you make express and yourself. to wear on your neck, wrist, ears, or in your hair. Introducing Paper Bling, the paper bead maker that lets you create beautiful jewelry in no time. And best of all, it's so this shit as easy. Beautiful. Anyone can do it. Just trace your template, cut it out, slide in the Beauty paper, turn it onto the twist, beholder. seal it, string it, and slip it on your wrist. Um, paper Bling makes beads out of just spend this about much any time. kind of paper. Making a fucking lame paper bracelet. I mean, maybe it just seems like an un totally unnecessary product. In Fourteen ninety five. Nine ninety nine. I'm gonna go with. Yeah, I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with fourteen ninety five on this one. Ah, you're garbage. Eight ninety nine. Eight ninety nine. Oh undercut. damn! Undercutting us. Oh yes! Yes, victory! The incredible Damn. price of ten dollars. Should have had faith in in the true Scotsman, man. I know my useless tat, dude. I know my useless shit. Dude, the, Paul has seen all these commercials. This one's He's called. Just recalling. He's going to his memory bank and going, "Oh, okay, nine ninety nine. This one's called Whoopi Magic. Yeah, Paul's like sitting there watching this commercial, like, "Oh yeah, I saw this on, you know, uh, February sixteenth of last year." It I was, was a sitting Thursday. on my couch, no, no, it's crying Saturday myself to sleep in a dancing with the Saturday. stars marathon. Yeah, I remember now. What oh, is sadder? Tell me, sad. Tell me the sad yeah, story. It's actually sadder than that. I saw this last night, sitting on my couch in a pair of uh, uh, piss and shit stained tidy whities <laughs> Um, uh, picking at the gravy that had dried up on my hairy man tits, uh, that I didn't, that I didn't have the, uh, the ability and, and kind of looking down so I could see my over toenails and, and I saw this. Yeah. It was I mean, at 3 a.m. Paul, I might have asked you to stop. You're giving uh, Ben a serious Paul, I reaction. I can actually prove that story is false because okay. there's, there's no way that you could have seen the television over your massive gut. <laughs> that you, okay. You got me. Nailed me. Awkward sets. Massive. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. This is 10 bucks. So, CC, I guess we have footage of your slave, <coughs> uh, Vadim, on some kind of dating show. Yeah. Huh. What about it? I, I don't know. Is it is it footage that we can show here that's like royalty free? It's definitely look. This, this is from a cable, a, a really low budget cable uh, show from New York City. The the uh, the the the, the, uh, the network has been gone for like over ten years now. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. So not worried. Like like it was a low budget, like no name. Uh, like channel to begin with, and they've been gone for like at least ten years now. So. All right. Third date. Okay. So third date. I don't think there's much wrong with it. Yeah, me neither. Oh my god. Hey, my name is Vadim. <coughs> I'm a screenwriter and performer oh here my god. in New York City. And I'm getting ready for my date with. So, Rebecca. if you ever want to see what uh, you know the definite, if you ever want to look in the dictionary next to the racist, <laughs> this is pretty much a picture yeah. you see. Yeah, here you go. Did you, oh. did you make your slave shave that pedophile mustache on? Yeah, those holy shit. Uh, I, I I was not in his <laughs> life at the point that this was made. I think this was he around looks 2004, like... 2005 that that this was made. 
And um, you know what? I'll tell you guys the story behind it once it goes on a little more. But yes, I will heartily concur that he looks very much like a pedophile with that mustache. <laughs> he, 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 he took his glasses off for the interview, those thick uh, pedo glasses. That was good, though. He, he had some uh, recognition of that. So. He's really funny and cute, and I was just sort of interested. No, he's in not. Him. He's creepy. Yeah, we've had a good time, but... Something about unibrow. Oh He's shit! He's plucking his fucking unibrow. Look if only he, with ten dollars. If he had yeah, ten, he, that ten dollar product, he could have fucking. Yeah. Exactly. What if was it called? It was I don't even remember. They should have called it the like, you know, wow or something. Incredible. Everything we've ever done, he's always worn a Hawaiian shirt. And he's really into snack foods. And he's really into that squeeze. Oh my god, I need stuff. that right fucking <laughs> now. Uh, you need <laughs> cheese whiz? Yes! I gotta, I gotta be honest with you right now, TJ, and I'm just gonna come off the top and you can tell me if you agree. I would fucking literally walk out into the street and kill a human being right now. <laughs> for a Ritz cracker with some extra sharp cheddar cheese squeeze cheese. <laughs> Paul, I would, I would say capital premeditated murder in the street right. in front yeah. of the house where my fucking wife lives. Well, let me tell you something. Squeeze cheese. Let right me now. tell you something, Paul. If I was on a space station and I was looking down on the Earth <laughs> and someone presented me with a button that would give me even a fourth of a Ritz cracker with a speck of the shittiest flavor of that cheese. And all I had to do was blow up the entire world to get it. I would do it in a heartbeat without the fucking slightest bit of hesitation. That's how much I want that fucking that, shit. That is yeah, fucking yeah, dedication. Yeah, TJ, well, you, you know what, TJ? If I were God... And, oh, shit. And another deity from a different fucking universe came to me and said, Look, <coughs> oh, I have this fucking Ritz cracker with some squeeze cheese on it. All you have to do is take every human being that's ever lived on the planet and make their entire existence a living fucking torment for eternity. I'm talking like having their flesh flayed off of their body and their bodies scorched by fire and then healed and then scorched again day in and day out for eternity. I would do it without even blinking, motherfucker. Yeah, well, you know what, Paul? That other god that came and gave you that fucking Ritz cracker with the cheese on it, that was me as a god because I got all the fucking Ritz crackers with cheese on them because I did that to a billion universes before your ass even cooked up your fucking universe. Man, fuck you, TJ. Man, fuck you, TJ. Fuck you, TJ. <laughs> I think we've determined who loves the crackers and, um, and cheese more I now, Paul. <laughs> The main reason that I like Vadim is because he's good looking and attractive. No, he's not. What? what are you talking about? What is this bitch smoking? He looks like too. a pedophile Our version of that weird love. character. He's like fucking the, eating Cheetos, like, Mary. damn, that's sexy. Yeah, you remember I'm something about right. Mary? He looks well, like that well, guy. Oh, I do? I got you this. I wouldn't point out that he has cheese on his face. Point out the fucking horrible mustache on his face. You got a shitty mustache on your face. Let me get that off. You got a little peach fuzz here. Let me, uh, let me, let me get that off here. Oh shit, that's really on there. Oh. <laughs> We're gonna have to find a a, a trash there can gonna to be a open fourth this up day. over because it it broke. I I dropped it. <laughs> I'm so I'm so sorry. I... Oh, and he's a klutz too. Okay, is this is this scripted or what? Yeah, it's scripted. It's, yeah. it's fake. Yeah. It's fake All as right. fuck. Okay. Stupid commercials. <coughs> Toilet tunes. Hand job. Hand job. Come on, they knew what what that was. When no, they, they didn't. They were uh. aware. Such a joyful little ditty. Yep. <laughs> it's always yeah, fourteen ninety five. It's always fourteen ninety five. Fuck. <clears throat> All right. Here's here's the first one. I I almost passed out. I laughed so hard when I saw this one. Next time you're feeling down, feeling that no one really gets you, or you're just wanting to hear some encouraging words, well, there's a solution. You can have what you want. You can do. <laughs> the finish line is closer oh, than you think. But you have to use it. This has got to be a parody. No, man. <laughs> <laughs> this has got to be a parody. I feel like Brett Keane needs this product, you know? I can see him listening to this. 
That'd be great. CD is eight tracks filled with encouragement and cheering oh. applause. It's even been featured on the Ellen DeGeneres Ooh. Show. We're on your side. We're here for you. <laughs> we believe in you. Oh my oh God, it's creepy. You're feeling better about yourself. We believe in you. Good you. job, TJ. We love you, you know, TJ. Uh, uh, 1495. <laughs> No, no, something like no. this is worth more. 1999. Call 1-877-545-6715 now to order the Cheers to You CD. And you'll uh, also receive nine, nine, three puzzle-shaped affirmative tokens. One says, I am courageous. Another, oh. I am unstoppable. And the third... <laughs> Hold on. Unstoppable? Hmm. Without me, the puzzle is incomplete. Together, wow. all these items normally sell for $35. But right now, you... <laughs> Hold on. Where, where do you normally buy these yeah. items for $35? Normally, when you have no self-confidence, the no self-confidence store, Ben. That's where you go. Ben, can ben get... just go get, go get the receipt from the last time you had a hankering for bad fucking CDs and terribly shitty made fucking trinkets. Yeah. Yeah, thirty five dollars. Twenty four ninety five. Oh my god, that's so much money for such a piece of shit. <laughs> oh man. We need to make a drunken peasants version of 25, this where it's full of discouragement. Twenty five dollars. Shit. You're <laughs> fucking a garbage. crowd while we just insult the person, you know. You're fucking shit. Never gonna finish anything. Never finish anything you start doing. Alright, this next one is laser bond. Things break all the time. So you try messy glue, but now you're stuck holding pieces together. Fingers Just get new sunglasses. Come on. Never works. What you need is Laser Bond. The amazing Lazy liquid bond. plastic that fixes, fills, fastens, and seals. Uh, okay, wait a minute. Anything. So the, the, the alternative seconds. to glue is glue. No, it's laser it's a bond. Laser bond. It's not a. La it's it's glue. Laser, laser bond. bond. It's fucking glue. Laser it's a laser bond. And it bond. Hey, 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 uh, TJ. Why, why don't you go get your Elmer's glue out of the closet and show me the LED laser on it? Oh, okay. I, <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I I just bought some Elmer's glue and a laser pointer. I'd I see an LED light, TJ. Well, you know. No, it doesn't glue or epoxy but a unique liquid plastic that only hardens with the uv light wow Watch in yeah real time. simply apply aim the uv light yeah aim yeah. the yeah. uv light three seconds, have three permanent seconds later lasts. permanent repair plastic, metal glass or wood repairs are fixed right with a uv light the sweet magic, a powerful <laughs> liquid plastic compound this is basically magic dude under ultraviolet light now fill in plumbing leaks in three seconds Shouldn't you be like pew! cutting the water to that first? Pew 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 pew. <laughs> it's like every repair is like a, stu a science fiction movie. You're shooting lasers, just like Captain Kirk and Han Solo, as you repair your leaky drain. Or less. Instantly repair kids' toys and keep playtime flying. The best part: the adhesive is made in the USA, yes! so it's guaranteed to hold time I'm sold for your on money now. back. Fourteen ninety five. I mean, nineteen ninety nine. That little helicopter thing they were showing, like the balance on those things, is so delicate. Was, there's no way it would be flying well. Yes, it was. It glued the blade with the laser down. bond, dude. The laser bond can do anything. These are first time users. It's not weightless. <laughs> Look at these first time users, TJ. Fourteen ninety five. Nineteen ninety nine. A hundred percent. Nineteen. I'm gonna go. With, I'm gonna go with Ben on this one. It's already solid. Come on! Wow. Futuristic. Watch. We can a futuristic. Can oh my laser God! No way. Both ends. Wow. The Holy boat floats shit. with no danger to the passenger. Oh my God! Amazing. Wow. Amazing. You can even laser glue a boat back together, y'all. So Watch we... him like step out of the boat, and the water is like up to his knees. Or <laughs> Let's something. see some glue do that, huh? Repairs look, can look you new can again. Sand it. If you, you mess up applying it, it, just wipe clean. There's no sticky residue, and it only cures with the UV light, so you can make sure the repair is just right. Call or go online to get your laser bond for just nineteen ninety nine. Ah, As a bonus, we'll yeah. get, Paul get it. The he fucking did it. Is free. You get a. You get a. He, he, you know what? Paul owns Paul one of these. He has a drawer full of these. <laughs> he owns this shit. A really powerful laser bond. What's next? Garbage. Fucking laser bond. Piece of shit. Fucking Paul. He fucking knew. He knew it. Just look at his beady eyes. I don't, I don't know what you guys are talking about. <laughs> there we go. Sorry, what? But it's such a pain to open Ow. that can. Ow. 
Ow! <laughs> Ow, my head! Why? Some good acting. Ow! And it spills and makes a... Oh, damn it! It didn't spill. She just There's... tipped it over. It's... Doesn't look like a spill when you just literally ah ha there. there. There's got to be a better way. Dude, I, think I do Pat like Robert, how they I... were artistic enough to make everything black and white except for the can and the peaches. You know, draws yeah. in I... the eye. Millions of peaches. Ooh. peaches a, I think that uh, I think Pat Robertson was the hand model for this shot. By the way. <laughs> No, those hands are not saggy enough, and they're too strong still. <laughs> they just like skeleton hands. I guess his hands are pretty strong from how tightly he grips every dollar that is sent to him, though. So. Yeah. <laughs> Mess. But now there's an easier way. Introducing Toucan, the world's easiest hands-free can opener. Just put it My on top of the can, complete. press the button, and in seconds, your can is open. All right, old people, when you reach the point when you can't open a can anymore, the solution is not this product. The solution is you need to be put in a home, all right? <laughs> and most cans now come with a thing where you can pop it open. Like, you don't, you don't need a can opener anymore. Like, sometimes you still do, sure, but for the most part, you can just buy the ones with the easy open. Yeah, you heard that, thing is... by the way, Mama. You heard that. So the next time you go, Peaches, could you open this can for me? I'm sending you to a fucking home. That's Send it. Send her <laughs> ass to the home. <laughs> Damn. Send oh, her straight, ass to the, the fuck home. Around. He's straight OG. to the home. He's OG. He's like, you gone, bitch. Ever since you DP'd her earlier, she's worthless. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Other automatic can openers get stuck. What? But Toucan has two times the power to cut through almost any it can. It has the power! Almost any can. What? Almost any can? It's, here it says cut through any can. Have you ever heard the heavyweight? Which one is it? Yeah, this one it says cut through any can, but he's saying cut through almost any can. You know, have you ever heard the heavyweight champion of the world say I could beat almost anybody? No. Toucan, you need more self-confidence going out there. You can open any can, even if it's made of fucking titanium alloy. Toucan can open that shit. Damn right. Small, medium, or large, without using your hands. It's perfect for people... Hey, you have to use your hands to put it on there. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. She's clearly using her hands right yeah, now. Yeah, she is. What the fuck? No. With arthritis, hand, or joint pain. With Toucan, you'll never struggle again. With just the touch of a button, Toucan does all the work. It's like magic. The it's second, like magic. I'm sorry, but the second you buy this, you should be struggling with yourself. Yeah. Toucan's uniquely designed blade clamps... What is unique about that Dude, design is, blade? That's exactly the same as every other can opener this, I've ever seen. This is seen. something you see at like 6 in the morning. It's clearly targeted to or, like the old people. Like, watch this! And it's like... fourteen ninety. It's gonna make your life better. Uh, nineteen ninety nine. I'm gonna go with... A low, low price of nine ninety nine. Damn. Wow. Down on the lid That's from the up, outside. Man. The strong onboard magnet prevents dirty lids from ever falling into the can. Countertop openers take up too much space. Fuck that. Look at it. <coughs> Fucking space hog. <laughs> but Toucan fits easily into any drawer. Wow. Toucan is easy to clean with its unique detachable blade. Finally, an opener you can sanitize finally. in the dishwasher. Toucan Fucking is the finally. last can I've been waiting for that day for all, like, you know, so many years Stop now. Stop struggling with stubborn jars, bottles, and cans. <laughs> its extraordinary design helps you remove the toughest bottle can caps. Can solve any of my life. So it's also a bottle opener. So you can easily twist off jar lids. When you have arthritis, it's hard to open a can. But with Toucan, it does the work for me. No. Order two it's can a bottle today opener. for just ten dollars. <laughs> yeah, uh, bitch. Fucking piece of shit. You fucking looked ahead of time. Woo! <laughs> Call right away wow. and you can get a second two can. Just pay some two for ten dollars. This exclusive TV offer is not available in stores and quantities are limited. Don't delay. Order your two can yeah, today. Yeah, limited quantities Call now. of this shit. Limited quantities. That means right. nothing. It's just let's be, like, you could say we have limited quantities. That's just there's limited total quantities number. of everything. Yeah. All right. <laughs> everything is finite. No, unlimited quantities of everything except for two can. <laughs> two can. Our most precious commodity. Well, Ben, two can play at that game. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! I wish I had a slide oh, whistle yeah. for that. <laughs> All right. Fuck you, TJ.
This is like the weirdest music for what, but this is the only intro I have. Yeah. It does, I, I think it works for this segment, honestly. It kind of does. Because it has the same blase, humdrum, everything is meaningless feeling that most of these ads do invoke. 1495. <laughs> <gasps> <gasps> Grandma, you have a pet? It's my singing parakeet. Oh, Jesus. No. Introducing Perfect Polly, the pet No fucking kid is going to run downstairs. We got a pet bird! Yeah, that's totally real looking. The way its head isn't even actually it's attached Disney to its body. Disney animatronic fucking ripoff. Yeah, <laughs> it's, its head is like severed from its fucking body. <laughs> tree, 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 tree. Yeah. Chirp, 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 chirp. I am a bird. When you enter the it room, looks like Pretty Petey from Perfect Dumb and Dumber. Polly is motion activated. Motion activated. When you come near, wow. She starts to move and say. Oh, oh, wow, so it, anno it annoys you the closer yeah. you get. It annoys the fucking living. Why, oh, it's life size. Why too. not? Why not spend twenty bucks and get a real parakeet? My mom is totally into this shit. <laughs> like the stuff that like punishes you for walking in your house. Like when you walk by it. Like my mom had Billy the Big Mouth Bass hanging up oh, in oh, our home. Fuck. And like, mm. and she had it on all the time. So like we'd walk down the hall and he'd Take be like, "Take me to the river," you know. And I'm just, like, she, she has like 90 of these little things. Oh, Jeez. that's scary. Why did why do people Peaches. feel the need to have furniture than shit that tortures you if you get near it? Peaches. I, I, I There's nowhere you can stand in my house without being fucking annoyed. Yeah. And like at Christmas time, it's even better because she has like all the little like Santa dolls that like pee on. Like she has like a like a snowman and a little dog that when you walk by it, the dog pees. He's on the snowman, and the snowman sings a song. Some of those trees that fucking jiggle. Yeah, we rocking had the, around the Christmas tree. We had the shit. tree that the the fucking creepy ass tree with eyes and a mouth. You remember that shit? I do not. That fucking thing was hideous. Like it was, it looked like a normal little plastic tree, but when you walked by it, these huge like goggling eyes opened up <laughs> and lit up, and this mouth Sounds came hellish. out, and it sang like Christmas carols, but in this really deep voice, it would be like Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. <laughs> That sounds horrifying. Yeah, it was fucking, it was terrifying as a child. All right, how much does the perfect poly cost? Uh, $9.99. They're charging $19.99, $14.99. Oh, fuck you, TJ. That's what I guess. Why would you put it in a cage? Oh, God. It, is it, you now think it's going to fly away? It turns it on and off. throughout the night. Get your perfect Polly today for only $14. Yeah! Oh, wow. I hate you. TJ hashtag, fucking locked. Yeah, hashtag TJ locked. TJ, TJ locked. fucking locked. Well, fuck you, what TJ. A piece of you shit. Fucking got, yeah. oh. You fucking have seen this ad before, TJ. TJ knows what's what. Yeah. All right, next one's called Roto Clipper. <laughs> what? When your grip is starting I to love slip, the ones that start like this. nail clippers Oh, my God. I'm old and stupid. And out. <laughs> <laughs> the amazing new we all felt the need the to imitate fast, that. Easy way to trim and file oh my god, that's horrifying! What? Time. Just push the button and insert your nail. Ah, in seconds, uh, you have uh, a perfect uh, nail. Just hurt looking like at it. Yeah, it really is kind of like that's cringe. Could you, you, know, you, you imagine someone this, doing that to your toenails? Oh my god, no! Yes. Don't even TJ, TJ, TJ needs now this. I know a way to torture TJ. Oh why, not, why not just grab an angle grinder? Can someone just... can someone send one of these to our PO yes. box so I can torture <laughs> TJ do not, with it? Do not. We'll do, do it on the yeah. show. TJ had to get his toenails clipped on the show. You know, there's no way that this is still available anyway. Send it to uh, this uh, address on the screen. I I believe on Wednesday show we're gonna open up. The mail too. Yeah. Some more mail. Yeah, we should have a fresh, uh, you know, shipment of mail. Mail and female. An electric mail. emery board. Uh, it precisely files each nail for a salon smooth finish. Ugh, it's ugly and it's horrible and I don't like it. One side to trim nails and the other side to file them. The secret is the durable. The secret. The s there's no secret. 500 RPM. To trim and shape fingernails. You're just sanding it down. That's it. Flawless finish. Clippings are nasty. Not any. 1495. More. No. 999. Yeah. I'm going with Scotty on this. 999. Uh, yeah, I'm saying that too. 
The blades are recessed, so they're safe to the touch. Roto Actually, I'm going to say they're not even going to fuck with the 99. I think they're just going to say 10 bucks. No, 999. Your skin, it's delicate enough. It won't even damage a balloon. With a special it's offer. It's hard to see when you clip your nails. But with Roto Clipper, you can trim your There's nails. There's a light. It comes with a headlight. Clipping I take it back. There's a light. A no, it's not. I've never seen anyone try to clip their nails like that. For, who, for who is clipping your nails a struggle, okay? I guess if you're like 98 years old and you should be in a fucking home... Maybe clipping your nails is a fucking struggle. Wouldn't holding this little thing and like maneuvering it around your fingertip be hard? You can hard? do it with ease, If Your Paul. hands are shaking from Parkinson's so bad. In some alternate can't... universe, this thing came first. They're like, are you tired of roto clippers? Well, try new fingernail clippers. The manual way to keep your nails trim and secure. So much easier than the roto clipper. Do you cringe every time you fire up your old your roto clipper? <laughs> I have a hard, All right. hard time bending down to yeah, turn yeah, my Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a shit. Makes it so easy. How, how is that any better? I don't know. I mean, like the same angle. The clippers at this <laughs> you gotta do, what? What was the magic about? She still, she still has to bend over you to fucking gotta reach do it. the same thing to reach the spot. I don't. Turn their nails. And now with Roto Clipper, they can trim their own nails. Doctor recommended, y'all. Get rough nails, snag your stocking. Roto Clipper grooms nails with smooth, even edges. Yeah. Kids will be chipper when they use Roto Clipper. They'll be chipper. Cutting my Kids nails will be chipper about. when they use Look at this Roto kid. He's like, no, I so don't do it. He actually wants to trim his nails now. He's like, yeah, I love it. Oh, it's not going to tell us? There's no price. Oh, what a fucking rip off. I got to look it I'll up. I'll look it up. Just move on to the next one. What a chip. Okay. This next one, no, you know what? This one isn't real. Anyway, uh, next one is the five-second fix. No oh, shit. The five-second fix. Damn. Well, Wasn't whatever. that the title of that Catholic uh, sex video we just saw? <laughs> Dudes, the Roto Clipper is nineteen ninety nine. What? Damn. But you get two. Oh, okay. So but there's six ninety nine shipping and handling, too. So it's like... 20, it's like 27 bucks for this fucking thing. Ah, oh, what a rip. <laughs> TJ, you should get one, dude. What a total Hell fucking no. rip. And if you buy it at Bed Bath & Beyond, it's 20 bucks. And by the way, get with one, 12, send it to me. I'm going to torture with TJ. 12 with 12 customer it. ratings, it has two stars. Oh, you need it, TJ. Out of five. <laughs> Yes, that's fucking because cheap inflicts, piece of shit. It inflicts physical. The people harm. have spoken. Dude, this that's one of those products shit. you can look at. You know it's shit. You know it's not going to work how they're advertising. It's just going to be. It's just something you're going to buy and never use. <laughs> when they make instant repairs on the job site, they use a welding tool to fix it right. But you wouldn't try that on a pair of reading glasses at home unless you had five second fix. Dude, TJ, you need this. Welding tool that fixes, fills, and seals I think we've seen this one before. In five seconds yeah, or less. I, I know I have. Have we? We've done this one. All right. Have we done miracle slippers? Uh, miracle I'm not sure. Let's take Play a look. try it. By the way, if you're watching this and you enjoy this segment, please send us more. Just look for infomercials because those are the best. Infomercials, they could be new or old. Just send the ones that you find amusing. Some old Ron Popeil would be awesome. Remember the Popeil rotisserie? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Set it and forget it? Set it and... Forget it. And he had that spray on hair, too. Oh, man. Dude, one of my favorite infomercials is the Magic Bullet. Oh, yeah. It, it's it, so good. Because, like, they pretend like they're, like, a bunch of friends hanging out, and they were, like, partying last night. <laughs> and there's the guy that's, like, all hung over, and there's, like, the old woman that has, like, a cigarette hanging out of her mouth the entire commercial. Dude, I remember, um, go ahead, never mind. No, no, no. I was just going to say, it's weird because the infomercial actually had characters in it. It did. It was like a story while they're, like, using this weird blender to blend things up. That is very strange. Yeah. Dude, one time I was watching uh, infomercials late at night. I was, like, I don't know, 13, 14 years old. And I, I was flipping through channels, and I saw this infomercial. like... Later on in this broadcast, I will demonstrate to you psychic powers exist. <laughs> and I was like, all right, I'm hooked. I'll see. You ended up watching the whole fucking So I sat there and watched this 30-minute infomercial for what product, I don't even remember. But it was something to do with psychic powers. Right. This was the evidence for psychic powers. He took a lemon. <laughs> he cut it in half. And he said, can you feel yourself salivating as you look at this lemon <laughs> and squeezing it imagine it on your taste buds even though this lemon is nowhere near you 
it produces a response in your body. That is proof. That's not psychic at Par all. Apparently, <laughs> apparently, yeah, it was Ben. Apparently, this idiot's never read Pavlov. Nope. It was. Uh, it's psychic powers, dude. Dude, it's just like if you're if you're addicted to cigarettes and you see someone smoking a cigarette on TV. Oh my god! Every time I'm like, yeah. What, what well, gotta go for five minutes, y'all. Uh, see psychic ya. power. What the fuck is classical conditioning? It's psychic powers for me to show you a lemon and ask you to a, a, imagine the sourness. I think you're wrong, on your Paul. I think he has read Pavlov and he's counting dude, on. Dude, they have horror. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they have these fucking horoscope scams now. Anyway, let's see miracle it, slippers. Oh, okay. miracle oh no, slippers. sorry, my Scotty. My feet are killing me. They're killing her. My feet are killing me. My feet are killing me. My feet are killing me. Introducing miracle slippers. The Revolutionary anti uh, we have not gel seen this. That soothe, relieve, and energize your achy feet and, and they grow Look. tentacles up your body, apparently. Yeah. Hentai Pressure style. Walking and standing can cause pain in your feet, <laughs> knees, and lower back. But, but these slippers, slippers fix all that like shit. Like a shock absorber to help relieve aches and pains. <laughs> Feel supported and so, relaxed. While so why can't you buy a pair of slippers and put like some like Dr. Scholl's? Yeah, Dr. So Scholl's in them. We put some Dr. Scholl's and some slippers, and we're claiming it's a new product. Yeah, they're they're definitely gonna charge twenty nine ninety five at least for these. Mm. Mm. Fourteen ninety five. I'm thinking nineteen ninety nine. Twenty nine ninety five. Yeah, I'm with Scotty on this one. No. Nope. I'll. Let's see. Guys, they added In Dr. Scholl's to a slipper. Slippers take the pressure off your feet and joints. It's Ordinary gonna be cheap, Paul. It's not gonna be that much. Fourteen ninety-five. No, this book's a crack, Paul. Twenty-nine ninety-five. Nineteen ninety-nine. Never flatten out, Paul. It never flattens out. Nineteen ninety-nine plus they come with some stupid bullshit. Then we dropped an egg onto the miracle slippers. Wow! Wow! Look at that. Proof in the pudding. Proof is in the pudding. Microfiber. Microfiber. Yo. Only took like twelve takes for the egg to bounce. They actually feel like you're walking on a cloud. <laughs> well, actually, you'd fall cloud. right through right. a fucking cloud, wouldn't you, you dumb bitch? <laughs> I'm walking through a cloud. Yeah. How would you know what walking on a cloud is like? Because you can walk you on they're, pay, they're just paid shills. They're paid shills. Yeah. They're not. Look, it says right there, not actors, people with... No, no, no. No, no, no. Inside, it's they're phenomenal. just average people These they paid. They're, not, they're just not oh. professional Where actors. That's all that means. Love them. These are fabulous. Your feet Let's see if we... Says we're reconnecting. Did they see uh, the on. price? Um, we'll see. All right, so I believe we're back now. Oh. Okay. Price was nineteen ninety nine. Scotty. In looked. case anyone missed it, the I price was nineteen ninety nine. Scotty Scott, looked. I, I did not look. I won as oh, well, I. and I I went further than Scotty and told you guys there would be some kind of addendum bullshit too. Yeah, so TJ looked. So I was actually even more right than Scotty was. Oh no, you fucking weren't. Oh, yeah, I was. Wait, wait, look at the bottom of this miracle foot cream. It says copyright Scotty Cena Enterprises. Whoa. Wow. Let's move, move on. on. You got insider on. Smoking gun Scotty. there. Let's move on from this. This is this is a it's been uh, altered by Paul's ego. <laughs> All right. Uh, Snackies duo. Okay. Snackies. Eat it, Snackies. And the 2015 product of the year is Snackies. The two <laughs> 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 what? No. Uh, look, look how t uh, voted number one kids novelty product, and there's a bunch of fucking like size seven font or size six font. Yeah, or I can't read. What does that say? Consumer Survey of, of product, product Innovation. Innovation. Sounds like some sh organization they made yeah, up. Yeah, that's some shit they made up. Snack and drink up, and it just got better. Introducing Snackies Duo. It's everything what? you love about what Snackies, but now lightweight and recyclable. Snackies Sweet. Duo is party ready and perfect for your crowd. Snackies Duo. So it's disposable Snackies, right? Is that what this is? Yeah, yeah I'm guessing, yeah. Oh. Snackies, dude. This is the best product would, of 2015. I would, say, heard of it. I would say, like, for kids, it's probably, even, like, shut up, you little asshole, and drink this, and, you know. I don't even know what it is. What <laughs> yeah, is it? Yeah, what is it? It's a cup that has an above chamber that allows you to have, like, snacks up, up above. Oh, my God. Who's in a convenient <laughs> Ask them out at a birthday party. The big game. Sleepovers. Barbecues. So you see, it's a. We cup. had self-lacing Nikes in Back to the Future uh, too. But we have cups with bowls. Yeah, yeah cups. we have snackies. A cup with a bowl for a hat. We had flying yep. cars. We had holograms. It's just funny snackies how people buy the most <laughs> worthless fucking products imaginable. It's like fourteen ninety five. Fourteen ninety five. Ah. Uh, uh, oh, fuck. Ten dollars. Ten even. Nine ninety nine. 
six ounces of your favorite snack in one container. No more juggling cups and plates. When the party's over, Snackies Duo can be reused or discarded responsibly. Personalize Snackies Duo so no one sneaks your snacks. You can uh, call or go yeah. online to get your Snackies Duos today. You get Killed 10 multicolored Snackies Duos in a pack. I'm That's fall. 10 cups, Should 10 fall little snack bowls, and 10... The Kirk Brothers looked, dude. Yeah. You guys man. own this shit, don't you? Not available TJ's, in TJ's over there eating Skittles out of his Snackies below the table. Well, Have we done the toucan uh, can opener? Uh, I feel like maybe. Yeah. Uh, that one does sound possible. How about the Micro Touch Tough Blade? I don't think no, so. That sounds think pretty so. good. Ever wonder why big razor companies keep raising their prices? Because yeah. they know if you want a great shave, there's nothing you can do about it. There's got to be a better Hi, way. I'm Brett Farr, and I Brett found a way to get <laughs> Whoa, okay. I'm sold now. I trust whatever this man this is This is selling. a breakthrough in shaving, finally. Brett fucking Farr. an entire year for under 20 bucks. Sweet. Check it out. Introducing the all-new Microtouch Tough Blade, the German-engineered razor guaranteed to give oh, you the... Oh, okay. It's, it's German. made in Germany. Oh, yes. You know the shit made in Germany is better. You know the quality of our shaving blades. <laughs> Close, clean, comfortable shave you want at a price that can't be beat. With other razor blades, I was spending 20, 30 bucks a month. But with Tough Blade, I spent $20 for the entire year. Okay, so we already know. Wow, $20 a year? God. Pretty reasonable price. How much does it cost? $20 a year. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, I guess that's true. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> How much does it cost? Well, I mean, <laughs> I mean, does it just last a year? Is it multiple blades? I don't know. I don't it's know. 20 bucks, dude. Fine. $20. <laughs> Shut up, Ben. You what does it cost? Piece of shit. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's pretty dumb. You're fucking stupid. No more All right. For TJ. Th this next one's called Be Quiet. So embarrassing. <laughs> Be Quiet. <laughs> That's what so you need what to do, do Ben. Hardcore snorers really sound like. <laughs> if you're not a hardcore snorer, if you don't hardcore swallow snorer, right, I'll you tell slumber, you what. There's some emo shit like, dude, fucking you hardcore snore? Our stepdad, Scotty, snores. Oh yeah, he does. Fifty thousand times louder than any fucking person in this commercial. Uh, it's way crazier. I couldn't even do an impression of it. I'd literally have to scream at the top of my lungs. You can hear them across the entire house. It vibrates the fucking like, house. Like, doors can be closed. Doesn't matter. You fucking hear it just reverberating through Is the house. Is it, like, very bassy? Yes. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's... Yeah, that's why you can hear it anyway. Like that, but about twice as loud. Wow. I feel so sorry for my mom. That's why her mind is slowly slipping away from her. Don't watch this commercial. Instead of her shaking, kicking, and begging you to be quiet, now you can. Introducing Be uh, Quiet, the safe, effective way to sleep the night. <laughs> <laughs> Do you never want to get laid again? It's a jock strap for your I mean, face. How would that even be comfortable? It's like strapping something tight to your face. You're just going to go to sleep. It's like, what? <laughs> Wow. It looks, it looks like so uncomfortable. It looks like he's putting fucking thong underwear <laughs> on his head. When worn at night, Be Quiet <laughs> helps reduce the snore so you can sleep more. Be Quiet definitely helped us get a peaceful night's rest. He was quiet. I got to sleep easy. You know what they say, happy wife, happy life? Well, since I've been trying to be quiet, I don't snore anymore. And I'm a happy wife. Come to think of it, you did make I am happy. Yeah, I did. Be Quiet will help you experience oh, increased God. intimacy, promote family harmony. Increased and intimacy? <laughs> They're really fucking There's telling There's no like, fucking way that thing will increase intimacy. No, like, no, dude, those, those guys have been getting laid more, and they get breakfast in fucking bed because they wear this ridiculous head strap. Your girlfriend will never fuck you again if she sees you wearing that. No, she'll ask him to wear it while he's fucking She you. might have sex with you, but you're never getting fucked again. Oh, fuck me, jockstrap face. Yeah. <laughs> Cut a hole in it, put a dildo through it. Maybe you can get one of those weird mouth dealies where she fucking straddles your face. <laughs> Importantly, help you develop a healthy lifestyle. Look, open mouth breathing uh, equals hardcore snoring and acts like a sound I think it was amplifier that keeps the whole family awake. But Be Quiet's anti snore chin strap brings your jaw forward, keeps your mouth closed, and promotes better breathing, turning the noise down so everybody can sleep sound. A good night's sleep is important to your good health. Be quiet. 
can help you breathe easier, snore less, and get a good night's sleep. Sleeping is Need important. A comfort Flex fabric. <laughs> Be quiet is lightweight, breathable, and a pleasure to wear. Plus, <laughs> Plus it's a pleasure to wear. Yeah, yeah, I'm happy, happy to wear this. Just nodding at each other. The nod. Not a yes. I just put on my jock strap. <laughs> Wow. I look ridiculous now. Dude, I'm buying this for TJ. <laughs> oh, it won't dent your face. Be quiet, fit snugly, yet comfortably. You oh. won't even know it's there. Stop you won't even know it's there. What? You're sure. not going to know it's Let there. Be Come quiet on. Give you a peaceful night's sleep. So You're not going to know there's some ridiculous blue this special jock TV strap on your fucking You can head. get your be quiet anti snoring chin strap for just $10. I was like, everyone really goes to sleep no smiling. Way, but $10. What if be quiet does I'm so happy I'm going to sleep. And he's getting laid more because he's not snoring. For a full refund, we'll even <clears throat> refund your processing and handling. But to make this deal really quiet, we'll send you a second oh, wait, wait, for an additional it. fee. That's. Oh well, never mind. It, it already said ten dollars. I was like, maybe we can guess. Two but... Be quiet for one low we price. Did guess. Color, log on at trybequiet.com. I never remember guessing for this one. You didn't. You were just sitting there silently. You missed your chance. Missed your chance, bitch. Really? Fuck. Get with the program. Me and Paul guessed nine ninety nine, and Ben guessed fourteen ninety nine. TJ and I win. We were closer. Bum, bum, ba, ba, bum, 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 bum. All right. Shows where my more. fucking mind is. I don't know what this is. Uh, now nah, I'm just gonna do this one. Just play it. This. Fuck it. Okay. This is. It says. Roll the dice. Ice ball press kit. Do it. What? The Cirrus ice press turns ice cubes into ice spheres. Not only are the spheres. Oh my god, that's so but useful. The process is so dramatic. Dramatic. To get started, what? I'm going to remove the top. How? Hold on, Scotty. And the press Give it a chance. Three molds. So first, make a block of ice. Make a block of ice. That's the beginning step. Put one on top. Put the lid back on. Okay. And then let the magic happen. Let it happen. You want to make sure to make the spheres on the tray that comes with the kit. The kit was 100% designed and manufactured in the United States. Wow, cool. And the cool. special anodized aluminum. I'm glad we can still who, who make needs something, this? man. Yeah. Who fucking needs this? Like, where is the demand for this product? Like, uh, first you need to take a block of ice. And, and they say U.S. manufacturing and, is dead. And they're going to make it into a, a sphere. Like, um, w what good is it's that? It's great at parties and shit, Scotty. People yeah. say, damn, you got some ice spheres here. You, you, you don't deny, Scotty, that you wouldn't be impressed if you came to visit me and I gave you like a <laughs> like a snifter of scotch the spherical shape with a sphere ice, ice in it. Drink. And in fact, yes, I would wonder why you wasted so much time with such a scotch. fucking pointless gesture. Exactly and you know this thing is ridiculously expensive, too. She, oh, yeah. She uh, just mentioned whiskey and scotch. I bet she did. Well, that's what they do with this. Like, high-end like bars and shit will serve their fucking yes. scotch. I've like had a, them serve that to yeah. me. Almost ready yeah, that is to true. The sphere. <laughs> it's just pretentious garbage. I'm going to remove the lid by pulling straight up. And look at that. Wow. To help release the sphere, I'm going to turn this knob. It's beautiful. Release right the front, sphere. And then use the Have you ever seen coming. such beauty? Just one big ice ball. Yeah. Prices, people. The kit. Do you think they'll even say a price in this? Mm, I don't uh, know. I'm, I'm thinking like uh, 50, uh, 49 dollars No. 75 It's going to be something crazy. $99. I'm going to say $89. $149.99. Wow. No, no. They're probably not going to say. 75 There you go. Now you got your scotch on the rocks. Yeah. Well, oh, great. <laughs> All right, I got to look it up. It's William Sonoma. Ice ball maker. Ice ball press kit. Yeah. William Sonoma ice ball press kit. All right. Kit. This next one is brow. Per it's called brow perfect. So I imagine it's for like perfect eyebrows. You know, people pluck the shit out of their eyebrows and fuck them up. So now brow perfect will help them. I hope we get a lot of reaction shots of people hurting themselves trying to pluck their eyebrows the old fashioned way. You know, I can find ice ball Shaping press kits and I can find William Sonoma shit. Oh. Tweezing, waxing and threading, all that Oh, there's got stuff? to be a better That's way. Enough. Hi. I'm Laura Baker, here to show you the fast, easy, pain-free way to shape your brows without the owl. It's called Brow Perfect. Jesus. Just oh my look God, it looks like a weapon from yeah. a prison. It's a, looks like like, a, it's a fucking makeshift a shank. Yeah, a prison shank. Beautiful shape that was so easy to create. Simply hold Brow Perfect at a 45-degree angle to gently remove hair instantly and easily. 
Okay, ladies, I want to know what holding you brow think. perfect this at any perfect angle other than 40 to 5 so degrees easy. may result in severe skin damage. Yes. Uh, just so you guys know, I cannot find this that William Sonoma. Oh, oh shit, I was right. Anyway. Um, 50 by the way, oh, shit. Uh, 95% of the votes are in for the Democrats. Sanders is still 49 to 50. Wow. <laughs> it's, it, 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 when it's that close, though, they're going to go all the way down until 100% of the vote is in. Yep. Unless she just really pulls ahead. Yeah. Yeah, it's not happening right now. We might not even hear like a, like a full result tonight. Maybe not. I even, mean, even if she does win, it's like by a cunt hair, so it really doesn't matter that much. Yeah, I don't know if the winner takes all or if they divide them, you know, 50-50. I think they, the state only has, like, a few delegates anyway. So it's probably winner take all. If they it win. probably is. Yeah. And this is weird because it's a caucus. It's not a primary like, <sighs> like they would have here where people just go and vote. Caucus. Cock. Yeah. Caucus. <laughs> he said caucus. <laughs> caucus. <laughs> All right. Brow perfect. Yeah. Uh, I'm going uh, for the prison shank. I'm going um, 1999. Mm. I didn't really 1495. See, I didn't really see much of it, so I'm going <coughs> to play some more. 1495. What makes Brow perfect so special is that it's not a ra That little piece of shit, uh, they're probably trying to get 999 for it. 1495. 1495. 1995. 1995. 1995. I'm going 1495, bitch. Jesus. But a man. hair removal tool. Wait, they're selling it to women, though. Hmm. That is true. Probably 14. You're, you're probably right about that. Designed to remove unruly hairs and those fine light hairs you can't see pain free. Brow Perfect is so safe <coughs> and gentle, if it you won't can't even see pop them, the thing. Why do you remove it? They always do this balloon test. Safe and gentle. This balloon. Let Brow Perfect beautifully remove peach fuzz from the side of your face, around your chin and upper lip, leaving your skin silky smooth. You'll fall in love with Brow Perfect because it takes off hair in an instant. Even use Brow Perfect to clean up your man's neck, beard, and ears without fear. With Brow Perfect, hair grows back like before, not thicker, not anymore. Turn that ow into a wow. I can't believe there's people that literally obsess that much about like... I've got little tiny hairs out of place that no one will ever notice or see. Yeah. They even said, like, you know those little invisible hairs that you they're get invisible. around your temples? You can you can take those off, too. Well, they're fucking invisible. Paul, they know they're there, though. It's just the knowledge of them being there. Trepidation, anxiety. Come on. With Brow Perfect. During the special TV introduction, we'll send you not one, $10. but two Brow Perfect Shaping Tools stuck with my original. and the Perfect Look Aww. Shaping Guide for just $10. Keep one in your purse or in the car for quick touch-ups wherever you are. But to make this the most perfect offer on TV, we're going to double everything free. Just pay, separate wow. processing and handling. Oh. As so there, you get like four of these little cheap pieces of shit for 10 bucks. Yeah, but you got to pay separate processing and handling for each one. Which is like six bucks. Which, which, yeah, which makes me the winner. No.